The views expressed are not necessarily the views of the management of the street. 919 FM. Pastor Hannah A. Pabu of Holy Spirit Ministries will be live on the street 919 FM every Wednesday from 11.15 a.m. to 11.45 a.m. In the scripture, Matthew 19, verse 26, the Bible says, But Jesus looked at them and said to them, With men, this is impossible, but with God, all things are possible. Pastor Hannah is here to motivate you, challenge you, encourage you, to walk in your purpose and destiny God has for you. For prayer and counseling, call Pastor Hannah at 728-5197. God, hallelujah! I'm Pastor Hannah, and I am here to motivate you, challenge you, encourage you to walk in your purpose to walk in your destiny wow this is the day the lord has made let us rejoice let us be glad in it hallelujah i'm so excited because god is doing great things hallelujah if we look a little closer hallelujah and look beyond a lot of things that we are seeing we will be able to see that god is truly doing great things because sometimes we can be only focused on what we are seeing but we must focus on what we know we know that he is doing great things we know that he is impacting our lives hallelujah for the better we know that great things are taking place amen because he gave us his word he gave us the prophetic word he gave us his word he gave us the rhema word and the logos word come on somebody somebody say amen so based on what god says hallelujah we rejoice we are glad in this day amen it is not based on circumstances that we are seeing in front of us amen it is not based on the things that we are seeing we rejoice based on what god says every morning i get up i'm rejoicing i'm happy i've got my journal hallelujah and i i walk around praise god and i'm thanking god hallelujah for everything that he says about me come on somebody write the vision make it plain and i get my vision out and I'm praising God, hallelujah. Glory be to God. And I'm getting excited, hallelujah, praise God. I do this every morning. And I get excited about what God says, hallelujah. Woo! I had a, a, a Red Sea parting experience this morning with God. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. So you're not rejoicing based on the, the circumstances, hallelujah. Because if you look at the circumstances, you see your praise go kind of, it will kind of, how you say it, go ho high one minute, low next minute, high, what, yeah, you'll have a, a valley mountain experience, hallelujah. One minute you're good, one minute you, you know, but if your praise, hallelujah, when I get up every morning, hallelujah, my praise is based on what God says about me, come on somebody, what he says, hallelujah, he's spoken in my ear, hallelujah, the vision he gave me to write, and his word come on somebody it's all his word his rhema and his logos to me so i rejoice i write it down i have my scriptures so forth and i'm rejoicing i'm happy i'm praising god i'm praying and praising according to the scripture i'm being specific you have to be specific because you can't walk around praise god hallelujah Woo, thank you jesus it sounds really good but what are you thanking him for what are you praising him for you gotta be specific hallelujah praise god i thank you lord i'm an excellent trader come on somebody i praise you oh god i'm a wise person Woo, praise the lord i thank you jesus i am the head and not the tail Woo. So you got to be specific when you're praying, when you're praising God. Hallelujah. Yes, I do this every morning. <laughs> Praise God. <laughs> Hallelujah. God first. You talk to God. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. For faith is acknowledging that God exists. Hallelujah. And then believing. Hallelujah. And acknowledging. Hallelujah. That he is a rewarder of those that diligently seek him hallelujah praise the lord okay genesis chapter 2 hallelujah praise god if i would if i would call it a title to this today i would say it's called you don't have to partake of the fruit come on somebody 
you don't have to partake of the fruit. When God created heaven and earth and Adam and Eve, hallelujah, everything was wonderful. Everything was, was, was perfect. Come on, somebody. Everything was beautiful. Hallelujah. It was awesome. I mean, when Adam looked at Eve, he was, whoa, man. Hallelujah. <laughs> it was awesome. Praise God. I, I don't want to read. Okay, I'll, I'll read from verse 18. Praise the Lord. And the Lord God said, It is not good that man should be alone. I will make him and help me for him. And out of the ground the Lord God formed every beast of the field and every fowl of the air and brought them unto Adam to see what he would call them. And whatsoever Adam called every living creature, that was the name thereof. And Adam gave names to all cattle and to the fowl of the air and to every beast of the field. But for Adam there was not found and help meet for him. And the Lord God caused a deep sleep to fall upon Adam and he slept and he took one of his ribs and closed up the flesh instead thereof. Hallelujah. And the rib which the Lord God had taken from man made he a woman and brought her unto the man. And Adam said, This is now bone of my bones and flesh of my flesh. She shall be called woman because she was taken out of man. Therefore shall a man leave his father and mother and shall cleave unto his wife and they shall be one flesh. And they were both naked and the man and his wife and they were not ashamed. Praise God. So let's go to chapter 3, verse 1. Now the serpent was more subtle than any beast of the field which the Lord God had made. And he said unto the woman, Yea, hath God said, Ye shall not eat of every tree of the garden. And the woman said unto the serpent, We may eat of the fruit of the trees of the garden, but of the fruit of the tree which is in the midst of the garden, God hath said, Ye shall not eat of it. Neither shall ye touch it, lest ye die. And the serpent said unto the woman, Ye shall not surely die. For God did know that in the day ye eat thereof, then your eyes shall be open, and ye shall be as God's knowing good and evil now i just want to show you what what the enemy said and tell me if this sounds familiar to you what he is saying according to eve god said don't eat the fruit don't touch it that's trouble so if the fruit is trouble you will die it will kill you it's not good for you it's not healthy you will die but what the serpent is telling the woman no nah, you see, something good will come out of this bad thing, you know. So, if you eat the fruit now, things will change for the better. You know, does that sound familiar? You shall not surely die, you know. For God did know that in the day you eat thereof, then your eyes shall be opened. So, something good will come out of this bad thing. In other words, does that sound familiar? That's, that's the enemy's philosophy. <laughs> something good will come out of something bad. Have you ever heard somebody try to tell you that? I've heard people try to tell me that. <laughs> I've heard people try to tell me that. Amen? While trying to reason with me. Praise God. So, ye shall not surely die. Meaning, nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with eating the fruit. If you eat it, something good will happen. Yes, it's bad. He said, yeah, but you see, God knows that something good will happen. And when the woman, so then, okay, wait, wait, let me back up. So ye shall not surely die, for God did know that in a day ye eat thereof, then your eyes shall be open, and ye shall be as God's, knowing good and evil. Hallelujah. So he said, ha, ha. It's good to know everything. <laughs> Have you ever heard somebody say that? It's good to know everything. It's good to know a little bit of this and a little bit of that. You have to know a little good and a little bad and a little... You have to be exposed to this and you have to be exposed to that to understand life. <laughs> Have you ever heard that? A lot of people are exposed to a lot of things, but unfortunately it didn't turn out too good for them as we all know when we read the newspapers all right so this was the enemy's philosophy that you had to dabble a little bit in order to experience good you know you have to do something bad in order to get a good experience you have to do something wrong that god said not to do 
in order to have a good life. <laughs> okay, does that sound familiar? Does that sound familiar? And a lot of people do the same thing that is said right here, and people are still advising people to do the same thing, you know. And you clearly see it does not work. And they're still advising people to do the same thing, and people are still doing the same thing. Amen? You don't need something good to have uh, something bad to have something good. Amen? Hallelujah. And when the woman saw, so this, this advice from the serpent, this, this advice that, you know, don't worry, you wouldn't lose anything. You will still have all this wonderful garden and everything. You ain't going to lose nothing. You will still have God and whatever the case is. You know, you're just going to be like God. You know, this is what you need to be like God. You need to do this to be like God. This is what you need to walk in more righteousness. And the woman saw that the tree was good. And we know what happened. She ended up partaking of the tree. And everything that the serpent tell her, well, it had some lies to it. <laughs> there were some impurities in it. Yes, she knew more things, but she knew things that she should not have known there are some things in life we don't need to know amen because what comes in your air and your eye gate will affect your life you don't need to partake of the fruit to be like god you don't need to partake of the fruit to have a good testimony amen i've heard people tell me well you know pastor hannah you need to have you need to go to some good trouble you know they take the scripture and they tell me this you need to you need to um it's only somebody who you know was real bad and they will have a powerful testimony only somebody who really you know they, 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 they sin so much they will have a powerful testimony so you see does that sound familiar you know if god wanted if that was true then god would make some real sinners in the garden you know, because you see, it takes a lot of sin to be able to love God. You know? It takes a lot of sin that need to make some real sinners in the garden. He, he, and as a matter of fact, he wouldn't even have sent Jesus Christ. As a matter of fact, if he wanted that, amen, he wouldn't ask us to repent of our sin. Amen? So you don't have to eat of the fruit. And that fruit represents, that fruit can represent things that you don't need in your life. You may not need certain people in your life. You may not need certain foods in your life. You may not need certain type of music in your life or words. Because it depends on the words that you're listening to. Amen. You may not need certain movies in your life. Hallelujah, to be like God, to be like Jesus, to walk this Christian life. Hallelujah, if you're desirous of serving God and being on the right path, you, you may not need that fruit to, to walk the right road. Hallelujah, the Bible says the just shall live by faith. Hallelujah, you don't have to go through something bad to develop good character because the bible says the just the fair-minded hallelujah the just mind come on somebody shall live by faith and walking by faith means you just do it you just do it in spite of the statistics that the philosophies in spite of what hallelujah people are taught in spite of what we are taught growing up you just do it because God says so, hallelujah. He just created a garden. He just said, let there be light, and there was. He just made man. He just made a woman. Come on, somebody. You just do it. Hallelujah. That's what you need to be like Jesus. Just do it. He just walked on the water. Why don't you just walk on the water? Why do you believe, hallelujah, that you have to go through a storm first and then walk on the water? Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. You don't have to go through 
through something bad for something good to come up. Come on, somebody. Yes, somebody literally said that to me one day on the phone, you know. Well, I, 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 and they were trying to be positive, I must say. <laughs> and, I, and I was like, no, 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 no. So that, that, no, 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 no. You have to go through something bad. Something, what, what is, was saying something, um, um, things had to get bad first before it could get good. <laughs> it's kind of funny. <laughs> the garden, the, the Adam and Eve, I mean, the, the serpent said the same thing. He was like, things have to get bad for them to get good. You have to eat of the fruit and disobey God blatantly. Hallelujah for you to be like God. <laughs> you know, and I was like, no, 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 they don't have to. Amen. You say that based on your experience, based on what you hear on the news, based on other people's experience. That's what we, that is things that we grew up here and it sounds, it sounds, you know, uh, cliche and it sounds, it makes a little sense, you know, but it, it doesn't make God. He said the just shall live by, there are a lot of things we say. Amen. There are a lot of things we are accustomed to saying. It, it, it's not Bible. It's, it's not it's not what Jesus would say. It's not what God agrees with. You know, because if we look at the way God thinks, uh, and we look at the way he has dealt with people, amen, we know that that is not something he would agree with, obviously. He said, well, you know, when you're bringing a gift to God, bring a good gift. Don't bring the worst thing. Amen? That's how God thinks. We know that. So, amen? You don't have to bring something bad in order to develop into something good. Praise God. So how about just obeying God in everything, amen, and fully depending on his guidance to develop your character, to learn, to win, and to know what to do. That is why he sent the Holy Spirit for us, amen, so that if we need what the Bible says in James, if you need some wisdom, ask of God, amen. So just if we obey God and we follow his direction, that, that is what if we look at the Bible and throughout history, we'll see that that is one thing God wanted people to do. Just do as I say. Just do as I say. Do as I show you. That is what he has tried to teach humanity. Do as I say and you will be okay. Amen. So let's just obey God. Let's follow his guidance because he said the just shall live by faith. Faith. You exercise your faith and exercising your faith will show that you believe what God say. Hallelujah. And you know, you may not have the garden like Adam and Eve. Amen. They had a perfect place. They had a reason to be perfect. Praise God. But you know what we have? Praise God that we can look to. We have the cross of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. So we don't need to eat of the fruit. We can look to the cross. Hallelujah. Anytime we feel like we need some guidance. Hallelujah. We don't have to look to serpent advice. Come on, somebody. We can look to the cross. We have that relationship and we can say, Holy Ghost, help me. Father God, help me. Hallelujah. Show me what to do. Hallelujah. There may be times when, you know, you look for the serpent advice. And you take it. Hallelujah. You repent and you say, God, show me your way. Show me your way. Hallelujah. Because I messed up. Show me your way. Guide me. Lead me. Praise God. Hallelujah. Let us walk by faith. That word, that word just. Yasher means straight, upright, right, righteousness, just. Hallelujah. The just shall live by their faith. The just Hallelujah, the fair-minded, in English, fair, praise God, based on behavior according to what is morally right and fair. Praise God, hallelujah. Our behavior, hallelujah, our words must be based on what is right, based on God's word. As believers, we must base our behavior. If Eve had based her behavior on what God said and said, no, no. Hallelujah. We're going to be like God because we know God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. We don't need to eat of the fruit. If she had based her action on what God said instead of listening to the serpent, 
Hallelujah. And guess what? You may have listened to the serpent in the past, but I tell you from today, hallelujah, because God, we are in a time of grace. And from today, you can base your actions, your words. And, and you know, we know it's a process. Amen. But you got to start that process. It is a process. Hallelujah. And we help one another. Amen. We help one another. Praise God. You help your brother. Help your sister. Hallelujah. Keep that process going. Amen. We have to help each other. Don't go to the serpents. Hallelujah. Don't go to the serpents for advice. Come on, somebody. You have to help each other and be transparent with each other and pull each other up. Hallelujah. And remind each other. Hallelujah. That we must base what we do on what God says for us. Amen. Your life may not be written. Hallelujah. Details of your life may not be written in the word of God. Hallelujah. But it is written in your relationship with God. Hallelujah. If you ask God, show me. Hallelujah. What my life contains. And God will show you. Amen. God will show you. One day I asked God and God told me begin to write. And I wrote my vision. Hallelujah. And it's plain as day. And every morning, every morning I tell you, I'm worshiping God. Hallelujah. I'm writing my vision. Praise God. I'm in my vision every day. Yeah, hallelujah. And that is why I'm on top all the time. And I'm focused. I'm in my vision every day. Praise God. Hallelujah. I don't turn from the left or the right of my vision. I'm in my vision every day. I'm worshiping God every day for my life. Because I've got it written down. i got my entire life written down in a book. Praise God. Hallelujah. No, I'm not going to read it out for you. Woo! Jesus. <laughs> so, hallelujah. So, obey God. Because guess what? He'll do it again for you. He'll do it again. Just take a look at where you are now and where you have been. Hasn't he always come true for you? He's the same now as then. You may not know how, you may not know when, but you do it again. Sometimes, you see, you don't, you don't have to know how. You don't have to know how everything is going to happen. Amen? You're going to know how, you know. But hallelujah, initially, you may not know how. Hallelujah. You may not know how you're going to meet that spouse. You may not know how you're going to start that business. Hallelujah. But you know it's going to happen. And that's what you're praising God for. You know it's going to happen. The how will be revealed to you. But you don't got to figure that out. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. You just base your action on the word of God and keep going forward. Hallelujah. You, you may not know how the business is going to continue in this pandemic. Hallelujah. But God told you, open the business. Walk by faith. Open the business. Hallelujah. Do what you have to do. Base your action. Base your words. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm the head and not the tail. I'm prosperous. Everything I put my hand to do, it prospers. Come on, somebody. See, you got to speak it based. It must be fair-minded. You must be. It must be based on what is morally right and fair. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. So you base your words on... God's word. Come on, somebody. I'm prospering. So you're not praising God and you're not confessing based on your present situation, whether it be good or bad. That's not what you're looking at. Hallelujah. You are looking at what God is saying. So you see your prayer and your worship will be constant. You ever see believers one minute, they're up, one minute, they're down. Hallelujah. One minute, they're praising God. Next minute, they're different. Hallelujah. No, it's got to be consistent. Hallelujah. There's got to be a consistent flow. you got to flow the same way. Praise the same way. Have you ever seen ministers praise God all the time the same way? Pray God. Pray all the same way. Preach the same way. And you never know what is going on in their life behind the scene. Well, that's how you have to go. You praise God no matter what. Because it's based on, your, on the word of God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And you see, you do that first thing. You gear yourself up in the morning. Dress yourself in the vision that God has for you when you wake up every morning. Praise God. You don't know. You don't need to know how. Amen. It will be revealed to you. However, you can look back and say like now. I can look back at some things. 
and say, thank God he didn't answer that. You didn't answer that prayer. Praise God. I was telling somebody what I prayed for one time, and I said, thank you. I was upset when the prayer wasn't answered. Then I said, thank you, Jesus. You didn't answer that prayer. You must really love me. Hallelujah. So when you're looking back at your life, now you're going to say, you know, he did it. He did it here. He did it there. Hallelujah. I wasn't sure if he was going to do it. I didn't know how he was going to do it, but he did it. So it's the same thing now. You don't know how it's going to happen, but it's going to happen. Because if God says it's going to happen, it's going to happen. Praise God. So you may be in a backslidden state right now. I don't know. Hallelujah. Maybe you want to have that joy in your life. You want to serve God more. Maybe you have not based your actions, your behavior. Hallelujah. You have not tried. Some people try. Some people have beliefs that are not based on what God says. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Uh, you may not know God. Hallelujah. I'm, I'm inviting you right now. Praise God to pray a prayer with me. Hallelujah. To accept the Lord Jesus into your heart as your Lord and Savior today. I tell you, I made that decision years ago at the age of 14. I tell you, I stand here today and I've never regretted that decision. That is one decision I've never regretted. I've regretted a lot of other decisions I've made. Hallelujah. And they did not stem from knowing God. Come on, somebody. <laughs> they did not stem from God. <laughs> Those decisions I regretted didn't stem from God. They didn't come from God. So I know God only leads me on the right path. Amen. Praise God. And I tell you, it's a decision I've never regretted. I want you to pray this prayer with me right now. Hallelujah. Father God, I come to you just as I am. Father God, hallelujah. I'm sorry for my sins. Hallelujah. I ask your forgiveness and I receive it right now. I thank you for what Jesus Christ has done on the cross for me. Jesus, I ask you to come into my heart right now. Make me the person that you want me to be. Wash away every sin, every wrinkle. Hallelujah. Right now in Jesus' name, I give you praise. Holy Ghost, fill me and saturate me in your presence right now in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. I give you praise, Lord. I give you praise. Hallelujah. I give you praise. Thank you, Lord, for those out there. Hallelujah. That have accepted you. I give you praise for that person that has accepted you right now. Hallelujah. I give you praise for that life that is being changed right now. Hallelujah. I give you praise for that person who has been motivated right now. Hallelujah. I give you praise, Lord, for that life that's being impacted for you right now in the name of Jesus. I give you praise, Father God, for stirring up that fire in that person's heart for you, O God, once more. Hallelujah. I give you praise, Father God, for restoring the joy of your salvation right now hallelujah I give god praise for jo restoring the joy of your salvation i'm seeing someone i give god praise right now he's restoring the joy of your salvation right now receive it in the name of jesus receive it in the name of jesus take it run with it hallelujah by faith it's all by faith father god i give you praise i see somebody's hands up in the air i give you praise i touch your hands in the name of jesus take it by faith take it by faith hallelujah Take it. Yes, that's the Holy Ghost. Take it by faith. Everything that you put your hand to do prospers in the name of Jesus. Take it by faith. I see you. I see you. I see you. Praise God. Hallelujah. Everything that you put your hand to do, it prospers in Jesus' name. Take it by faith. Hallelujah. I see you. I see you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father God, for that person. Hallelujah. That is being saturated right now by the fire of the Holy Ghost. Fire of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Receive it. Receive it in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. The presence of God is all upon you right now. In the name of Jesus, I give you praise, Lord. I give you praise. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Call me. Give me, uh, let me know what God is doing in your life. Hallelujah. I hear so many wonderful testimonies. Call me. Let me know what God is doing in your life through this program. Praise God. Call me at 728-5197 or message me. 728-5197. If you want to learn to trade on the Forex market, call me. Hallelujah. I have, I'm a part of a wonderful school. Hallelujah. You want to invest in crypto? Praise God. You want to learn how to do that in the school? Call me. 728-5197. You want some Herbalife products? Call me. God bless you. Have the best day of your life. Praise God. Hallelujah. That you are faced with circumstances that you cannot get through. Holy 
Spirit Ministries will be live on the street 919 FM every Wednesday from 11.15 a.m. to 11.45 a.m. In the scripture, Matthew 19, verse 26, the Bible says, But Jesus looked at them and said to them, With men, this is impossible, but with God, all things are possible. Pastor Hannah is here to motivate you, challenge you, encourage you to walk in your purpose and destiny God has for you. For prayer and counseling, call Pastor Hannah at 728-5197. The views expressed are not necessarily the views of the management of the street. 919 FM.
Simpsons Memorial Limited. Number 63 Eastern Main Road, Laventille. Internationally accredited funeral directors and embalmers. A full service funeral home serving families of Trinidad and Tobago and internationally since 1945. At Simpsons Memorial Limited, we serve with dignity in assisting families in honoring the memory of their loved ones. Our services include professional funeral and pre-planning, burials and cremation, custom-built and imported caskets, conference and cremation trains, cemetery management, limousines, mourners' cars, grief counseling, web streaming of funerals, fully air-conditioned chapel with live musical accompaniment, full global shipping and receiving of loved ones. We specialize in facial restorations. Call us anytime, day or night, at 623-8688. That number again is 623 623- 8688 Simpsons Memorial Limited. Superior service always with excellence. Take me to the king. I don't have much to bring. There's a new taste in town. Maracas Bake and Shark at 79 Robert Street in Woodbrook brings you Bake and Shark, Kingfish, Fries, Shrimp, Alu Pies, and delectable sauces to tease your taste buds. Walk in, order with Food Drop, or get Parking Lot Pickup at 488-BAKE or 75-SHARK. Need catering? No problem. Call or email tastemaracas at gmail.com. Follow Taste Maracas on social media for all the delicious details. Taste Maracas, the new taste in town. Corner of Roberts and Rosalino Streets. See you soon. Yes, yes, Trinidad and Tobago. A musical showdown of medium and large steel bands from around the country will take place on Saturday, 26 February from 5 p.m. Center stage at the Safe Zone Carnival City, Queens Park, Savannah. Pantrin Vago, in collaboration with the NCC, presents a pan event musical showdown in the Big Yard. Big Yard. See NCC's website or call the NCC office at 6221718 for grandstand and pawn group ticket details. This event is supported by Digicel and Angus Tura. Me say you wake up in the morning and you just realize Carnival come. What are you doing? Does that Monday? Yes, Carnival Monday, 3 p.m. Queens Park Savannah. People, you need vaccination of entry. Young brother, I'm gonna be there live in the live DJ to be coming to shell it down. In other words, steam it up. Yeah, does that you alone bounce on it like a trampoline? You, yeah, he's a benza. Shake it from a lay. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. So the ladies there, Carnival Monday, 3 p.m. KMS, TSP, and T dot sided alongside Iowa George presents the Carnival Combat. The Mosh Bra, the Mosh Bra, the Mosh Bra 2022 from the creative mind of Davlin Thomas. Deja vu echoes of Carnival coming, presenting the finalists for the first citizens, kings, and queens competition. Ten best of the best in Kaiso with guest performances including Bungie Garland, Nadia Batson, Iowa George, Lyrical, Swappy, Fama Nappy, Skinny Fabulous, Blacks, and much more. The magic happens on the big stage at Carnival City, Queens Park, Savannah, Sunday 27th at 7 p.m. Grandstand and Pod Posse tickets also available at NCC's head office and online at TicketGateway.com. For more information, contact the NCC at 622-1718. This event is supported by Digicel, Angostura, and TTT. Dimash Bra, Dimash Bra. Doctors Desmond and Angina Phillips present a series of healing retreats from February 27th to Sunday 6th March at the Eco Resort in Toko. This includes delicious healthy foods, refreshing healing drinks, learn DIY healing techniques, mini seminars and natural therapies. Price plans are for cost and full coverage excluding transport. Select plans one day from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. at $600. Monday, 28th February, Tuesday, 1st March, Wednesday, 2nd March, and Sunday, 6th March. One night, one day from 5 p.m. cost $1,100. Sunday, 27th February, Monday, 28th February, and Tuesday, 1st March, or two days, two nights from 5 p.m. That costs $2,100. 
Sunday 27th of February and Tuesday 1st March. For more information, reservations and bookings call 336-5441 or visit the website at www.npathlimited.com for online bookings. Empath for love and healing. Blessings in the wonderful name of Jesus. My name is Nikki Garcia, and you are invited to listen to the final hour broadcast every Monday from 12 midnight to 5 in the morning on the street 919 FM radio. Here, Pastor Helen Garcia and my husband, Pastor Valentine Garcia Jr., preach the word of God. We can be contacted at 629-0113 or 623-8444. Tune in and prepare to be blessed. As my life, I lit on the altar. As my life. Tune in to the Street 919 FM every Friday from 9.15 a.m. to 9.30 a.m. with Kingdom Health Services. Situated at number 125 Eastern Main Road in Tunapuna. For the program, Health and Healing. Merging the old with the new with Mr. Brent Diet. For more information, call 318-7471 or 4840141 or 360-4100. It's all about Kingdom Health Services on the street, 919 FM. Deals are at East Side Plaza, located at number 32 Shannon Street in Port of Spain. It's a sale on everything at all stores. Opening hours are from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. Everything from food stuff, lunches, pottery, African wear, Christmas gift items, tailor services, hair salon services, and so much more. Everything means everything. Head into Port of Spain and check out East Side Plaza at number 32 Charlotte Street. Join Pastor Kelvin Heinerein and friends for The Way, The Truth, The Life Radio Ministry, a Church of God ministry, live on the street 919 FM from 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. This and every Sunday on the street 919 FM. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh to the Father except through me. John chapter 14, verse 6. For further information, contact Six eight six three eight four five three four nine five one seven eight or three four two seven three zero three. Me say you wake up in the morning and you just realize Carnival come. What are you doing? Who does that? Monday, yes, Carnival Monday, three p.m. Queens Park, Savannah. People, you need vaccination of entry. Young brother, I'm going to be there live in a live DJ to be coming to shell it down. In other words, steam it up. Yeah, who does that? You alone, bounce on it like a trampoline. You, yeah, he's a benza. Shake it from my leg. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. Ladies, there's kind of a monthly champion. Hear this, TSP at T dot sided alongside Iowa George presents the Carnival Combat. Share the line. Share the line. The Street 919 FM on Facebook and Instagram. Share the line. Iowa George on Instagram. Share the line. Iowa TV and Street Street TV on YouTube. Share the line. The Street 919 FM. Broadcasting from Trinidad to the world. The Street 919 News from the street, 919FM.com. Here's what's happening. Good afternoon. I am Vanessa Thomas with the 4 o'clock news on the street, 919FM, and online Facebook and YouTube. In the headlines, security guard shot dead in San Fernando. Police kill bandits during spate of robberies in the San Juan area. Man killed while trying to cross highway. An international student had legs and fingers amputated after eating leftover Chinese takeout. And now the news in detail. A security guard was found shot to death in San Fernando. Police identified the deceased as Taquan Riquet. 
According to police, around 1.30 a.m. this morning, police received a report of a shooting in progress along the SS Aaron Road in the vicinity of Source Medical Associates. When officers arrived, they observed the body of Rickett lying on the roadway in a pool of blood. He appeared to have been shot multiple times. One bandit was shot and killed by police during a spate of robberies at Boundary Road, San Juan, on Tuesday. The dead man has been identified as 25-year-old Daniil Robinson of Darbadi. According to reports, officers of the Northeastern Division Task Force were called to the Reliable Appliances Parts and Services Store on Boundary Road at around 12.55 p.m. Tuesday. When the officers arrived, they saw several workers tied up on the floor of the warehouse. One of the workers signaled to the officers that the bandits were still upstairs. On reaching upstairs, police saw the bandits and called out to them to surrender. However, police reported that Robinson pointed a gun at them and they shot him. He was later taken to the Eric Williams Medical Sciences Complex in Mount Hope where he died. The other suspects were at large up to last yesterday evening. The police believe there were between 8 to 10 robbers at the scene with three vehicles. Meanwhile, a mini-mart belonging to radio announcer and DJ Marlon Mr. Music was robbed on Monday. CCTV footage released on social media showed two young men walking into the mini-mart located along the Arima Old Road opposite the George Boys Recreation Grounds in broad daylight around 1.20 p.m. One of the young men asked for and paid for a small bottle of water, and that is when his accomplice pulled out a gun and announced a holdup. However, the quick-thinking cashier behind the burglar-proofing counter managed to press the alarm button, prompting the alarm to go off, causing the bandits to hastily run out of the mini-mart. The bandits were later identified as young men from the Tunapuna and Valencia areas. They were taken to the Arima police station. A 45-year-old man was killed in a road traffic accident yesterday evening. The deceased has been identified as Vishwanath Dionorain of Basi Street, Valsane. Police said around 6.40 p.m., the man was reportedly crossing the Churchill Roosevelt Highway in the vicinity of Spring Village when he was struck by a vehicle while on the eastbound lane. The man reportedly was thrown several feet away and died at the scene. Internationally, a 19-year-old college student developed sepsis and lost his legs and fingers after eating leftover Chinese takeout food in what a doctor described as a perfect storm of events. Dr. Bernard Hisu described how the young man became severely ill after eating tainted leftovers, including lo mein, chicken and rice. The patient had been well until 20 hours before he ate the restaurant meal. However, after eating, he experienced abdominal pain and nausea. He was admitted to the Massachusetts General Hospital after developing sepsis and had to get parts of all fingers and his legs below his knees mm -hmm. amputated. A friend had eaten the same meal as the victim and vomited but did not become progressively sick, according to a report. To reduce the risk of food poisoning from bacteria, leftover food should be refrigerated no later than two hours after it is removed from a heat source. And that was the 12 o'clock news on the street, 919 FM and online Facebook and YouTube. Recapping the headlines, security guard shot dead in San Fernando. Police kill bandit during spate of robberies in the San Juan area. Man killed while trying to cross highway. An international student had legs and fingers amputated after eating leftover Chinese takeout. Do enjoy your afternoon and continue to be safe. I am Vanessa Tom. News from the street. News from the street. 919FM.com. And now we get inside a session for this. Me say you wake up in the morning and you just realize Carnival come What are you doing? Who does that? Monday. Yes, Carnival Monday. 3 p.m. Queen's Park Savannah. People, you need vaccination of entry. Young brother, I'm going to be there live in a live DJ. You be coming to shell it down. In other words, steam it up. Yeah. Who does that? You alone. 
bouncing it like a trampoline. Yo, yeah, he's a Benza. Shake it from my leg. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. So the ladies there, Carnival Monday, let's go. Kibis, the TSP, and the T Dub sided. Alongside Iowa George presents the Carnival Combat. Tickets for this one. Carnival Comeback 2022 at the Queen's Park Savannah. Come out with your team from 3 p.m. We're going to have ourselves a great time. This guy is definitely going to be there. Touching the stage, setting all souls on fire. I'm talking about KMC. This event is put on by Iowa George and TSB. Imagine yourself in the crowd when KMC singing this one line. It's gonna be an experience. It's definitely been too long. I don't want to hear about nobody business, boy. Security. How long you been waiting? Oh, the party, oh, the macadam. Oh, the macadam, oh, the party. I am gone for that. Talking about the poor business in fact. I am gone for that. Boy, move from here with your bad hat. I am gone for that. Talking about the poor business in fact. I am gone for that. Boy, move from here, give me a chance. Me and my little pussy. Come get up us a line. I'm talking up in my head, talking real all the time. Nobody wants you around here, yeah. your name on the list. Everybody in town know you for talking people business. You know all who hoarding, and all who broken. You know all who bogly, how much wrong they're buying. That girl head picky, it's a wig she wearing. Stop sitting up in the air, boy, I can't take the gossiping. I ain't come for that, talking about people business in fact.
wanna force me see. If you look around, it is plain to see. Everybody inside is set. Don't know that already, but we ain't come for that. Talking about people business and set. I ain't come for that. Who from here, boy, with your bad gun? I ain't come for that. Talking about people business and time. I ain't come for that. Who from here and give me a chance? I come to pick a little job. Pick a little job. Pick a little word. Not to stop me from business. Not to stop me from business. I come to pick a little job. Pick a little job. Pick a little word. Not to stop me from business. Boy, I ain't come for that. Imagine you pay your money to head into Carnival. Come back next week, Monday. And the people you choose to have a good time with, the only talking people business in the path. You definitely didn't come for that. Who else is on the rhythm? Swampy. And he's definitely going to be touching the stage for this one. Carnival Combat 2022 at the Queen's Park Savannah. Remember the action kicks off 3 p.m. at the Queen's Park Savannah. to this one on Carnival Monday. That's next Monday. Remember, male tickets 250, female tickets 220, and that's inclusive of food. You can also book your cabanas, $2,000, and uh, that accommodates groups of nine coolers and food inclusive, all right? Live performances by that guy in the background there. I'm talking about Swampy. Viking Ding Dong is also going to be touching the stage. KMC, Jaiga, Shal Marsha, and of course the boss himself. The boss, Neil I with George, is gonna be there. All the ladies, come out for this one. This is I with George, the big boss in the business. ready book your hairdresser book your nail tech because we coming out for this one from the beginning carnival comeback 2022 mashing up everything mashing up everything before you want to talk i give you what i got i know if you 
media walking into this event just so you know you had to show proof of vaccination and your id Natasha, Natasha is saying she's definitely feeling this one. Well, girl, go on out and get your tickets. Wrongs up your crew. Oh. What you feeling like? Yeah. Remember, this one yeah. is food inclusive. Yeah. Pack your coolers and come. Yeah. This coming Monday, 28th of February, is Carnival Monday. the drink, some rum from the morning now, I'll go flowing on my veins, party, calling on my name, and I'm feeling the Live. You can also get physical tickets, and I'm going to give you the information via the commercial after this one, all right? DJs passing through Travis World, DJ Kevin, Artist Steve, Trevlin, Selector Carrie, Papi, of course, DJ Andy, all those DJs passing through to give you a musical experience. And of course, performances by Swappy, KMC, Jai, Shaw Marshall, Ding Dong. And of course, the boss I with George, and you know when he touched these stages, a different kind of energies, a different kind of vibe.
Papa George and he's definitely gonna be performing in this one. Carnival Comeback 2022, Queen's Park Savannah, this coming Monday. the street 919 fm covid 19 updates in case you missed it the latest covid positive cases in tnt as of february 22nd 2022 stands at new positive cases 412 total active cases 20,830 total recovered patients 100,076 Total positive cases for COVID-19 as of March 2020 to present, 124,488. Follow the Ministry of Health COVID-19 protocols. Wear your mask, sanitize, 
social distance, and avoid gatherings. A message from The Street 919 FM. This is your Royal Castle Soca Shot on the Street 919 FM. What goes in is a local something that makes it all, that makes it all taste better. It's the flavor of our culture. Come from here, come from there, and everywhere. It's the special flavor that's made to savor at the Royal Castle. Oh, oh, come the Royal Castle. Royal Castle. Flavor to the bone. Royal Castle. It's the very own. Royal Castle is the local something that makes it all taste better. Taste the unique flavor of our culture at Royal Castle. I know stop. My parents' generation grew up with Royal Castle from the first restaurant in 1968 when that distinctive, tempting aroma hit the air. They just couldn't resist. And like never before, fried chicken with a special blend of local seasonings and a one of a kind flavor down to the bone. Today, Royal Castle still have that same delicious taste, and I love it too. The kids can't resist it either. Plus, they have more to enjoy. For me, the castle is more than just nice food. It's we own, part of me and you, and it's the real flavor of TNT. That was your Royal Castle Soca Shot on the street, 919 FM, brought to you by Royal Castle. Our culture, our taste. Broadcasting from Trinidad to the to world. The world. Street919FM.com Burn your belly Ah 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 Ready now, ready now Yeah, 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 yeah Ah 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 that is nothing I need, yeah, no, no, no. I never see people with them things and fix them of it. Especially when they work hard for it. But they have some people, as soon as they walk through your door, they put a stumbling block in your road, your road, your road. Your road, your road, your road. They practice evil. They think we don't know. And some of them close, they close, they close. They're close to your own. From the borderline, we're not blind. We don't fuck them long, long time. Yes, I. And the 
have time for making moves. I don't carry feelings. That is too much of a heavy load. I never sell out my friends. That's not something I don't practice. Too many actors and actresses. Yeah. But it have some people. Soon as they walk through your door. They put that tumbling block in your road. Your road, your road. Your road, your road, your road. Your, road, your practice evil. They think we don't know. Long, long time. Yes, I. In the midst of the border. 
from the wavelength. So I said, this year we got it. Cause when the birthday was fresh already. So I ain't don't say no sleep for nobody. I don't know if you will notice. But I own money and progress. If you have ulterior motive.
right, Trinity Bigo. I am right here. I'm right here. Don't worry yourself. I'm right here with you. It's already um, 45 minutes past 12. And um, today is Wednesday. If you want to thank Mr. Wayne Dalamo, we want to thank Big Mike. We also want to thank um, Pastor Hannah for being with us today. So we want to take this time out to thank all our sponsors for being with us today. Okay. Yep, we want to thank all our sponsors for being with us today on the Street 919 FM. And um, it's my turn just to take you for the next hour. Right? Um, just take your calls and interact with you for the next hour on the Street 919 FM. So we... Yesterday, we would have spoken about um, the readiness of both political parties for the local government election. I got several phone calls from interested well, people who were very, in, very enlightened by the program yesterday. Very enlightened by it. And I said today I would have played a clip, a video to remind you guys of something that I think you all may, may have forgotten. And I wanted to just play two video clips of some things that I feel that, you know, just need to just remind you all a little bit about. And um, after that, I wanted to go back to the phone calls. Um, some people are asking me what is the solution to the situation that we we um we were talking about yesterday and i think yesterday people would have given the solution i don't think it's a big science a big high science or a complicated issue that needs to be sat down and have to come up with some big dramatical plan you know i think it, it's very simple it's, um and you, the callers, have reiterated it on several occasions. What do you think should be the resolution to or the answer to the questions or the answer to this, the, the situation that um, the party that you all support and love, or this a party that, you know, the party that you salute and love so much? Um, Okay. Thanks, Mr. Bego, for letting me know that I wasn't live. I thought I was live on Facebook. All right. Thanks very much for letting me know. So I'm now live on Facebook. And I know that I'm live on YouTube. All right, let me say good afternoon to all the people on YouTube who are joining me and all the people on Facebook that are looking at, well, are coming on. So I'd advise you to come on very quickly because, as I just said, I just have an hour with you guys or less than an hour with you guys. So the faster that you come on, is the better. And remember, this Friday at 12.30 this Friday, 12.30 this Friday. You need to be on the live by 12.30 on the dot. As soon as you get the notification to come on Constructive Talk, I am begging and... I'm well, not begging, but I am asking you to come on. Because I will have... Member of Parliament... For Paul Spain South... The Honourable Pete Scott, I don't know why I always want to put minister, but the Honourable um, Mr. Keith Scotland will be with me and he will be addressing the people of Paul has been south. I have some homework to do. 
And in that home lesson, I will be, I have my home lesson to check out and to do. I wouldn't tell you what is my home lesson. But I have my home lesson to do. And um, again, the door is open. And I'm seeing it so that you can talk to your member of parliament. The doors are of Street 919 FM will be open on a Friday from 12.30 for any member of parliament who wish to... Well, remember, I, I finish at 2 o'clock. So from 12.30 to 2 o'clock, I am opening up the doors on my show for any member of parliament. And when I said that yesterday, any member of parliament, I got calls, I got two phone calls actually from members of parliament who are not, who are UNC. <laughs> Which kind of, you know, people want to know, how they, why they got caught? Because there are people who um, from their constituency who listen. We have Mr. Pinal who does listen. We have Shogun, Mr. Um, Central who does listen. Central has listened to everybody's show on this, on this radio station. Central has listened. Pinal has listened. Yeah, people from every constituency does listen to this, to this program. So when the members of parliament from the opposition would have called me to come on the program, they would have gotten a phone call from their constituents telling them, hey, go on Google show X, Y, and Z. So the doors are open for, should I be specific? Should I say, only PNM members of parliament? You think I should say that? If I say that, you think I'll be fair? I'm asking you. Because up to yesterday, I know I got a phone call for a person telling me, don't invite no UNC day, you know. <laughs> so, again, you know, I am... Um, well, I want to thank all the people who would have called me yesterday, who would have texted me, messaged me on Facebook, and stuff like that. I said I wanted to show you a video. Um, when I come back from the break, I'll show you the video. I have two videos I want to show you. So I have to go for a break right now. So when I come back from the break, I have two videos I want to show. And then I'll open up the phone lines. Because I said to you, I would have continued the conversation. But, you know, the statement about... Um, the statement about solutions to this situation. I don't know. I, I think solutions would just make it... Would just kind of draw it down to a, a tick for tat, a different... You know, I ain't going through that. If you want to talk about solutions... The, uh, the, uh, the, the lines will be open for you to talk if you want to talk solution to, to, solu to bring a solution to this situation that you would have heard yesterday of how people felt so I'm going for a break and then I come back I'll take your calls don't touch your dial stay right here on the street 919 FM Shut up and dance to him, for he has been your help. 
22 <laughs> defend the <laughs> culture thank god i'm free again oh. the 24 we come in to play oh. song for you know is the place so oh. chance tell me where you drink in, oh. we drink in, oh. it's all about chance february 24th make sure i be yeah, because they don't know it's a super shell down a fear. Yeah, man, pretty sick. Season 22. Defend we culture at Sound Forge. The spirit was live on! Shop at New City Mall and check out our premium selection of high-quality clothing and accessories for men and women. Save on all items with competitive prices and courteous service throughout the entire mall. New City Mall is located in the heart of Port of Spain with entrances at 3 Charlotte Street and number 41 Independence Square. We offer a variety of shirts, long and short sleeve, round and v-neck tops, vests, caps, hats, sunglasses, briefs, boxes, shorts, swim trunks, denim, jeans, long and three quarters, socks, sneakers, casual and athletic, shoes, dressy and fashionable, dresses, formal and casual, skirts, lingerie, undergarments and a wide range of accessories. Come check us out as we also have clothing and accessories like Levi's, clocks, Armani Exchange, Hollister, American Eagle, Ralph Lauren, Nike Air Force and Air Max, Puma, Adidas, Timberland, Academics, Aeropostal, Old Navy, Forever 21, Haynes, Dockers, Guess, Converse and so much more. We have barbers, hairstylists, as well as weave and wigs on sale. All at New City Mall. Like us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram. Sale, sale, sale. There's a new taste in town. Maracas Bake and Shark at 79 Robert Street in Woodbrook brings you Bake and Shark, Kingfish, Fries, Shrimp, Alu Pies, and delectable sauces to tease your taste buds. Walk in, order with Food Drop, or get Parking Lot Pickup at 488-BAKE or 75-SHARK. Need catering? No problem. Call or email tastemaracas at gmail.com. Follow Taste Maracas on social media for all the delicious details. Taste Maracas, the new taste in town. Corner of Roberts and Rosalino Street. See you soon. Every Friday, it's all about Fireboot Soccer Fridays with MCU Consulate Takochi from 6 straight to 9 p.m. 
Blaze it all the lightest and pass soca heads. So remember, make it a line, make it a day. Rock and come in, you know. It's all about fire moon soca Fridays on the street 919 FM. Don't know. Season 22. <laughs> Defend We Culture. Drop your keys and bow your knees. For I am the best for your swing right rubber. February 22nd to 28th. I am here to defend my culture. Season 22. I am here to introduce you to season 22. Defend with music. We have soca, we have pal, we have calypso. We even have the doubles man. Sound food. Culture lives on. To make sure my culture lives and not just survive. Season 22, February 22nd to 28th at Sound Forge. The spirit must live on! <laughs> We say you wake up in the morning and you just realize Can't even come back again Alright, maybe that is not 100% true But hear this, TSB and T dub sided Alongside Iowa George presents Can't even come back Take back This is Iowa Georgia, big boss of business. Carnival Monday, the 28th, 3 p.m., Queen's Park Savannah, Carnival Combat. 3 p.m., Carnival Monday, Queen's Park Savannah. People, young brand, I'm gonna be here like a live DJ, you have to be coming to Shake it properly. People, you need vaccination on entry. Come out in your Monday wear. Come out with your team from 3 p.m. till. Get your female tickets started at $220. And male tickets at $250. With food inclusive. Get those tickets online at subtix.com. Also, book your cabanas. $2,000 for groups of nine with coolers and food inclusive. All this happening at the Queen's Park. Savannah, Carnival, Van Hub. If you're experiencing pain, constipation, headaches, poor blood circulation, high or low blood pressure, diabetes, cancer, swollen or darkened feet, come visit us at Health and Wealth Lifestyle, located at 73 Eastern Main Road, Barataria, opposite Eastern Credit Union. We at Health and Wealth Lifestyle offer a wide range of services. Come and experience our new 3D analyzer, which allows you to have a look inside your body. We also provide live blood analysis, iridology, ionic foot detox with foot soap and foot massage aqua therapy full body massage and organic supplements on sale such as nano silver nano zinc body light cold pressed sesame oil and more health and wealth lifestyle located at number 73 eastern main road barataria opposite eastern credit union for more information call 275-8359 or 288-1108 join nicole for health and wealth lifestyle every Monday from 9.05 a.m. to 9.55 a.m. right here on the street, 919 FM. Hey guys, it's Aisha Wells here. Listen up. If you're considering selling or renting your house in Trinidad and Tobago, then call Keelan George with O'Neill's Real Estate Group. He's a good friend of mine and he's been in the business for over six years. First, selling real estate in Atlanta, Georgia, and now right here in Trinidad and Tobago. He has a strategic online marketing presence that actually attracts thousands of home buyers and renters. Plus, with his home selling advice and techniques, he's getting homes sold really fast. Keelan will actually guarantee you sell your home or, get this, you can cancel the listing agreement and pay nothing at any time. That's right, you heard me, nothing at any time. Selling your home doesn't have to be stressful, people. Check out www.oneilrealestatet.com. O'Neill is spelled O-N-E-I-L or just call Kilon Direct at 363-4030. That's 363-4030. This is Wayne Delamore, head consultant and director of Natural Health Solution. With over 15 years of experience in clinical nutrition and microscopy, we specialize in early detection and prevention. We incorporate evidence-based nutrition and science-driven analysis. Tune in to our educational program every Wednesday from 9 a.m. to 9.30 a.m. Right here on the street, 91.9 FM. For appointments, call 222-2189 or 304-5816. At Natural Health Solutions, we offer a natural solution to healthy living. This is
Pastors Bishop Aaron Williams from the Divine Problem Solving International Ministries inviting you to be part of our broadcast on any given Thursday night from 12 midnight right on to 5 a.m. on Friday morning. And this broadcast is called Early Morning Gospel Market Program. Then we have on Tuesday from 12 noon to 1 p.m. the Holy Ghost Gospel Pharmacy. If you are sick and ailing, you can get from this particular pharmacy from the pharmacist the good things of life. Hallelujah. And any Saturday from 10 a.m. to 12 noon, break into the host of the Philistines. Hallelujah. If you are sick and tired of being sick and tired, hearing the Babel of false doctrines that you encounter daily, it's about time you get close to God, God's word, direct from his throne room in the name of Jesus. God has good plans for his people. Why do you worry so much? Turn your lights down low and listen to the Master's Radio. The Church of the Firstborn Assembly of Numbers 399 Eastern Main Road, Guayco San Grande, is pleased to present Pastors Morris and Agnes Johnson and guest. Sundays, Tuesdays, and Friday night, Sunday Ministry of Worship, Children Hour, and the Word from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. Tuesdays, see Jesus in every book of the Bible from Genesis to Revelation. Tuesday morning from 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. And Friday night, 9 p.m. to 5 a.m. All night prayer for our nation. Tell your neighbors, tell your friends, tell everyone. For further information, visit with us at www.churchofthefirstbornassembly.com or on Facebook. Email us at church668hope at gmail.com or call us at 753-1113 or 236-7271. Your free gifts and offerings will be greatly appreciated at Church of the Firstborn Assembly, account number 795222 at the First Citizens Bank. Get in touch with God. Share the line. Share the line. The Street 919 FM on Facebook and Instagram. Share the line. Iowa George on Instagram. Share the line. Iowa TV and Street Street TV on YouTube. Share the line. The Street 919 FM. That's game take that one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. See you right there, boy. Oh, Father will provide uh, Jesus will supply Good Lord, more than enough More than enough uh, My Jesus will supply All when my cup of them empty Jesus will provide Badang, you know the pressure to burn me See, remix, remix, watch it, watch it uh, corona in my country, Jesus will come. So when me do have not me no worry, Jesus will always provide for me. Cause Jesus will provide, Jesus will provide. I run my cup of them empty, Jesus will provide. But uh, Jesus will provide, Jesus will provide. So when you can't control your salary, watch it. Uh, he better than kiss and quail, He keep on putting bread on my table. And Lindos and Freddy, them they're ready. And Jesus Christ got the recipe. Uh, he's my cheap baker. So my bread basket always run over. So it overflow, overflow, overflow. And now I know, now I know, now I know. Jesus will go by. Jesus will provide. I run my cup of them empty. Jesus will provide. Baba, Jesus will provide. Jesus will provide. So when you can't control your salary, watch it. And he's my provider, my Jehovah Jireh, and my supervisor. So my blessing, my blessing run over. And so it overflow, overflow, overflow. And now I know, no, I like this part, I watch it. It's like you're doing it for spite. No matter what Jesus will provide. Jesus will provide. 
Yes, you will provide. I will not go with them empty. Jesus, this one is for the elders, for the elders. Jesus will provide. Yes, he will provide. So when the can't find your medicine in the pharmacy, Jesus will. Oh, oh, Jesus will provide. All right, trying to be good, so I'm back with you. Join me on Facebook and on YouTube as I'm about to show you a video that I believe need to be shown to be to bring a gentle reminder of some things. Um, when I show you this video, then I'm going to open up the phone lines, show you two videos. When I'm through showing you the videos, I'm going to open up the phone lines to hear your views. I hear what you think, hear what you have to say. All right, so Trinidad and Tobago, join me. Um, we had a national day of prayer in Trinidad and Tobago. I don't know how many of you could remember. We had a national day of prayer. And there was a pastor who would have made some, some would have prayed, made some declarations over Trinidad and Tobago. And I want to just play for you what the past had to see. Good. We give God praise for this opportunity to speak to our nation and to the nations of the earth. And specifically, one more time, to our Prime Minister. This is what the Lord said to me. I'm giving the nation a homework to do read jeremiah chapter 22 in as many versions as you can but i have taken it from the message version to speak today and it is this the lord said to me go down to the house of the king of judah and by the principle of similitude go down to the diplomatic center and speak to the leader and declare this is God's message attend to matters of justice set things right between people rescue victims from their exploiters don't take advantage of the homeless, the orphans, the widows. Stop the murderings. Then he said, I will give to you, Mr. Prime Minister, the Joseph mandate in reverse. Whereas Joseph became Prime Minister of Egypt in a time of plenty, to prepare for a time of scarcity. You have come into leadership when the nation is in a time of scarcity. But he said this, I shall cause you to lead this nation into a season of unprecedented economic wealth. For you shall lead the nation in such a way that you will lend to others and not borrow. Many leaders shall come to you for counsel on how to bring their nation out of their crisis. For I hear the voices of major investors saying, come let's go down to Trinidad and Tobago and invest seeds into their economy for it is yielding high yields on investments. The Lord also says there shall be a season of unprecedented collaboration between the government and the various opposition parties. 
Then he also says, I am after the heart of the nation and COVID became the rallying call. I will bring healing, not just to the COVID, but to the contentions within the nation. Then he said this, I wanted to have all the eyes and the minds and the hearts of the nation in one place, reflecting exactly what happened on the day of Pentecost, of which this is a commemoration, in the upper room. They were all together in one place. And the Holy Spirit fell. I decree then, God will heal our land and bless our land. Thank you. Right, so that was said to Trinidad and Tobago um, on the day of the um, National Day of Prayer. We had a National Day of Prayer, and that was said on the National Day of Prayer by also Vivian, Vivian, Funan Duncan, sorry. So I have one more video I want to show, and after this video, then I'll go straight to the phone lines. I have another video I'd like to show. What was up in here? Okay. While I'm waiting for that video to download, I will take some calls. All right, tell a good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. Yeah, good afternoon, Pastor Google. Well, Pastor Google, I'm listening to that video there. It's very deep and retrospective. Just that I am a little skeptical about that so called um, unprecedented um, that the opposition will work with the government. That one, I'm a little, I am very skeptical about that. Right? Um, but with respect of um, UNC people going on to um, take a station, that they want to come to a station, I prefer, prefer, prefer the people to come for. I'll tell you why. This country has over 20 radio stations. Most of them, the East Indian format station, they are not in favor of the government. And they say unscrupulous things about our prime minister and the government. So to have you bring somebody representing the UNC, the party that is like our party, I, I don't know about that one. Right? I prefer the preference. Bring the PNM people first. I can't right? bring them, eh? Wait, wait, the just now. Let me just clear this up. Yes. It's an open door yeah. policy for them to come. If they choose not to come, you can't I I can't bring them. They have to choose to come. Understand that. It's an open door policy. And when I said it yesterday, I said I have an open door policy for members of parliament who would like to come and share on what they have what they have done in their community, what they're willing to do and to talk to their community. Right? I have extended an invitation. Within extending the invitation, um, Member of Parliament for Port of Spain South, Mr. Keith Scotland, grab up the invitation and he'll be here on Friday. All right? The two UNC would have heard, would, they said that um, members of their community told them about the offer and they are willing. You telling me, don't let them come. Let PNM people come. And I'm saying to you, the PNM people don't want to come. What am I supposed to do? Hmm. Right, Pastor Google. No, I'm asking. Well, like I say again, it, 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 I think because of the fact that I think this station and protect other so-called station that's supposed to be in the PNM, we tend to be very open and nice to certain people. But on the other side now, with the UNC stations on them, is that different kettle of fish, Pastor Google? Yeah, but you're not listening to the question I ask you. You are talking about something totally different to what I'm saying to you and what I ask you. you talking about other stations. I'm not even talking about other stations. I am saying, and I'm saying it again, for you to hear it again. I have issued an open door. My boss was standing right by the open door 
when I said that I issue an open door invitation to members of parliament to come from 12.30 till 2 o'clock to share with Trinidad and Tobago how, how the politics have been going for them, what have they been able to accomplish in their community, how has it been for them, what are they doing, How? what and what. That is what I'm saying. I'm not talking about other stations. And I just said to you that um, the Honorable Mr. Keith Scotland for Porta Spin South took up the invitation. All right, opposition. Well, if he is coming, I hope the other... That is what you should be saying. That is what I you should be saying. Well. That is right, what you right. should be saying. Right. That's what you should be saying. And that's why I said also that if you have, if people have a close relationship with their members of parliament, right? And they, like, let's right. see, you could, you could WhatsApp them or you could talk to them and let them know, hey, Pastor Google have an open invitation um, every Friday from 12, 30 till 2, jump in now. Before you go to parliament, you could run in there for about half an hour and talk to the people and run out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I understand where you're going from, Pastor Paul. Right? But I think this is an open invitation. I hope the, most of the, the PNM people should take this up, take this opportunity, because this year's local government election. And their PR is very poor, in my opinion. So if this is the forum, so be it. Pastor Google. All right, sir. But I understand where you're coming from. Okay. Thank you. Hello, good afternoon. Yeah, good afternoon, Pastor. Um, I believe the rest of PNM MPs should do likewise, like um, like the invitation, um, like um, MP um, Scotland, who is now with him. They should do likewise and put the station and have a discussion with you and let the nation know what they can place. And you know, so the, the citizens will hear what the government doing and what they are doing for the constituency. Well, the UNC, they're not coming on that program because they consider the, this program as a PNM program. So the UNC MPs, they're not coming in. Trust me, I'm pastor. Good day. All right, if you say so. Hello, good afternoon. Pastor Google. Yes, sir. A, a, pleasant, a pleasant good afternoon to you and a pleasant good afternoon to the people of Trinidad and Tobago. Yes, Mr. Wall Street. Pastor Google, I want to compliment you on that initiative that you have started. And, you know, I might have to put you in the transformational category too, you know. I feel so, you know. Eh? But I'll I, I see a little more, you know. I'll see a little more, Pastor Google. Pastor Google, your program is called Constructive Talk with Pastor Google, right? Yeah, yes, sir. yes, sir. So if it's Constructive Talk and you have an open... And let me say this, Pastor Google, right? You have not come out and bash the prime minister because people just say i just bash the prime minister because i just call him the blackest man in trinidad and Tobago. you haven't come out and said anything negative about anybody right you haven't said anything all you have said is i'm having an open forum for mps to come and discuss what they're doing in the constituency what is so wrong about that and pastor google i just have people are calling and say boy this is considered to be, well, no, let me paraphrase that, because I'm a paraphrase. This is considered to be, well, I guess what he was trying to say is that this is considered to be a PNM sort of radio station or a PNM program, and you should only bring PNM MPs on that program. You know, Pastor Google, let me tell you this sad thing. Eh? I have never supported another party in my all my years on this, all my years on earth. I have never supported another party. The only party I've supported is the PNM. Right? The only party I've supported is the PNM. And Pastor Google, I have invited members of the UNC and members of the PNM to come on WZY 95.9 FM here in New Jersey. And the only people to have taken it up was the, the mayor of San Fernando, Mr. Robrello, and the mayor of Port of Spain, Mr. Martinez. Everybody else that have invited, right, is salt from them. Salt, right, from the leader, go down the line. We have invited members of parliament from the UNC, and them fellas just come 
listen, even with that money, last comedy program, and all them fellas didn't know my long time support for the PNM, right? So that tells me that that what is the purpose of me supporting a party and I can't get one MP to come on my program that I have in the village? One MP. Or maybe not one, but half an MP to come on my program. What is the purpose of me supporting that party? Why am I supporting that party? And I, I, I'm not going to talk about the building in Chumaka and thing. I'm just talking about the radio station that we have here in New Jersey that I am an owner of. And I invite, and I can't get one MP. One? Why is that? So, Pastor Google, you came out and you did something. And I want to compliment you on that. I really want to compliment you, and uh, you, you know, I know only no brief for you, eh, Pastor Google. Yeah, you know they're gonna say no. Once you complimenting me, that means something I'm doing wrong. Well, correct is right, <laughs> and they will say, oh, why, why Wall Street? I'll come, and you know, you know this, but but Papa, constructive is constructive, Pastor Google. When it's constructive, people need to take the head out of the sand and say, boy, listen, we want to hear what the other people are saying. We want to know what they are doing in their constituency, and we want the PNM MPs. I believe every twenty-one of them, every one of them, including the Prime Minister, should make a time to come on the radio station. Every one of them should come on the program. Every single one of them. And All if right. they don't come past the Google, uh. I don't know what the message is sending. But if they do come, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. But Pastor Google, you have a tremendous difference. Splendiferous, fantabulous, marvelous, just rest of the day. And I want to compliment you again on taking an initiative that is sorely needed in Trinidad and Tobago to hear what other people are doing, Pastor Google. And I appreciate that very kindly. Talk to you later. Bye bye. Thank you very much. Hello, good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon to you, Pastor Google. Yeah. Uh, Let me and you know. I. Calling you to wish you happy birthday. You taking my calls. You're only taking calls from ladies, but that's all right. Oh my gosh! And Pastor Google, it, it's trying to say today that I take I I on some fast right now, and some fast right now, Pastor Google, and I take some time now to call the program. And Pastor Google. The Prime Minister is out of the country, right? And you know something? The Prime Minister is seen or working as head of state right now, as I speak to you. And not a picture on the official Prime Minister page. Not a video. I went and see some picture and the picture mark up another Chinese or Muslim words. I said, but why our media personality? Why the photo not traveling with the Prime Minister? What is there to hide from the Prime Minister? Because if the Prime Minister is going to say, and I one thing I can say about the former Prime Minister, Kamala Prasad, because the camera was in, in her face. Don't care when she went to South Africa and invite Dr. Rowley. You see both of them on the plane was sipping on something. You see them in the funeral, and every country, every state that Kamala going to India, there's videos with Kamala in India going back to her hometown. And what is the what is the PRO? How how the Prime Minister could be out of the countries seeing heads at stake, and in that scene, a picture, a video when the Prime Minister comes out at the vehicle when he going to the Summit. Pastor Google, the PNM gone, you know. I do not know where they're hiding. I do not know where they're hiding. But Andrew Gabriel. Hey, hey, don't call the wall in there, please. Let me well, show let me show you a pitier. You want pitiers? Alright, I'm gonna show you a pitier. No, go on the line. No, that's go on the line. Watch the watch the what's the name of the pitier. I is that pitier. That's that's not a pitier. That is some screenshot. They take they take offer at um a TV or a live. But but no, what that is not true, Kingsley. I watching on the Prime Minister's official page here now, mm. where the Prime Minister, Dr. the Honorable Keith Christopher Rowley, with Trinidadians who living in Qatar. Mm. 
So it's you have you have and you have you have all all the names of different persons and you have a picture of them in a room Pastor, in a ballroom in a room talking. Pastor Google what what Pastor Google what what in two minutes ago was the minister of health com- press conference on on the official prime minister page. What page you 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 want Pastor Google? I on Dr. Keith Christopher Rowley, the Prime Minister of Trinidad and Tobago. No, 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 no. You on his personal page. I'm speaking about the, the official of the, the Prime Minister page. That is a page. I don't know no, what his personal page. I'm speaking about the, the, the official page of Trinidad and Tobago. We have over 100,000 followers. Over 100,000 followers. I'm speaking about that page. Dr. Rowley blocked me. Dr. Rowley blocked <laughs> me on that, on that page. You can give her one event. Doctor, only block you. Doctor, only block you from a official page. Yes, 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 personal page. I cannot get it. So, but I could go on the. I could, I could go on the official of the Prime Minister of China to be go with have over one hundred thousand followers. That like uh. page I own. And the last two hours, the last two hours post was the Minister of Health press conference, and 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 a video. With the prime minister speaking in the summit right now, right? So if you take the personal page to post, I have a problem with that. Pastor Google, if you, you tell me that you same thing, and, and, and this is, is an official page where the public will go on first before they go on the personal page this page because you can't lock me up. This is that page is my page. <laughs> you can't lock me there. You can't lock me there. Lock you can't lock me there. <laughs> that page is my page. But you lock me there. But you lock me there. This page. <laughs> 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 the prime minister block you. That means the prime minister know your boy. Look at okay. Look at look at using my fake. I'm a fake account right now, and I'm going into and I'm going into the so, prime minister. So keep rolling. Keep rolling. So with that, you have a fake profile. Let's go. I had to tell him you. Yes. That. I had to tell him yes, that. So I had to tell him that you're on a fake profile. <laughs> yes. I had to tell him so that he will not to deal with you. Let me take a next call. 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 Let yeah, well, so I, go show, I, go, I will show the pictures. You, you try to be <laughs> no. nasty. I will show no, the pictures. No, I don't. I, will. I am. I am now here. It was on his private page. I, I, I am looking for the past three, four days. I am not looking to see what happened to the prime minister. And I'm looking for the past three, four days. I am looking to see because I went on um or oh, some leaders who were over there. And I see that who the meeting. I see everything, but I'm looking on the prime on our prime minister page. Uh. There's nothing. So I am. Consider about that. All right, the pastor, the pastor, I Google. I hear your fight. You hear my hear fight? Your, uh, my yeah, fight. I hear your fight. Me, yeah, I don't fight. Your fight. Me, I don't because, fight. Eh? I don't have any fight, King Lee. Don't say that. Because you're the Christian. You're a Christian. Do the hierarchies in the PNMK? Any question that? Today, Pastor Google, in your party, 20 ministers in Anson. The phone. Twenty ministers. Pastor Google, I sent a video three months. Three months with cheat lights in Portsmouth South. I sent it personally to Chief Scott phone. Personally to his WhatsApp. Three months now. Three months now. Four, four lights, cheat lights. Four cheat lights. Only if we block up the road. They received his country running up the road to fix that. So, wait, just the now, just now. Uh, about it. Right, right. So, wait, just now, just now. The councillor know about it? The councillor know about right. it. Right. And what, what the, has the councillor the, done? The, the, the MP know about it. Wait, what the councillor did when he when you all told him about it? That woman, a female. Yeah, what did she do? Nothing. Why she did For, nothing? Ah? Uh, Why? I was advised strongly with one of the residents. And, 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 and I do not know, right? So I do not know. And let me say, let me ask a question because I do not like the libel and scandal and like allegation. I am asking the councillor if she tell the resident better you protest because she and check ain't coming up here. That's what she tell a resident. I call Wendell Stephen because Wendell Stephen is the chairman of the Post Incorporation. Right? Because I'm getting vexed now. I'm getting vexed now because I send that video to shoot the MP. 
the Kasi, the Council, uh, the, the Councilor on Simple Street, I stop and I ask the Councilor that that waste of time, Councilor, who should never be the Councilor of St. Anne's East River. Yeah, but Kingsley, you can't take up, wait, 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 you can't take up my whole show like we just do on, on, on other shows. I remember I just have an hour, you know. So when you you have been on from all, from quarter past one already, it's twenty five to. I want to call in and expose that MP for Portland South because he's coming. He's coming on Friday. He is coming on. Wait, just now, just now. But he's coming on Friday, so I will address it with him on Friday. I'm sure other. I'm sure it have. I'm sure just like how you want to expose him. I'm sure when I'm sure if Michelle Benjamin sit down here, he that people from Moruga. Will call in and share other um, things that are happening in Maruga no. that she's not addressing. Pastor Google, and that one, you are fighting a fight alone. Because you are you saying it now? Because Michelle leading in front, burning tires of constitution that she so they will support her. They will support no, her. No, I'm saying to you yes, that there are yes. people, wait, that's now, that's now. There are people from Michelle Benjamin's constituency. I'm, I'm not asking you. I am telling you that there are people from Michelle Benjamin's constituency who have an issue with Michelle not addressing certain issues. I am saying no, Pastor Google. You saying no? Say no? Well, nah. Then I you then you don't no. then you don't listen. Then you don't listen. Then you don't listen to this radio station. Let me take a next call. And it's already no. 20, 35 minutes past. They are party cards. They will have party acts. Thank you very much. But they have UNC people who do a whole video on Michelle. They do a whole video, said how she said she was coming to give out hamper, and she never show up. Oh, I never see that video. Oh, you send me that video. Well, then I check back your video. phone. You send me that video. I see that video. Yes. I never see that video. You send me that video. A man stand up with a list and say how she was supposed to come for Mother's Day, and she never come. You I send me that video. You forget how it. I can't recall. All right, then. I can't recall. Let me leave it there. I can't recall. Thank you very much. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon to you, Pastor Google. Yes, sir. Change me, my brother. You're keeping back your brother here. Yeah. Uh -uh. Let's talk. Oh, God. Yes. You know we have, you know, we have work to do. We, I Make didn't me. know that. And you always have to remember your brother will be there. It's a button here, but always remember Google show is short. Very short, and right now, I, I, right now, I've called us holding. You can't carry, and um, you know, yeah. Call, call me, call me, Pastor Google. Uh -huh. I have to support you one hundred percent. The PNM must learn that other radio stations with the support and the grip adds to don't care one foot about that. And you have the opportunity to come here on this radio station, and you're not coming. And I have to compliment the MP for Fora Spain South to be one that put up his hand and say he will be here at Kingsley. He can't hit him. He agree that he's coming. Now, what I want to point out to you, Pastor Google, the PNM. It's very weak. Very weak in advertising. For the good and welfare of Trinidad and Tobago. So much that when Neil Eversley this morning has drafted a letter to go to the police, the acting police commissioner, for the permission to run a protest outside the opposition leader's office. Unless we apologize for accusing the Coast Guard at Trinidad and Tobago for being murdered. And I am supporting him 100%, Pastor Google. And I hope my brother, King Z, is looking to join us. Because we very seriously that we want Sharon Felix and Marcel and everybody to make it known. It is official. We are going to protect the opposition leader's office, demanding that she apologize to the Coast Guard of Trinidad and Tobago that hypocrisy must stop and she must not be made to get away with that past of Google. Kinsey, we are a joint that. Right. We are a joint that. 
So, I'm making it official. The right. trusting letter is coming from Wendell Eversley. I and others are supporting him 100%. Thank you very much for allowing me this contribution. All right. Thank you very much, Mr. Paul Spain. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Pastor Paul. Jesus. <laughs> I've been waiting since before Wall Street. Um, Pastor Google, I'm not going to stray because I really am truly not into the tip of that politics. I've grown and evolved beyond that. The, the video I played with the, with the pastor that spoke in the day of prayer. Yes. I want to go back to that because I think we kind of lost the callers kind of carry down a different road with all this tit for tat UNCP and I'm talk. And I think the missus, that, that, that speech, that, that sermon or that pastor gave there because I was listening to that. And it kind of moved me spiritually. You know why? Because nowhere in that speech, in that sermon, he mentioned anything about division. All he spoke about is the leaders coming together and prosperity will happen for children and Tobago. Right? And he decreed. It means to say that we, the people of Trinidad and Tobago, have to put aside this PNM UNC in order for our country to move forward. Right? It means to say we a country that is divided, a house that is divided can never stand. It can never move forward. It can never fix. All the problems we have in Trinidad and Tobago can never fix so long as we have this back and forth division. And some, this is some of the reasons why I never used to call the show because I believe for a man of God, right, you're not supposed to involve yourself in this division politics. Right? It's divided by race and party brand and who loves the party and who is this and who that and Tam and them and UNCT and PNN this and PNN that. I'm more concerned about the citizens, the future of children and Tobago. Because here it is. We argue every day on a radio station based on who's red and who's yellow and who's Indian and who's African and who should get and who shouldn't get and who thief and who didn't thief and all that drama. Where is we going through that? We going through that. I tell you on the radio, I going through that. And I realized doing the same thing over and over, expecting a different result with nothing short of madness. I'm saying to that. Right? So why it is, it, when I listened to that sermon, I was like, this man really gets the information God talks to him in that day of prayer. Right? And if it is we're supposed to get a second or a, or a third or a fourth or a boom or some kind of investment or something, people come in here to invest in our country, Right? It means to say, we as a people have to forget this division that we preach and we, we regurgitate and we poison our minds and our children's minds with in order to move forward as a country. Right? I am not going to talk about Kit Katan coming Friday. I'm not going to talk about Rukha government election. I'm not going to talk about you can land, which is say with, 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 with the code. God, I'm not going to talk about none of them things. Because to me, all that is relevant and should and today goes more important than all of them is used. Right? And I hope to God, right, that you allow both PNM and UNC MPs, candidates, senators, councillors, whoever want to come in your open door forum and speak on behalf of the constituency, what they do, what the constituency, and let the people call in and see what the constitu constituency need, what they want, and allow the MP and them to answer honestly and fairly. Right? Yeah, this is not about tit for tattoos, you and CMP and them. And I don't know why people just call 919 I a PNM station because very rarely we will get some PNM as they. You understand? I am PNM as on all of that. You can be on radio right to hold it. Switching, switching, switching. Right? And I hear ads all over the place, but we does not get them. I say, why don't I play that by way? And we pay them out so they just think. You understand? Or I don't condone that either. I believe Trinidad and Tobago should be first and foremost in every single government, every single party, every single thing we do is supposed to put trade I push red, white, and black line high. Not no, no bodies there, no right and sun, and no whoever PDP. I don't care. It's a high time we give up this crap. We chasing a rabbit, we like a carrot and a stick, 
We chase so like, and they just had the kind of riding we back and we running on the state. We're not getting nowhere. The place getting bad, the people, the things that going forward, things that's happening in the country. You understand? I will say COVID come for them two years there and cramp economy to reject. So this is this to me, I don't know why we still focusing on UNC and PNM. What we can be focusing on how to get back out of this crisis we in here and get back to our loving foundation that we have. Thank you, my brother, and I thank you for allowing me. Enjoy it. Hey, uh, good afternoon, Pastor Google and Trinidad and Tobago. I heard um, Wall Street say that he has invited so many of the NPs to come and none has ever come. Probably what he's offering, they either see it of little value or very low return on the investment in time, or he has not properly articulated the benefits to Trinidad and Tobago and NP going on a radio station in New Jersey could have. So probably he needs to do some work in that area because I myself am not sure what would be the real value that would accrue to the members of their respective um, constituencies by appearing on a radio show that he has or on a radio station that he owns. So maybe he could clarify that for us. Hello, good afternoon. Hi, good afternoon, Pastor Google. Yes, sir. Pastor um, let me say this. Michelle Benjamin ain't gonna no tie and blocking no road if she government in office. She'll do that because she government not in office. So that doesn't mean that when she bond then she she care about her constituency. She is just advertising for herself and her party. Basically, and basically right now with, with what I understand with the UNC is to make this government ungovernable so it'll do anything like that. Drag coffee from all and things. Two, Miss Kamala Pasad the sister travel all over the world, have cameras, pictures, but when she come back to Trinidad, what, what have we benefited from that? What, is, what investors came to Trinidad and invest? She have met with investors in a 19 and hotel room and all kind of nonsense. All these things I know have good thing here. But what has she, what she have she achieved? So that's a doctor, you know, because he's saying thing. I see that I have been following up. Not pictures it have all over on, on Facebook. They were doctor in, in, in the meetings and they keep me up, updated on what he's doing. The same thing, the same thing you talk about when you meet with the people in quota and the names of the, the citizens and uh, who they, they put it to. But what I'm saying is that Dr. Rowley has, from day one, went and met with the BP boss on them because um, Shell had bought out BP. So it is, he went England first. Some, some challenging case that what Ms. Kamala Pasabi says has done, you all get go ahead, drill, and you don't have to pay any money or no royalties to the, com- to the country, so no taxes we get in. That was agreed. That was a signed agreement. It was above the pay grade of the, 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 the chairman of BP in Trinidad and Tobago. It was even above the pay grade of the, 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 his bosses and them in England. So Dr. Early and his team had to go to the United States to meet with the big head honcho and argue his case. What Dr. Early achieved from that? He got them to pay taxes retroactive to, plus they invested millions into Trinidad and Tobago. And we reaping the reports now because now we're finding oil here. Dr. Rowley and his team had to go to the International Court of Arbitration to get back close to a billion dollars for Trinidad and Tobago. That what a minister under the Kamala Pasabi Sessel government has went and removed the clause to allow him legally to leave with it. All Dr. Right. Rowley and, and there's another thing Dr. Rowley have been doing, boy, and the people and them just people just don't want to hear that they I don't think I don't think, I don't think it's that they don't want to hear it I don't don't say that I don't think it's that they don't want to hear it don't, don't, don't say that it, it's, you have to, wait, just know just know what you have to do and I'll just draw an example of scripture in the Bible you read right throughout Exodus God always remind the people I am the Lord thy God that brought you out of the land of bondage Egypt Oh. He always reminded them, and and sometimes, and we always see it as 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 a people. If we forget our past, we are doomed to what? Repeat it. Right. So if you and don't pastor? remind the people of what you are doing, you don't remind the people of where they came from and where they are going. They are going to forget, and you have to remind them every time God spoke to the children of Israel. He remi- it was I, I was telling my I was telling to my son one time. It's like somebody reproaching you every minute. Hey, 
I am the one who brought you out. Hey, I am the one who brought you out. You know why? Because God knows that human beings have a way they forget. All right. Well, I'll, I'll agree with you. So I'll, I'll scratch that. But uh, that is what I wanted to tie back into the message from the Yeah, but, but I want to take... I've, I just have a few more minutes again. I have well, a lot one, of callers calling in. One more. Just so, a, just, as I could say that, that same speech like every three months or so like that, or just remind us of the same thing you're talking about. All uh, right, sir. I'll do that. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Um, what I say, man, heavy, right? With me because I have family in the Coast Guard, right? And we have wives. So why he didn't want uh, Kamala to apologize? It's hurting me up to this day. What she said about murder is hurting me. Hmm. I hear you call her. Hello, good afternoon. You see why I told you yesterday on that program, your program? You see why I was she somewhere? To try to link yesterday and the conversation to say that it was bad talk yesterday. That is not what we were doing yesterday. What we're pointing out here is the little phone that we see. Now I say constructive talk. The little phone that we see is the one thing we up to now still can't admit. That the mother of the nation is the mother of corruption. When King Z still to admit that, at least he's a part of support here to carry them up a particular line to, 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 to escalate what transpired yesterday that Granny had to call the case to them by the river talking his phone back. This is not what we're doing here, you know. This is not, this is not what's taking place here. This is what, and you know he said it. The minister will come in on Friday. He sent him. And the minister came to the food speak out yet, but he passed him. Did he talk to the council? No. But he has information. What information he has? He can't tell you. If the council had called Sienta, and Sienta can come in the community because of their conduct. Hence, they are get police to come to take food speak right because of our conduct in the community. We had to say, we must have a picture that's coming through. And we had to read two soldiers to watch this event for so we entered. Hey? And that is what we're talking about. That has nothing to do with the PNL. You know? We have our own self that is back up on our own self as black people. Hmm. I put this conversation going on. Oh, this is not about the PNM per se. You just really need to hear more from the PNL. You know? But if we go down the road and go down there, we stay down by the river on our stone and talk it back. All right, thank you very much. Good afternoon, Pastor Google. I'm listening to a gentleman speaking here. But until those people of that 18 constituencies start to think otherwise, then we probably might get somewhere. Good day, Mr. Google. I now come home here. I now reach you. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Pastor Google. Hi. Pastor Google. Uh huh. Let me tell you something. Hello. I am not saying that the members of parliament, whether you and CPLM, not supposed to do things in the area. But I also think that it is said it's not what the country could do, say, what you could also do, say, country. And why I'm saying that, I remember in my, in where I live in Mutuland, there were some street lights not working. I knew a supervisor that working by, by TNTEC, and I talked to him, and I get him to change all the lights and fix them, fix them. Also, the street sign on my street, about 20 years that street sign was done. I, I take my own money, and I get a guy to get the, the same kind of material, that they make the street sign with, and I tell them, put it back up. I also put back the name of the street and everything. And that's true sure enough. I just saying what I did. It's not all time what, what it, it, also you have to help also. You understand? Well, I suffer the foot and thing now, so I can't do what I used to do. I used to, the whole street. All right. I used to scrub down that whole street. You understand? Because right. I live in there, and I need to see it taken. Okay, Pastor Google. All right, Ms. John. Hello, good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon, Pastor Google. Hey! Yes? Talk quick. I want uh, to hear you, so talk quick. Yes. 
And now that I've been in West Mall here, yeah, so let me come in so I can talk good. I want to drive and talk. Pastor Google, I listened to you all yesterday, you and I, sure. Let's switch off this engine. And I agree with some of the things you said. But, I mean, because I too, I did cross under my breath when I drive in on Wendy Fitzwilliam Boulevard, the road in a mess. And I am asking the question, why is the is it the roads are not being repaired? Is it an orchestrated thing? I mean, come on, right? But I am going to say this, and I don't care Wall Street, you could call me how much, go along, get along. I don't mind. I've taken it. I will still vote PNM. You know, they have something called spy vote. I voted back the PNM for spite for you and leave it there and all oh, you who want to see the UNC because let me tell you I yes. don't want to see Kamala Passad the Sessa back in we parliament as prime minister and to control we treasury all right but I'll, the I'll PNM, tell you the day. right the PNM need to step up the game all have right. a blessed day pastor Google reach home safe love you I miss love you, you <laughs> I miss <Bye>. you <laughs> I'm out of here, chill. I'm to be good. Talk to you guys tomorrow. Please, God. Tomorrow is what? Tomorrow is Thursday. Right. Talk to you guys tomorrow. Please, God. Be safe. The views expressed are not necessarily the views of the management of this street. 919 FM. Simpsons Memorial Limited, number 63 Eastern Main Road, Laventille. Internationally accredited funeral directors and embalmers. A full-service funeral home serving families of Trinidad and Tobago and internationally since 1945. At Simpsons Memorial Limited, we serve with dignity in assisting families in honoring the memory of their loved ones. Our services include professional funeral and pre-planning, burials and cremation, custom-built and imported caskets, coffins and cremation trains, cemetery management, limousines, mourners' cars, grief counseling, web streaming of funerals, fully air-conditioned chapel with live musical accompaniment, full global shipping and receiving of loved ones. We specialize in facial restorations. Call us anytime, day or night, at 623-8688. That number again is 623-8688. 38688 Simpsons Memorial Limited. Superior service always with excellence. Take me to the king. I don't have much to bring. It's all about the fastest growing reggae show in the land without a doubt. Right here on the street 919 FM. Each and every Sunday from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. With yours truly, I'm you alongside Selector Kochi. So make it a date and don't be late. Rock and come in, say line up, link up, creep up. You don't know regular rock each and every Sunday. Salute, that I'm our king, Selassie. Red hat, red hat. Hi, I'm Valentine Garcia. And I'm Nikki Garcia. Please join us on the final hour broadcast every Thursday at 9 a.m. on the street, 919 FM radio. Every week, we will journey into the amazing Word of God. So please join us. See you then. Tune into the street at 919 FM this and every Thursday for the program Conscious Talk. Conscious Talk. Where we are at and where we are going with Steve Antoine as regards the land space for the celebration of Emancipation Day. Every Thursday from 1025 AM to 1055 AM. It's Conscious Talk on the street 919 FM. There's a new taste in town. Maracas Bake and Shark at 79 Robert Street in Woodbrook brings you bake and shark, kingfish, fries, shrimp, alu pies, and delectable sauces to tease your taste buds. Walk in, order with food drop, or get parking lot pickup at 488 Bake or 75 Shark. Need catering? No problem. Call or email tastemaracas at gmail.com. Follow Taste Maracas on social media for all the delicious details. Taste Maracas, the new taste in town. Corner of Roberts and Rosalino Street. See you soon. The Mosh Gra. The Mosh Gra. The 2022. From the creative mind of Davlin Thomas. Deja Vu. Echoes of Carnival Coming. Presenting the finalists for the first citizens, kings, and queens competition. 10 best of the best in Kaiso. With guest performances including Bungie Garland, Nadia Batson, Iowa George, Lyrical, Swappy, Farmer Nappy, Skinny Fabulous, Slacks, and much more. The 
magic happens on the big stage at Carnival City, Queens Park, Savannah. Sunday, 27th at 7 p.m. Grandstand and Pod Posse tickets also available at NCC's head office and online at TicketGateway.com. For more information, contact the NCC at 622-1718. This event is supported by Digicel, Angostura, and TTT. Dimash Bra. Dimash Bra. Doctors Desmond and Angina Phillips present a series of healing retreats from February 27th to Sunday 6th March at the Eco Resort in Toko. This includes delicious healthy foods, refreshing healing drinks, learn DIY healing techniques, mini seminars and natural therapies. Price plans are for cost and full coverage excluding transport. Select plans one day from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. at $600. Monday 28th February, Tuesday 1st March, Wednesday 2nd March and Sunday 6th March. One night one day from 5 p.m. cost $1,100. Sunday 27th February, Monday 28th February and Tuesday 1st March or two days two nights from 5 p.m. That cost costs $2,100, Sunday 27th of February and Tuesday 1st March. For more information, reservations and bookings, call 336-5441 or visit the website at www.npathlimited.com for online bookings. Empath for love and healing. Me say you wake up in the morning and you just realize can't even come what are you doing? Does that Monday? Yes, Carnival Monday, 3 p.m. Queens Park Savannah. People, you need vaccination of entry. Young brother, I'm gonna be there live in the live DJ to be coming to shell it down. In other words, steam it up. Yeah, who does that? You alone, bounce on it like a trampoline. You, yeah, he's a benza. Shake it from my leg. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. So the ladies there, Carnival Monday, 3 p.m. Hear this, TSP at T dot sided alongside Iowa George presents the Carnival Combat. Yes, yes, Trinidad and Tobago. A musical showdown of medium and large steel bands from around the country will take place on Saturday, 26 February from 5 p.m. Center stage at the Safe Zone Carnival City, Queens Park, Savannah. Pantrin Vago, in collaboration with the NCC, presents a pan event musical showdown in the Big Yard. Big Yard. See NCC's website or call the NCC office at 622 for grandstand and park group ticket details. This event is supported by Digicel and Angostura. Season 22. <laughs> Defend we culture. Let's give it up. Make some noise for David. David. Michael. Ronnie. Uh, this is David inviting you to my concert, High Mass The Rising, at the Song Forge in St. James, Carnival Monday night. Tickets available at the Song Forge box office or tickets.songforge.live. See you there. Season 22. Defend we culture at Sound Forward. The spirit must live on! For more info, call the hotline at 33Forge. That's 333-6743. Job Optimum Health and Wellness. Are you sick and tired of being sick and tired? Get your Bioplasma Diagnostic Full Body Scan. Examines all of your organs in a single session. 95% accuracy. It's painless, non-invasive, and affordable. Call Pastor Job at 350-2628-767-1031 or 275-6300. Sick and tired of being sick and tired? Get your Bioplasma Diagnostic Full Body Scan at Job Optimum Health and Wellness. Pastor Hannah A. Pabu of Holy Spirit Ministries will be live on the street 919 FM every Wednesday from 11.15 a.m. to 11.45 a.m. In the scripture, Matthew 19, verse 26, the Bible says... 
But Jesus looked at them and said to them, With men, this is impossible. But with God, all things are possible. Pastor Hannah is here to motivate you, challenge you, encourage you to walk in your purpose and destiny God has for you. For prayer and counseling, call Pastor Hannah at 728-5197. Better vision for your physical eyes and to the eyes of faith, let healing arise in your mind, body, and spirit. At Natural Healing Ministries, we teach kingdom principles for living that brings the blessing of God to your mind, body, and soul. NHM Professional Associates are located at number 10 Moody Stewart Street, Monrepose, San Fernando. For more info, contact Dr. Desmond Phillip at NHM on 349-3494. NHM Professional Associates can be heard live on the street 919 FM every Saturday from 9.05 to 9.55 AM. Shop at New City Mall and check out our premium selection of high quality clothing and accessories for men and women. Save on all items with competitive prices and courteous service throughout the entire mall. New City Mall is located in the heart of Port of Spain with entrances at 3 Charlotte Street and number 41 Independence Square. We offer a variety of shirts, long and short sleeve, round and v-neck top. Vests, caps, hats, sunglasses, briefs, boxes, shorts, swim trunks, denim, jeans, long and three quarters, socks, sneakers, casual and athletic, shoes, dressy and fashionable, dresses, formal and casual, skirts, lingerie, undergarments and a wide range of accessories. Come check us out as we also have clothing and accessories like Levi's, Clarks, Armani Exchange, Hollister, American Eagle, Ralph Lauren, Nike Air Force and Air Max, Puma, Adidas, Timberland, Academics, Aeropostale, Old Navy, Forever 21, Haynes, Dockers, Guess, Converse and so much more. We have barbers, hairstylists as well as weave and wigs on sale. All at New City Mall. Like us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram. Sale, sale, sale. Tune in to The Street 919 FM every Thursday from 10.05 a.m. to 10.20 a.m. for the program Straight and Narrow. The Way of Life, The Health Store, being brought to you by Mrs. Arlene Collins Mohammed. For more information, check us out on Facebook or Instagram at Straight and Narrow. Or visit our website at www.opulence.com slash Arlene for Life. You can also call or WhatsApp at 309-4697 or 620-9379. Tune in to The Street 919 FM every Saturday from 7 p.m. to 8 p.m. to listen to the live Temple of Restoration, Pastor Curlin and the team. The Temple of Restoration is located at number 12 Endeavor Road, Shawanas, opposite the Curep Taxi Stand. For more information, contact 488-4413 or 7778691. The Temple of Restoration, where Jesus changes lives. Yo, 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 this is a big mic, not the mass man, the health man. Are you one of the 40 million people suffering with joint issues like rheumatoid arthritis or osteoarthritis? Well, you are listening to the right ad. You have the ailment, we have the remedy. Call us now on 288-8301 or 346-2612. Don't forget to tune in right here on the street, 919 FM, every Wednesday from 10.05 a.m. Performance, Beatle Talk. Why not come for why not? Don't let the niggas say you're welcome to the show. Let's go, guys. Carnival come. What are you doing? Who does that? Monday. Yes, Carnival Monday. 3 p.m. Queen's Park Savannah. People, you need vaccination of entry. Young brother, I'm going to be there live and alive. These years, you're coming to shell it down. In other words, steep it up. Yeah. Does that you alone bounce on it like a trampoline? You, yeah, it's a benza. Shake it from my leg. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. Ladies, 
Facebook and Instagram. Share the line. Iowa George on Instagram. Share the line. Iowa TV and Street Street TV on YouTube. Share the line. The Street 919 FM. Getting ready to go to the uh, Royal Castle Ahsoka shot in about seven seconds. Time counting down. So we're gonna get into that right now. This is your Royal Castle Soca Shot on the street, 919 FM. What goes in is a local something that makes it all, that makes it all taste better. It's the flavor of our culture. Come from here, come from there, and everywhere. It's the special flavor that's made to savor at the Royal Castle. Welcome the Royal Castle. Royal Castle. Flavor to the bone. Royal Castle. Taste the very own. Royal Castle. 
Taste the unique flavor of our culture at Royal Castle. Oh, this is a cry for my island. Yeah. A freedom cry for my island. Yeah. yeah. What would it take for you to stop and think before you take a life? Another life. That life you take. From the first restaurant in 1968, when that distinctive, tempting aroma hit the air, they just couldn't resist. And like never before, fried chicken with a special blend of local seasonings and a one-of-a-kind flavor down to the bone. Today, Royal Castle still have that same delicious taste, and I love it too. The kids can't resist it either. Plus, they have more to enjoy. For me, the castle is more than just nice food. It's we own, part of me and you, and it's the real flavor of TMT. That was your Royal Castle Soaker Shot on the street, 919 FM, brought to you by Royal Castle. Our culture, our taste.
It's called Sweet Part of Life. Tell them to respect we take. Of course, we're talking about Carnival. 2022, they gave us just a taste, but you know what? We're going to lick every part of it. It's just about a 20 minutes past the hour of 2 o'clock. Welcome to the VNR Show. My name is Precious. How are you feeling? It's a good day to have a good day. It's a good day to be alive. You know what, people didn't wake up this morning? And you were blessed with the gift of breath. Appreciate it. No one is in the road. No need a distraction. Want to jump at a can. Want to get in some action. Stand up. Suck around when you do one. I promise you we will stay one. Hey. What's on the agenda for today? Of course, want to thank Google for holding it down inside Constructive Talk. Yes, I'm feeling good. And you can definitely feel the energy, feel the vibe. So many things happening around the world today. And here you are in Sweet TNT where you can enjoy the sun. Nice music. Good energy, good vibe. Hey, we're going now with Ukraine and Russia. Hey, it's our job, my job, it's our are we blessed or are we blessed? Hey, we you wave your flag. Bless. You wave your flag. I wave my flag because I'm blessed. Oh my goodness. Robert and myself went down to the Queen's Park Savannah to see how things looking for Carnival Monday with Carnival Comeback 2022 and I'm telling all your things nice. From some of the boss I were judged down there as well, you know, making sure everything in an order for, for fr- uh, Monday coming. It's going to be a nice event. Do you feel this one? You like this one? You feel I like this, this one. one. Go in. Let's go in. Go in. You say have some respect for we thing. Put some know, respect you know, on the thing. You know, some of we just treat the thing with, with disrespect. Yeah. And we only know one love carnival when it's carnival. Yeah. But after carnival, we go in Jamaica and America. Who doing that? Who doing that? Like, call names. Call whistle. names. Call names. I go with soul. Um, this, this one who, um... That open one down so, and that open one up so, and this one down so. Yeah, that, yeah, the thing, <laughs> long transportation to reach that one up here. <laughs> <laughs> that was that one. So we're going for that song. Yeah, that that song was hot. It was hot. Oh, I went outside. As I told you, you guys, Robert and I passed down by the um, Queens Park Savannah just now. Yeah, of and course. We are like video to show them too. No, you know, show them the video one time. Yeah, well, let me show them the video now. Uh, uh, when you when you organize yourself. In the meantime, I'm gonna do the roll call. All right, you have the video. Uh, the video. Yeah, uh, uh, the video one time. No second. No second. Earlier, this is where we went down to the 2D Savannah to do a short while ago, and Robert we rushed back to the studio and put it together one time because the Vienna show got permission to give away two tickets. Yeah. For uh, the boss event oh, yeah. alongside TSB. Team not on, um, Monday. Mm-hmm. So we went down to 2D Savannah this afternoon, and this is what we came up with. So check it out. And then <laughs> Yo, this is your girl Precious representing from the VNR show, and this is my co host. Roberto. And guess what? Carnival Monday, 20th of February. We're heading right here at the Queen's Park Savannah, Savannah. for mm-hmm. Carnival Comeback 2022. We're giving away two tickets for Carnival Comeback 2022. Real easy thing. All you gotta do is call us up and sing any Iowa George song. Any song you actually know the lyrics to. Call and sing a song, and the callers will call us and vote both live and let us know which Iowa George impersonator they're feeling the most and then they'll move over to round two. Of course Friday is all about the trivia questions about Iowa George. So it's easy questions, easy thing, you will you bump to know them. <laughs> and then you get to win two tickets, male Ooh. and female, to come down here to the Queen's Park Savannah from 3 p.m. for Carnival Comeback 2022. Let me tell you something, when you see the boss in the stadium, you better come and come for your place. <laughs> Good vibes, good vibes, good energy. So y'all 
y'all heard it, right? We're giving away two tickets yeah, yeah. inside the VNR show. Yeah, yeah. Your carnival come back, yeah. Queen Spark Savannah, yeah, yeah. Monday coming. Back, back, go your way, go your way. Fed my spirit this hour of the day. Yeah. Go your way. Go your way. Go your way. I'm telling you. Good vibes only. In the party. That's how we move. Good vibes only. All around me. Good vibes only. One last time. Good vibes. Good vibes. Good vibes around me. If you come here with bad energy, leave. None. I'm telling you. Hello. All you hear what we say. So let me do your roll call, huh? Roll call time. Gonna send some love going out to Tasha, Tasha Moore. Tasha, Tasha Moore. Moore on the inside. My Dig- good, 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 good friend, dignified Keisha. Hey, hey, dignified. Always on the inside. Always. You are my yeah. today's WCW. Woman Crush Woman Wednesday. Woman Crush Wednesday. Yeah. Hey, hey. Love going out to Ushun. Ushun is here. Ushun in the house. In the building. In the building. Love going out. Hey, hey, Shusha from friend. Quebec. Shusha send my message, you know. Eh? Uh-huh. What's she yeah. saying? You know, some people send your message. It just Anybody dropped. cook? I feel like... You just dropped down in the notes. Yeah, ever. Yeah, but that's cool. I feel like for Jira. Jira? Jira. Hmm. Jira pork. I could do it all in roti today. Jira neck. You yeah, ever call somebody out of the blue and say, you cook? Where you cook? I'm passing for some <laughs> lunch. Jira foot. What well, cook today? I just feel them for Jira. And if you cook Jira, let us know. So I just feel like a Jira kind yeah, of thing. Yeah, of course. Plenty, 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 plenty pepper. So you have to tell you about this, Just some Jira. Love going out to uh, Lovebirds. Love yeah. Our 82 plus one. Yeah. Friend locked on. Blessings going out to Philip. Philip, Philip is on the inside. Preacher, that is. Yes, Russell, Russell and his mom is here. Yes, Mrs. Matthews, big up all yourself. Oh, yes, Donna. Big up to Donna. Love is Lynn. Yes, yes. Merlin. Merlin. in the house. What about Merlin? Diane in the house. Diane is here. Who else? Abedee. Abedee, share the life. Big Abedee. song, big share the song, life. Big song, big song, big song. He talking about the um. The um, Coven. The Coven, yeah, that one went nice. Yeah, it's going nice. The voice nice too. Yeah. Start off with the yeah. voice. Yeah, start, start with the voice. And Mr. Hey, hey, Bago. Mr. Bago, sunshine in the house. In the building. <laughs> Love going out to who? Janet. Janet in the house as well. Oh, yes. Oh, God, uh, Philip saying some people wake up dead. Hmm. What I mean? You wake up dead. <laughs> to wake up, you know, dead minded. I don't <laughs> Donna said yes, it's vibes. It's kind vibes. of vibes, you know? Yeah. Kind of vibes, no, you know? well, today we're taking it right up. Yeah, yeah. Tomorrow yeah, yeah. we're taking it right up. We're taking it right up until Monday. Uh, where Andy? I thought Andy was coming today. Andy? Uh, you have to go in the naughty corner. Andy, go in the naughty corner and stand up. Tell me you're coming like today and you didn't, you didn't show up here. Eh? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I put it in, I, t- I seen it and dig it. <laughs> oh, well, I like our background. Yeah, I Memories find... of our carnival going by. Of course, I'm looking nice, so you know. What band is this here? Me. Yeah. I find. Anyhow, I'm going to do this one next to me. Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay, that's so. Anyhow, yeah. Florence is here. Hi, Florence. Mr. <laughs> Bigger Sunshine saying, Precious, all know I, I would have been in my mask. I'm doing some finishing touches to my costume for the yeah. night for Kings and Queens tonight. Oh gosh, girl. Wait, Eric, 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 yeah? Eric, Eric, uh, uh, he Call calling him. in and sing for the ticket for we to go Iowa on Monday. Well, uh, right. Uh, oh, no, it's Miss Maslin, say that. Yeah. She's telling so Eric, we Eric, to call it. Well, we start tonight. We start tonight. Tomorrow, we'll start tomorrow. No, we tomorrow. started today. You started today? Saturday? Saturday? Yeah, Saturday. Yeah, today. Call we can start the action you know today. To call. But you'll, call, you'll have to call him within the... Um, the half an hour session that yeah, we're doing yeah. at three o'clock. Of call course. in, sing any Iowa George tune. And we put here. We write your name on the list mm-hmm. and then callers will call in and find which one of you all, you know, did, you know, the best rendition of our Iowa George tune. And then your name will go to the second round. And on Friday, yeah. we'll ask you a simple trivia. If you're an Iowa George fan, we, we could ask you anything. And, you know, yeah. if we ask you, is George's favorite caller, you know. 
Yeah. If we ask, when's the last time George shaved his head, you would know. <laughs> if we ask, you would know. I like that one, I like that one. You know, no, because he's no, a George no, fan. No, yeah, no, don't give them all. Don't give you them understand, all. you would know, and you answer the trivia, and you get yeah. two tickets to, to go down to um, the Queen's Park Savannah on back. Carnival Monday. Yeah, yeah. see pressures on myself then, and you know. Papa. <laughs> you pressures if you know. But I just went down there just now but to yeah. do the answer, so I wouldn't yeah. go down when the thing actually happened. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I feel a little bit of a Papa. Anthony in the building. Please, please, please. It's nice, you know. Miss <laughs> <laughs> Marston said, Precious, I can make that for you. What I mean? Jira? A little Jira. But you're not here. How are you pork. making it and you're not here? <laughs> Love you, Anthony. Now. So, Mr. Big, you're not coming over? For she not coming over. Mr. Bigo, are you coming for our event, Carnival Comeback? Yeah, you and your daughters? And, and Bring your daughters and them and you come. Papa. Hey, hey. Bring the family. Uncle Leslie in the house. Keith. Hey, the new one. Old buddy in the house. Ashton. Ashton Lockton all From the way out there. Brampton. And I find him my music. My music separate. Good vibes only. Nice. Good vibes only. Yeah, man. Yeah. Love going out to Angela. Angela. Angela Wells. Oh, yeah. Aisha, sister? Aisha Wells is your sister? Tell me. Randy <laughs> locking us down from Prizal. Oh, yes. That's going up Cuba, son. Yes, yes, yes. Love to hey, find the house. This right, is them, them, them my sister-in-law. Serious? Yeah, we love, love all the time. Kimba. And bring up to my brother, Iran. Hey. And who? My brother Aaron oh, as oh. well. Big up to Aaron. Oh yeah. And big up to my friend Aaron as well. Yeah, big up to Aaron. Always, always locked on. on, yeah. Big up to Calvin. Calvin, Calvin mm -hmm. Brian and Brian in the house as well. Annalise. Annalise. Rainy afternoon. We. Annalise, where? Which so. She's up in the background, by the way. Yeah. Background looks so what joyful and merry. No, nah, it looks nice. Happy. I just find this fella next to me. <laughs> He look who next to, is that? Is who? Look, he ain't even there. The man not next to you, Robert. Don't do that. Next to me, boy. <laughs> I'd um, yeah. My, Mr. Bigo Sunshine is saying, when my friend Eric, Eric, win the, the two Iowa tickets to me, and he, of course, I will be there. I find like you hooking up at date in a kind of way, Mr. Bigo. Mr. Bigo, you're not married. <laughs> anyway, let's go to YouTube. Let us know. Which part of Let us Trinidad. know which part you're locking us down from and where it's raining because you're saying it's a rainy afternoon. There's hot, hot sun on this side. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Love going out to Christine. Christine is saying no rain in Canupia. Oh, and uh, Annalise is listening to us in La Hockita. So, La Hockita, there's uh, rain. Oh, but okay. it's a passing cloud or, or, or um, yeah, a little passing thing. A little drizzle. Nothing to talk yeah, about. Nothing to talk about. You should invent a water. Um, Marion in the house. Marion from, from Long Island. And of course, those of you on uh, Facebook. Yes, yeah. Terry. Terry. Oh, yeah. And Terry's also happy to be alive. Oh, yeah. Yeah, man. Today's a good day. Today Today's feel a like good a good day. day. Today's a good day. What are you telling yourself? You know, I, I learned so much from Precious, eh? Papa. I must say, you know, we went to do the slave job in the Savannah. And I had the pleasure of seeing how, you know, you do a job. For, you know, a, a big event like this, you know. Yes, so, yes, yes. I want to. <laughs> I just want to say, I just get emotional. <laughs> hey, the phone lines are open, guys. So call us up. Emotion. Let us know what you're up to on this uh, hot. I would say hot because from where I'm sitting at number 56 Marvel Road, mm -hmm. the sun real hot. There's a new person. I never see this person before. Zanair. Hi, Zanair. Hi, folks. Hi. I don't normally call this show because all now so are doing something else that I can't oh. enter the phone. Is Zina here? Yeah. Okay, oh, Zina. Zina. Hi, but, Zina. Yeah, I always locked on after Pastor Google. I always locked on. Yeah, I'm yeah. just giving a chance for the other people to call now. Uh huh. <laughs> you know, I like my politics. So yeah. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> yeah, so here what? Mm -hmm. I want us to tell you the weather because mm -hmm. I'm in and out. Mm -hmm. A tenant of a plant because it's rain and stop. Where, where, where you at? Top. In Arima. Arima. Okay. Yes. Arima. And so oh, all man. now is just a overcast and it's cool. So, but no hot sun and shining here for the you morning. See, it's rain. It? rain we and just come back from the savannah. My throat was dry. Yeah. Yeah. Fuzzy sun hot. All right. <laughs> so I love tone. All right, right. Zins. Okay, Zins. Blessings to you, Zins. Zins. I'll be call her on the street 919 FM. I mean, she don't call her session because she just stated that you know, she's really on the politics. Yeah, thing, politics. But she's always locked on. I like to be honest. Goodbye. Let, let the yeah, young yeah, people yeah, call yeah, yeah, yeah. in. Joyce Smith is Hello. coming in. Hello. Hey. 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 Hey.
coming to the best club in town now. Yeah, I know you always on, Gina. <laughs> Man, I hope you're practicing your Iowa song so when we go going into that you could call and sing your Iwa song to win your ticket for you and your man. Come on, man. Come on, man. Oh. Put them in. Water. Put we, them in. We have a special seat for you and your, your, your madam. We sit in you all in front. Oh, so yeah. when you sing George, they sing your blessings. The VIP. The blessings. The very important. Uh, older than Zena, you know. Papa. You older than what? Uh, I said me older than Zena. My grandma did they say you're old me when you're old, dead. Older you're older than Zena. But you're not cool. <laughs> you're old, but you're not cool. Ah, but that, I, 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 I'm old for my way down. Papa. Hey, hey. All right. That's okay, Manu. All right, Manu. Anyway, mm-hmm. uh, give me a nice, a nice song there. You got a nice song. You got a nice song. You want to play for you, want to play for you. Oh, God. But you yeah, ask for a nice song. Songs that, that, that not pertain into the vibe and the atmosphere. I think, man, you want to try right, down right, the right, thing. Right. You didn't ride down, eh? Give me a bill trust on something. You see what I mean? I'll play some nice way. All right, love. Go ahead, you hear Bill Chapman tomorrow? No, tomorrow next week. Tomorrow next. is not retro, is it? Tomorrow is retro. Tomorrow is I. Well, I know I yeah. want to. Hey, the Mount of Women's Hospital. You're like, hey! Big up for yourself. Who said that? Dawn. Dawn is here. Hi, Dawn. And the Women's Hospital. Yeah, man. Hey, look who's friend. You're like. And they! And they! Where's he seeing? Where's he seeing? What's going on? What going on, buddy? Adi, what go? Adi, pork up, pork no beef. Adi, I feel like for some Jira pork boy. Come on, Adi. So long we know you. Pass by the building. <laughs> when quarantine over. All right, all right. Yeah, 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 <laughs> you yeah, can yeah. make Jira pork? When quarantine over. <laughs> How you been? All right, then. Well, I'm a boy. And that is a special. Uh, what's my? <laughs> that is my specialty. Yeah? That, uh, that, uh, yeah, that, that, uh, that, uh, that, uh, that, uh, that, uh, Mm-hmm. We talking there. Eh? Yeah. So when you when you come out of quarantine, you go bubble up. You go bubble up like thing. Yeah, I know a problem. Mm-hmm. I go I go start off for the Jiranek. Jiranek? Yeah. Alright. <laughs> Which one of the neck is that? Because that is duck neck? No, no, no duck. That is full neck. But next set up, give me chicken neck, goat neck, duck neck, guana neck. Oh, oh, okay. hey. Hey, 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 you, you feel this way when I'm saying something to somebody who uncivilized or? Yeah, 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 they say, I find. Content season over March 1st. I find you just give on a reaction. Not, not, for, real <laughs> not for real trinies. Papa. Not for real trinies. We trinies will, we trinies will, trinies will hunt, we trinies will make a hunt on your world. Now when we get wild meat from, we always have it in the freezer. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah, 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 <laughs> what is it? We said it, ha- it have a big fine for that, so don't put your foot in your mouth. Oh, well, here what now? It have one that sweetie. We just have sweetie and all kind of thing in a in little pocket now, you know? Okay. <laughs> so what's up, guys? We did, we did. Okay. Getting ready. We did. Hey, here Monday, what now? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I have a little, I have a little situation here. What is that? Right? What do you think about this, this whole carnival situation boy what do you mean with these quote-unquote little stages as they as they are what well, do you think about it well andy is not any and anybody mm. could come on the little stages yeah yeah, the, yeah that your vaccination card Card. there's the gonna be safety protocols mm-hmm. you understand Actually. <laughs> Actually, I overheard a, a, a little meeting today in Savannah. Mm-hmm. You know, nosy, mm-hmm. right? And mm-hmm. I, I heard the security giving out all the layouts of yeah. and, and yeah. how the, these proceedings will have so to. So all go. the events at the Queen's Park Savannah is going to oh. be with a level of responsibility. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. All right. Well, like likewise, anything. Yeah, but honestly, mm. I say, well, this this case a carnival. I think they could have do it later. Down probably would have been able to facilitate more people, right. and we'd have we'd have been as a, a more substantial in, income. Mm. You know. Other than that, honestly, they say really yeah, going and make nothing out of it. I've been real. Mm. The only person going and make out of this is the person who renting those little stages. 
right? Wow. We're going to make you not know that. And that is just my view. That is not your view, but that is my view. You understand? It really, you kind of honestly, the money that we felt to do that could have been turned into doing something else, using to do something else. You know? <clears throat> because <clears throat> I'll say this. Mm-hmm. Um, even even uh, persons with physical needs, right? Yeah. Such as the TT card and all of these things, it has been cut, right? Across the board, mm. right? And the kind of money that went into do that yeah. could have been put into getting food on people's on persons' table, mm. you know, and in this hard time. Right. understand so i honestly think it's a waste of money that was not utilized properly mm-hmm. it could have been used for something that is worth more than to just have a few persons come and shake up a pump on here and drop a wine on a corner there but, you know but, but, it didn't make much sense to me okay all right Andy, thanks for right. the contribution hello. hello good afternoon welcome Good afternoon, Precious and Robert. This is Swanks. Gems. <laughs> what a gun. I do, I do. I do. What are you doing, Swanks? I know he ain't Andy talking about, well, I not into Carnival, eh? Mm-hmm. I cannot last years now, I finish with that. But what I'm trying to say, every year that custom selling millions of dollars at Carnival, it's just because of this COVID that is cut down in this small way. But every year we are custom selling millions of dollars in this carnival. This is nothing strange. It's something that they always have every year. And it's millions of yeah. dollars that spend. Mm-hmm, uh, mm-hmm. I tell you, Mr. Andy, Mr. Andy, I think you better be yourself today. Okay? I want to drink some water and mind my business. Like right. Okay. All right, no. <laughs> All right, James. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hello, good afternoon. Welcome. Good afternoon, precious son, Mr. Roberto. Good um, afternoon. Listen, I want to touch on the topic the first caller and he has spoke about. And um, to agree to him to our point that, you know, at this point in time, you know, consumers have limited economic spending power. And we could literally say that we are in an economic crisis in the country, give and take of what the scenario may be, right? Um, another problem I want to say is that in fact, I notice that we should all see is that all of a sudden, a magic wand has been waved and the cases of deaths of COVID have begun to decline. Is it because it is a marketing strategy for one, vaccination, two, carnival is in the air, and three, is, is to get people out there, you know, to do the necessary things in order for this carnival momentum to be hyped up, right? Another thing, a point I want to add to is that you have students, um, children who are 12 years and under who are not allowed to go to the, who are allowed to um, accompany in, in terms of, you know, unvaccinated or unsafe zones. But those who are, um, they must be accompanied by parents who are vaccinated. So what is exactly, what are we heading to and how we are really strategizing it? Thank you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yeah, Mr. Bataria. Hello. Good evening. Hi. Good evening. Yeah, Mr. Bataria, are we hearing you? Hello? 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 You, you, we now hear you in and out. Uh, I, hope, I hope you get me. Yes, yes. Because go ahead. This, convert, this thing here is about large. I don't know about two o'clock. No, Mr. Baltar. You may need to call us. Well. Mr. Baltar, we are not hearing you at all. You're singing like you're in a tunnel. I don't know. We've been having that problem with your phone since yesterday, and we really, really want to hear your contribution. Um, your contribution. But we right? ha- so also we have a voice note, so let's go right. Yes, I can make Jura make Jura pop. <laughs> you name it, I could G right for you. Well, I'll hire me, now, man. Hire me, hire me. And yes, Eric, Eric is my date. 
So Eric, Eric, you go home. You need to take it. I go buy my boat ticket. You marry that? Plane ticket. Don't study, but me act me sleep in accommodation. When I don't set, it's just to go on the boat and get back up for work. <laughs> so, pass, so pass, 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 don't worry, you're inside with a Jira girl, you're inside with a Jira. All right. You're Hello? inside with the Jira. Hello? 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 Uh, yes, Mr. Paul, I spin. Papa. Uh, Papa. What are you doing, man? Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. They call her a while ago. In Trinidad and Tobago, mm-hmm. we have a culture where we have people who are very loving their, their religious body, whether it's Muslim, Christianity, Hindu, or whatever. And then we have the norm for our culture of Kilban, Calypso, and Cannibal. Don't you think, my dear brother, as my sister has told you, we are accustomed to canvas. The little 35 or 15 million dollars, how much thing it would have done to eat it like you saying, and we so hungry, like the little thing I hear in Trinidad and Tobago, that we can't have a carnival. How long that we go go on? The rest of the world going and opening out. At some time, we have to let it be and get a little freedom. Because Pan is my glory, and Pan has led us to be known all over the world. Accord? You better talk? You better talk? Yeah. yeah, following you. I'm here with you. Am I correct? Pan has led yes. us all over the world. All over the world, Pan, Pan Rich. Pan Men mm-hmm. have been staff for two years, my dear brother. Hello, yes, Pan Men. They have come up on court, so COVID, they go last so what? Ten years? Yeah, come on. This time we must come out, man. And yes, 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 yes. Come out responsible. So huh. we think about the pan man. Do you go get a dollar to? The artist. Do you go get your water dollar to? The producer, yeah, come on. The people who sell in. The only thing that you can look for dollar to? Mm-hmm. Oh, Jesus. Lord, I am made by the young people following that narrative. But you could have take the money and do what? Yeah. Fortunate thing about me is that I able to fool the rest of the world you know, on the computer and I'm watching the rest of the world. When I hear people talking about, oh, we hungry and we eating, people don't like it, it's only no people hungry yet. All the time people hungry in the world, you know, my brother. Oh, yeah. But you know, some people know, know how to survive it. You know, some people can't wait to go and rob people. And some people robbing people for time because they have the criminality in them. Not everybody going to be hungry, you know. Because I could tell you about some of them. Some of them even in shelter, when you get them, the material they're selling it. Pressure, they're selling it, shelter, don't give them money, they give them material. But a man put in and say, you have a rope fall up. When you watch at the, at the, at the identity of the place, it's a battle. Next thing you hear, the material sell it. I mean, come on, man. We must be a drama. Thanks, man. We have been spending money on carnival for years since we've born and grew up in it. Time for we to free up a little bit. The rest of the world doing it. Why not Trinidad and Tobago? Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Mr. Paulus. Hey, hey, Brooklyn, any else? In the, house. In the Hi, building. Brooklyn. In the building. Oh, bro. Hey, hey what's going on? Wow, Robert and Fresh. We good, good how are you? Good day. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. And for years now, after listening to Mr. Porter spin, the pan men and women, not just when we say pan, we always say pan men, eh? But I want to say the pan men, women, and also children has been underrated as well because without the person that's playing behind the pan, the pan is just 
a decoration mm-hmm. and that is our national instrument mm-hmm. so in order for it to be song you have to respect and you have to love also the people that have the ability and the skills towards playing that instrument Come on now. So, so i want to tell people uh-huh. because i am one of the person i'm an individual who came out from you know not having anything and pan take me all over the world from japan to europe to throughout the caribbean just learning to play that instrument you understand mm-hmm, so mm-hmm. i just call it that gift from heaven uh-huh. i don't call it just we trinidad and tobago national instrument i call it a gift from heaven because pan opened doors for me yeah and a lot of other people could speak just as i am speaking here so i want people of trinidad and tobago to stop thinking small-minded and know that we have the greatest instrument of all time and it can carry you throughout the world for free people who travel the world have to be millionaires but pan could take you all over the world for free well you have a blessed day well said brooklyn well said I, and i remember those days eh, precious mm. yes I, I i wanted to be on the state side band for any kids <laughs> and be in japan and all over us yes? So guys, the ads are counting down upon us. I want to squeeze in one more song before we go to the ads. Yes, Patrice Roberts, one more channel.
definitely going to be there. Carnival Monday for Carnival. Come back at the Queen's Park, Savannah. Y'all need to go on out and get your tickets for this one. Male 250, female 220. It includes food inclusive. You can get those tickets online at suntix.live. Here's more information on Carnival. Come back. Carnival, come me say you wake up in the morning and you just realize Carnival come back again. All right, baby, that is not 100% true. But hear this, TSB and C dot sided alongside Iowa George presents Carnival come back. Take bamboo, girl. Take bamboo, ride it, girl. Carnival Monday, the good again. This is Iowa George, a big boss of the business. Carnival Monday, the 28th, 3 p.m., Queen's Park, Savannah. Carnival come back. 3 p.m., Carnival Monday, Queen's Park, Savannah. People, young brand, I'm going to be here live and live these years. We're coming down. Shake it properly. People, you need vaccination on entry. Come out in your Monday wear. Come out with your team from 3 p.m. till. Get your female tickets started at $220. And meal tickets at $250. With food inclusive. Get those tickets online at sundicks.com. Also, book your cabanas. $2,000 for groups of nine with coolers and food inclusive. All this happening at the Queen's Park Savannah. Carnival, Carnival, Club. Simpsons Memorial Limited, number 63 Eastern Main Road, Laventille. Internationally accredited funeral directors and embalmers. A full-service funeral home serving families of Trinidad and Tobago and internationally since 1945. At Simpsons Memorial Limited, we serve with dignity in assisting families in honoring the memory of their loved ones. Our services include professional funeral and pre-planning, burials and cremation, custom-built and imported caskets, coffins and cremation trains, cemetery management, limousines, mourners' cars, grief counseling, web streaming of funerals, fully air-conditioned chapel with live musical accompaniment, full global shipping and receiving of loved ones. We specialize in facial restorations. Call us anytime, day or night, at 623-8688. That number again is 623 623- 8688 Simpsons Memorial Limited. Superior service always with excellence. Take me to the king. I don't have much to bring. I don't have much to bring. Season 22. <laughs> Defend <laughs> We Culture. Ule, come and take a nibble from me. Ule, two years now I ain't see. Ule, no pan, no mass, no party. No celebrations in the country. Oh, no, no, no chance. 24th of February, it's all about my concert, and it's going down at Sun Forge. Make sure be there. Season 22, defend we culture at Sound Forge. We spirit must <laughs> live on. <laughs> Trinidad and Tobago Mortgage Finance Company Limited wishes to advise customers making mortgage payments over the counter that the tellers at all our offices will be open daily from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. To make payments online, book appointments, request letters, statements, documents, and access other services, please visit our online customer service center at ttmf-mortgages.com. TTMF, from here to home. There's a new taste in town. Maracas Bake and Shark at 79 Robert Street in Woodbrook brings you Bake and Shark, Kingfish, Fries, Shrimp, Alu Pies, and delectable sauces to tease your taste buds. Walk in, order with Food Drop, or get parking lot pickup at 488-BAKE or 75-SHARK. Need catering? No problem. Call or email tastemaracas at gmail.com. Follow Taste Maracas on social media for all the delicious details. Taste Maracas, the new taste in town. Corner of Roberts and Rosalino Streets. See you soon. Are you ready? John chapter 8, verse 32 says, You shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. Tuning to the Street 91.9 FM every Tuesday from 6 to 7 p.m. for the program Walking in Truth with me, Pastor Gary Grant from Walking in the Spirit Ministries. Come, let's discuss how Christ Jesus can set you free. God bless you. If your hands are anointed, Season 22, <laughs> Defend <laughs> We Culture. Ule, come take an event from me. Ule, two years now I ain't see. Ule, no pan, no mass, no party. No celebrations in the country. Oh, no, no, no chance. The 24th of February, it's all about my concern.
concert and it's going down at some forge make sure be there season 22 defend we culture at sound forge we spirit what <laughs> live on <laughs> The deals are at East Side Plaza, located at number 32 Shannon Street in Port of Spain. It's a sale on everything at all stores. Opening hours are from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. Everything from food stuff, lunches, pottery, African wear, Christmas gift items, tailor services, hair salon services, and so much more. Everything means everything. Head into Port of Spain and check out East Side Plaza at number 32 Charlotte Street. Tune in to The Street 919 FM every Friday from 9.15 a.m. to 9.30 a.m. with Kingdom Health Services, situated at number 125 Eastern Main Road in Tunapuna. For the program, Health and Healing, Merging the Old with the New, with Mr. Brent Diet. For more information, call 318-7471 or 4840141 or 360-4100. It's all about Kingdom Health Services on the street, 919-FM. If you're experiencing pain, constipation, headaches, poor blood circulation, high or low blood pressure, diabetes, cancer, swollen or darkened feet, come visit us at Health and Wealth Lifestyle, located at 73 Eastern Main Road, Barataria, opposite Eastern Credit Union. We at Health and Wealth Lifestyle offer a wide range of services. Come and experience our new 3D analyzer, which allows you to have a look inside your body. We also provide live blood analysis, iridology, ionic foot detox with foot soap and foot massage, aqua therapy, full body massage and organic supplements on sale such as nano silver, nano zinc, body light, cold pressed sesame oil and more. Health and Wealth Lifestyle located at number 73 Eastern Main Road Barataria opposite Eastern Credit Union. For more information call 275-8359 or 288-1108. Join Nicole Huggins for Health and Wealth Lifestyle every Monday from 9.05 a.m. to 9.55 a.m. right here on the street, 919 FM. Renting a car in Tobago should be quick, affordable, and easy. Wow. Here at Oni Rentals, we make the process as simple as possible by using our easy e-sign-up. Yep, we can sign you up from just about anywhere using our tablets. See? All done. And everything goes straight into the cloud. Ah. Yeah, you're on your way. Are you coming to Tobago? Book your car rental with us and enjoy the most affordable rates in Tobago. But hurry, because cars go pretty fast. Call 361-1042. That's 361-1042. One more time, 361-1042. O'Neill Auto Rentals, Tobago. Taking you further. Dr. Livet. Join him right here on your radio every Friday afternoon from 5.05 p.m. to 5.35 p.m. for your dose of the health and wellness in a program that is sure to change your life. Popular for promoting Livet rather than diet, Dr. Livet has transformed a number of lives nationwide and is now live on the street 919 FM every Friday from 5.05 p.m. Tune in and also learn about the U-Juice to build your immunities and promote overall great health. Dr. Levette on the street 919 FM this and every Friday from 5.05 p.m. to 5.35 p.m. It's time that you live. Ultimate 
join Pastor Kelvin Heinerein and friends for The Way, The Truth, The Life Radio Ministry, a Church of God ministry, live on the street 919 FM from 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. This and every Sunday on the street 919 FM. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh to the Father except through me. John chapter 14, verse 6. For further information, contact 686-3845-349-5178 or 342-7303. All you all you Daddy Val, Cop, Bop, We say you wake up in the morning and you just realize can't even come back again. Alright, baby, that is not 100% true. But here is TSB at C. Sided alongside Iowa George presents Carnival Combat. Take Bamboo Gal, take Bamboo Riding Gal. Carnival Monday, the good again. This is Iowa George, the big boss of the business. Carnival Monday, the 28th, 3 p.m., Queen's Park Savannah, Carnival Combat. 3 p.m., Carnival Monday, Queen's Park Savannah, people. Young brother, I'm gonna be there live and live DJ. Are you coming to? Shake it properly. Uh, people, you need vaccination on entry. Come out in your Monday wear. Come out with your team from 3 p.m. till. Get your female tickets started at two hundred and twenty dollars. And meal tickets at two hundred and fifty dollars. With food inclusive. Get those tickets online at subtix.com. Also, book your cabanas. Two thousand dollars for groups of nine with coolers and food inclusive. All this happening. At the Queen's Park Savannah Carnival Fall Club Miss Yo, this is a girl precious representing from the Vienna. The live. Iowa TV and Street Street TV on YouTube. Share the live. The Street 919 FM. Miss Yo, this is a girl precious representing from the VNR show, and this is my co host, Roberto. And guess what? Carnival Monday, 20th of February, we're heading right here at the Queen's Park Savannah for mm-hmm. Carnival Comeback 2022. Mm-hmm. Giving away two tickets for Carnival Comeback 2022. Real easy thing. All you gotta do is call us up and sing any Iowa George song. Any song you actually know the lyrics to. Call and sing his song, and the callers will call. Call us and vote live and let us know which Iowa George impersonator they feel in the most and then they'll move over to round two. Of course, Friday is all about the trivia questions about Iowa George. So it's easy questions, easy thing. You, you're bound to know them. And then you get to win two tickets, male Ooh. and female, to come down here to the Queen's Park Savannah from 3 p.m. for Carnival Comeback 2022. Let me tell you something. When you see the boss in the stadium, you better come and vote for your place. <laughs> Time to shall the place Shall the place Tell shall the place Tell we shall the place We inside the half an hour for Carnival Comeback 2022 And remember we had two tickets to give away
fight it. Let we hug up and lift together as one. That's the vibes and energy we want inside the Queen's Park Savannah. Come Monday, Carnival Monday for Carnival Comeback 2022. For walking with a Kong Shed. Oi. <laughs> you like too much pain. You like my canal. Is that a bacana. Yeah, you know, you come out here hot and shred. Now for me to eat with a little I try to reel up people. And then I hear a call, I try to bust bubble now. I'm tell you something, you know, government experiment in this is that vaccination. I'm sorry, in terms of, you know, let me, let me drop out some people, people are complaining. This one, they're making money, it's possible that they want to do something well. And the government should try to do something, they call us an early addict You don't know that they come out so special, in terms of, you know, trying to run the road and have to control the environment. Yeah, yeah. You know, people are mad. You know, when it comes to COVID, it's no muscle. Special San Robert. Yeah, senior. I'm telling you, all them who complain, you know how much dress they went on that load and carry the thing home and spread the thing. They understand what I'm trying to say. But now they come up with a self righteous self. To talk about some bite of shilling that the government spent it, so they just have a little thing to, yeah, a little thing to circulate. You know, I don't go fast here to have such a robot. I feel like we'll be game on this. That is what we're talking about. No, real talk. Real talk. <laughs> real talk. I, I will talk. I can come and relax myself. Yeah. Okay, no, talk. And, and, Take and a day for yourself. Well, well, yeah, well, I'm yeah, 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 And I have a paper, yeah, so you know how high my shoulders are, me, right? <laughs> well, I, 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 it's for Cliffy Drive. Well, I'm for, for Cliffy Drive and take a rest. Hey, hey. I mean, I mean, yeah, yeah. since when? Well, we had Carnival 2020. We didn't have one last year. And they gave me a little, a little tea. A little time. Let me take it and enjoy I'm the gone. thing. I'm gone. Let me take the thing and enjoy the thing now. Oh gosh, food inclusive. You're walking with your belly in your hand. You're getting food. All you're doing is pack your cooler. Pick well, and I know you like friends. that. I know you like that. Pick and choose two friends. You want to you wanna enjoy this, this, this day with. And, and let's, have, let's have ourselves some fun. You're taking part in a lot of food, eh, Prashi? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Guys are treaty, you know. I know anyway, you like your belly too, eh? Anyway, treaty go to like to talk yeah. thing, you know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh I feel like it's a KMC because KMC gonna be there, yeah? Yeah. Kem, Kem, see how I vibe, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't, 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 don't sleep, don't, don't bet. Don't because they fight KMC for nah, somebody else. No, don't bet, don't bet on him. You understand you me? You play your bet, eh? Go ahead. Oh, bitch.
they watching too. I see man with a rung in a comb, I don't dare bargain. Let me see flag in the air, and rag in the air. People jumping, 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 throwing up their fear. Let me see death, fast, green, cast, ready, green, and all stars. One time, one time, one time. Tickets online at suntix.lam. Jadel is going to be touching the stage. All the man and them come out for Jadel. Yeah. 
2022. Definitely a safe zone event. You must show proof of vaccination, vaccination. and your mm -hmm. ID. It will be required oh, to yeah. be a part of this event. Like I said, I only see names being added to this cast. Papa, it's all kind of people passing through for this one. You miss this one. You're mad. <laughs> this guy's going to be there. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Push back, baby. Push back on Push back on it, go cry uh -huh. Push back, baby, push back on it. Let me go, go cry it. Malik, he's going to be oh, yeah. there, the, the, the younger one. Yeah. So guys, go on out and get the tickets. Where do you see Andy? Yeah. Where you tell him, I said, you're coming here, sit down. Yeah. I thought you was, you was playing music Play for the music. session. Oh, God. You're coming here. Oh, God. Oh, God. God, God, God. God. Where's he seen? We'll bring God in this. Where's he seen? I have to rest myself for yeah, Monday. Yeah, pop, pop. <laughs> you're resting up yourself for Monday. Of course. Oh. I'm dead over there. Wait now, I hear this guy going to be there too. Part of the mix. Carnival come back again. Also have a session for the Zessons. Mm. Go on out and get all your tickets. And you remember, you could rent your cabanas, two thousand oh, yeah. dollars, and it accommodates groups nine. of nine coolers Coolers. and mm -hmm. food inclusive. So what we're gonna do now is get into the uh, competition side of things. Yes. Because we have two tickets to give away. Yes, two tickets. Away. You get to call us up, sing any Iowa George tune, yeah. and then the callers would call and let us know. Which one of y'all was the best? Your name will go down on a list. And yeah. come Friday, 
those people who made it to, to round two, you get to answer a trivia question. And you answer correctly, the two tickets are yours, male and female. Male ticket is 250, female 220, and you gain it. You gain two free. Two free. Food inclusive. That's late them songs. Yeah, telling yourself, Robert, when you talk to George, say, uh, we want to give away two tickets. Just Come say, on. Let's see, you know, let's do what you do. Yes. All right, so let's see who's there. Good afternoon. Well, where is Papa? Papa. Where is Papa? <laughs> where telling yourself? I don't know, Precious and Robert. Good afternoon to you. Good Bill. afternoon. Good afternoon. You're calling to sing a George song? What's that, honey? You're calling for the competition to win two tickets? No, 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 well, I'm not going to be inside that. I just called to say hi to you all. Hi, okay. Lama, Lama. hi, mommy. <laughs> because it's a while I haven't spoken to you all. Yes, it's true. For the week? Yes, it's but it's true. Yes. Don't do me that again. We'll again. try that. Don't do me that again. We'll try that at all. Oh, Lord, I had a wonderful day on Saturday all year. Precious three mm-hmm. cake out for me, brother, you know. Papa, you better than me. <laughs> so, yes, my living God, you know, I really enjoyed that telling you, but honestly, and I'm sorry it was so far you couldn't have got some of my, my the food I cook, pressure. Wow. Hmm. I know you don't like that, that barbecue pig till and barbecue pig. <laughs> oh <laughs> gosh, girl, no do me that. No why is she? I will go. Precious, I don't go. But one of these days, I promise you all, I'm going to drop something there for you both. Honestly. Right? Okay, okay. We, we, we are waiting we are, for the yeah, moment. Yeah, yeah. We appreciate yeah. that right? talk. We good, we talk. good, we good. Yeah, Robert. Hey, mommy. So what are we all the kind of work shipping up at you? We good, we good at day. We getting ready for kind of come back on yeah. Monday. Yes, yes, and you know, I want you. That's a boy, you know. That's oh, a yes. boy, you know. Oh, yes. Papa. I made back in the last PNM fed for I you know, when they call him off the stage, I didn't keep business with me PNM, and you know, I started calling him, you know. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was, I was mad about it. Yeah. When I started he's singing, you know, you know, that was the, the that in the um, government campus wrong there. I started to call about it, only take him out and I was mad about this question. Oh, Lord. Mm-hmm. I'm telling you, I, I go back and I need to you know that. Well, all right, mommy, we inside the comp. We're trying to get some callers to call in and sing Iowa song because we want to give away these tickets. But you remember, we're not giving away the tickets one time, all right? Your name will go down in, in a list. Mm-hmm. And on Friday, you answer a trivia question. And see how that goes, all right? So we're inside the competition part now. Good afternoon. Mama, I'll take this Savannah. Mama, I'll take this Savannah. Savannah, Savannah. Uh, Panadol, we would on Panadol, we would on we would on Panadol, we would on you know, I love the honor to be special to a trip. I run the caribas, I run the caribas, I run the I got done with it. Hey, you know, you all right? Be good, be good, be good. I, I like to save some, the bathroom looking. You have a best bathroom in the dog, boy. Where's your one day? The best boy. Um, Bye-bye. 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 Bye-bye.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you are what? <laughs> <laughs> but wait now, are you playing down there on Monday? Yeah. Yeah, and you see and that. And you playing down there on Monday. And you will be playing. Oh gosh, I lost that call. Call me back. Call us back. Call me back. 3420081 and 4665391. Call us. Tickets are mailed to yeah, yeah, we gave to it, tickets, and yeah. we're giving away two tickets for this event. It's on Monday. Monday coming, the 28th Carnival Monday, Queen's Park, Savannah. The action kicks off from 3 p.m. Remember, if you already booked your cabanas, you gotta come down early. Pack your coolers in your cabana. Don't worry about food, food oh, inclusive. No. So Andy, we're going down with your belly in my hand. Yeah. Don't eat, don't eat on that day. I'm eating that Don't eat, uh, no, don't eat. Because everything I see, I, I want. Oh, God. Yeah, we will have a precious, we will have a precious. <laughs> you know what I like about the event, precious, is mm-hmm. that, you know, th- those artists will be coming in on big trucks, truck. big trucks. Uh-huh. Yes. Pop, pop. It's not a stage thing. It's, it's actual it's Monday. Monday. Carnival Monday f- atmosphere we create and mm-hmm. we recreate mm-hmm. in this thing and guys so and we, and we deserve it yeah after um COVID hit when 20 um 2019 COVID hit but it really came into Trinidad in 2020 and it yeah. really dampened the whole spirit right, yeah. of who we are as a people mm-hmm. they give us a little taste of the thing for 2022 we're gonna make the most of it oh yeah so you know once you're into the carnival and thing and you want a carnival like atmosphere you yeah. know we have any big trucks we have an artist passing through we have in free food all you gotta do is pack your coolers and come down no. put your hand in no 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 this is your Royal Castle Soccer Shop. You see right now, I want to see the bless. Mash up, mash up, mash up, mash up. So bless yourself. Bless yourself. One, two, three. I got to you. My gosh. 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 My and she made me chant on it, but I'm in the road. And she's going like she's crazy, but I'm in the road. That's all you're going on. You're going on. Samuel. Something Samuel. I ain't got the first thing. Oh, your phone break. You know, boy, Mr. Samuel, we'll just call you as that. If you're when you'll walk with your ID and... Yeah. So we'll see what's going on. All right, but your name going on on the list. Yeah, let me take your phone number there. Yeah. She, all right. <laughs> all right. All right, Mr. Samuel. Is it like that or not? Fresh. I'm telling you. We see if we get one more call. I want free ticket hour. I want us, I want us again. Oh, they don't want free ticket hour. Well, uh, we giving away one, you know. We one, giving away two, two male and female. Oh, go, uh, Eat your partner. Come on. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. What's that? But when it's free and they ain't calling. Hey. 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 Now we go. Get the whole place on you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, uh, and of course, this event is sponsored by TTT. Angostura Limited, East Side Plaza, and the Carib. Good afternoon, welcome. Hello? Hello, good day. Good, good day, day, honey. Good day. Where are you calling from? What's your name? I call it from Lavantel. Lavantel in the house, oh, representing you. Hey, Jen Jen, yeah. Jen Jen in the house. Hi, Jen Jen. Any Iowa, any Iowa tune you know, you go through. Let me put your name on this list. Hi, I'm a child, I'll say. <laughs> hey, when I went to Panorama, the stage was good. I come down for the mass, the stage was good. Even for Kini Carnival, the stage was nice. A paradise, it, it was, was a paradise. Hey, when I come down for Carnival Day, <laughs> and I hear the big jump to play. Tell them when me and my section touch down is trouble. Because My girl, <laughs> Papa, <I trot>. <laughs> <laughs> What's your name, honey? 
So your name went down on the list. Alright. Alright, so okay. continue listening on Friday. Uh, um once you're you're you are a winner on in rounds uh-huh. one, they go to rounds two and then you answer trivia and you song it like a property. If we ask you why is Iowa just favorite toothpaste, you song it like you know. But I mean, but I mean, she didn't take it on that. So that's not Friday, right, honey? All right, don't All right then, blessings to you. No, ma. So, guys, that's how we end it. We're going to go to our Royal Castle Soka shot of the day right now. I want to thank the arms recorders for calling in and participating. Here's more information on uh, Royal Castle Soka shot. This is your Royal Castle Soka Shot on the street, 919 FM. What goes in is a local something that makes it all, that makes it all taste better. It's the flavor of our culture. Come from here, come from there, and everywhere. It's the special flavor that's made to savor at the Royal Castle. Oh, oh, come the Royal Castle. Royal Castle. Flavor to the bone. Royal Castle. It's the very own. Royal Castle is the local something that makes it all taste better. Taste the unique flavor of our culture at Royal Castle. Oh, this is a crime. first restaurant in 1968 when that distinctive tempting aroma hit the air they just couldn't resist and like never before fried chicken with a special blend of local seasonings and a -a one-of-a-kind flavor down to the bone today royal castle still have that same delicious taste and i love it too the kids can't resist it either plus they have more to enjoy for me the castle is more than just nice food is we own part of me and you and is the real flavor of tmt that was your royal castle soca shot on the street 919 fm brought to you by royal castle our culture our taste
can be real. Hey. I try to fight the temptation, but I need to feel. Hey. Is that your profession? Cause you are number one. I can't I work over time for you. You make me come undone. I have a confession. So let me tell you for true. Yeah. I want to hold you and walk on the ground. I want to beat on the battle in ground. want you to call us up right now and oh, let yeah. us know which out of these three callers we had just now singing Iowa George's songs. You think should move forward mm-hmm. to rounds two. We cannot vote. No, we're not voting. We're nah, not, we, we make this thing. But I have my, I have my, um, we so make, my views income? No, your view income. We're making this thing as trans. I have my favorite possible. already. But so who we had in the competition? Panadol. We had Panadol. We had Mr. Mr. Samuel, Samuel. And we have Jin Jin, Jin, Jin from, Jin Jin from Love, Love Until. Until. Yeah. So call us up and let us know. No, the callers. And then we'll call yeah. and let us know. Well, let no, Andy. Andy, Come Andy on, no. Right no, Andy. Andy, oh, gosh. go outside, Andy. Go outside. So call us up and let us know. Out of these three who sang Iowa George's song, you think should move forward to wrongs two. All right, let's see who's there. Good afternoon. Welcome. Good afternoon to you, Precious Don Robert. Hi, Good afternoon. Love. The lady from Lavantil, of course. Hey. <laughs> All right, then. Thanks. All right, thanks. <laughs> Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Precious and Roberto. Good afternoon. The, one, the, the girl will sing from Lavantil. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> You're Lavantilian. <laughs> All right. Mm-hmm. That's, yeah, yeah, that's yeah. too so far for Lavantil. Oh, yes, I say call. And you don't come back here again and and unless you play music, eh? <laughs> Hold on, that's it, call. I can't take you. Good well, yes, afternoon, yeah, no. Yeah, yeah. Good afternoon, Come welcome. Bad vibes. Good afternoon, Precious and Robert. Swans. <laughs> the lady from love until, of course. Oh, oh yeah. Right, <laughs> Hello, good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon, Precious and Robert. Hi. Good afternoon. The, the, the lady from Love and Tell, Jin Jin. Jin Jin. Jin Jin. Panadol sing to you. Panadol sing. Mr. Samuel sing. Mr. Samuel sing. But let's take this, take this thing serious too, eh? You see Jin Jin come. Nah, Jin Jin sound real good in a way. Wow. And, and she pelt out the high notes too, yeah, eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. One more caller. One more caller. But that's a clean sweep there. Yeah, a clean sweep. You don't need an next caller. A clean sweep. Right. Let's take one more. Let's take one more to see if Samuel or Panadol will get some. One more, one more. One more. Caller to four. <laughs> we coming out of here four o'clock. Aisha Wells, she will come in from four to seven. Yes. And continue on. And she's the queen of talk, so she's going to be discussing all the issues. Person issues. At hand. Mm-hmm. This is the good vibes part of the thing. Yeah. Oh Lord, I see. So let me give you guys some information before we await one more call. I said we don't need it. Because clearly Jin Jin when she gone over to um the second two, round, yeah. But good afternoon, welcome. Yeah, good afternoon, precious and Robert. Hi. Hi. Yes. I said the young lady from Love until and then I'm panel. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. <laughs> Okay, so Jen Jen, congratulations. <laughs> we'll go over in on the list for rounds two. All right, so listen out on Friday to see if you are a winner of these two tickets for Carnival. Come back, you get mm-hmm. a male ticket and a female, female ticket. ticket. All right, I know the female ticket is for you, and I get to walk with your your people. Something, your, somebody, your people. somebody. Right? Aye, aye, aye. So you get to see and you, you, no, you no. remember and you. No Andy, no Andy. Oh, they say like salt? Is salt the same? <laughs> yeah, salt in everything. <laughs> like Wednesday between everybody. Good afternoon. 
precious. Oh, yes. I like the girl from Love and Tell. And mm-hmm. I sang for your birthday, and you didn't play my tune for my birthday, no. What tune is that? The same thing I sang for you. Which one is that? You couldn't remember? I remember. Oh, Oh, I, was I sang that yeah, for you. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Thank you so much. Let's imagine that. Precious, now you're actually here. You're welcome. Yeah. I appreciate it. Uh, she was in your party. Hello? She gone? Oh, gosh, thank so, you so, so much, honey. We try a whole party. We try a whole party. People call in and Come. sing. Mm-hmm. Hey, Precious, and you was when, in the party? A whole party. When now? That was on your birthday, Precious. Your whole birthday. That, yeah. that was how long we ago? We shut down the station. Did she say, did she ask how long ago? And she... We, 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 come down, man. we shut down the they, whole when station. When are they gone? I remember when are they again. You know? We didn't get cake so, and ice cream. We didn't get nothing. But we were supposed to go. We didn't get you and nothing. Mm. Precious <laughs> in the wrong location for we. <laughs> <laughs> was it mommy calling just now and said she get four cake? Yeah, she mommy get, get four cake. She get real party, not virtual party. She get real party. You see what she is? She came with. She came with. Not virtual party, real party. Love All right. it. Love going out to Michelle Sylvester. Michelle Sylvester is always locked hey. on. Big up to Michelle. She has a new song here with um, Ruel. It's oh, called yeah. Good Friends. Yeah. Good friend at the end of the day, you know? Yes. I love you at the end of the day, too, you know? Oh, girl, you want to hug now, isn't it? No, we're not hugging. Okay. COVID is still around. This is for me, but now. To play it like a minor Although you know we know I can take you all the time now You give me value and a value that I didn't know So you care about me and I will always care about you You never ever let me go Wasn't for you then I wouldn't know Where this river would go You make me feel like a winner, winner. You make me feel not a day will I ever, ever, ever go low, low. You make me feel like a day wanna. You make me feel like a winner, winner. You make me feel not a day will I ever, ever go low, low. This one is for me, good friend. This one is for me, good, good body. This one is for the good, good friend. You're like the hand on the long side. God put in my life that I'm on a show, show, show. When I saw the funeral, I'm feeling like a floor, floor, floor. You pull me, you pull me from the edge, oh, no. Take me down to lie about it, you don't know. And you, and you never ever let me go, no. Wasn't for you, then I wouldn't know where this river would go. Because of you, I find my body. You make me feel like a dead one. You make me feel. You make me feel not a day will I never ever go ever, low, low. You make me, you make me feel like a day one. You make me feel. To mentors and teachers who the business The siblings and friends who help you to dream big You pick me up when I fall down, down, down You took me in and you feed me when you can To all the preachers you feel well, my end of my Now show your love when you're done You make me feel You make you me feel You make me feel, feel. You make me feel. Stop by me. When I was losing my mind, 
shadow. And if I tell you about Rona, she's the hardest hard. She talks about the business owner. Interfere with big entertainer. All around the town. A man with a bank and sticking his tongue. She was stand a disease. I stay away from she for 14 days. She catch me again in the bad ways. I go on looking for sex. My hands keep a beat down when I'm in South Africa. of the VNR show. It was nice as usual. I have some information to share with you nevertheless before we get out of here, alright? There's no time like now to celebrate life and stay connected to loved ones. With Digicel, you get all the data, minutes, apps, and digital experiences you want, love, and need. Plus, chances to win the grand prizes of a flight, an accommodation to Miami Carnival, free groceries, or Digicel services for a year. You can visit my Digicel app for more information, all right? And remember, Digicel better together this carnival. Also, we are defending our culture at Sound Forge. Defend we must. Defend we music. Defend who we are. Come experience the Carnival Village at Sound Forge from February 22nd to the 28th. Seven days of live entertainment in a secure indoor and outdoor environment. We have soca, pan, calypso, food and drinks, carnival characters, and so much more. And most importantly, all COVID protocols will be observed. Proof of vaccination must be presented on entry. Tickets are available now at tickets.soundforge.live and at the Sound Forge box office. The spirit must live on as we defend the culture. All right? And uh, if you feel a little peckish, mm-hmm. you could go on down to number 79, Robert Street in Woodbrook, pick up a bacon shack. Yes, the Huddle after. Room presents uh, Maracas Bacon Shack. You can also get kingfish fries, shrimp, aloo pies, and delectable sauces to tease your taste buds. You can walk in, no scene. You can order with food drop, no scene. Or you can get parking lot pickup by calling 488-BAKE or 75-SHARK. And if you need catering, no problem. Send them an email at tastemaracas at gmail.com. It's all about Maracas Bacon Shop. Presented by The Huddle Room. Again, it's at number 79 Robert Street in Woodbrook, all right? And if you're looking for your new outfit to head um, to Queen's Park Savannah for a uh, carnival comeback on Monday, you need to check out New City Mall for premium selection of high-quality clothing and accessories for men and women. Save on all items with competitive prices and courteous service throughout the entire mall. New City Mall is located in the heart of Port of Spain with entrances at number 3 Charlotte Street and number 41 Independent. 
independence square and if you lower down walk into eastside plaza they have sale too sale on everything eastside plaza is located at number 32 charlotte street in porter spain all right so check them out and they need to go on a retreat let me hook you up doctors desmond and Anne gina phillips present a series of healing retreats from february 27th to sunday 6th of march at the eco resort in, to in toko which includes delicious healthy foods refreshing healing drinks learn diy healing techniques mini seminars and natural therapies price plans are for cost and full coverage excluding transport select your plans one day from 8 a.m to 5 p.m that costs 600 dollars uh one night one day from 5 p.m that costs uh 1100 dollars and two days two nights from 5 p.m costs 2100 dollars and the dates running from monday 28th of february to march 1st if you need any more information or to reserve a booking give them a call at 336-5441 so robert time to bounce uh, uh, yeah time to go time to get out uh, uh, we have one voice not to play now we have a voice not mm -hmm. really? I love your father, Precious and Robert. Oh, that's Kazi. Hi, Kazi. And of course, your mom, Wahida, always, always, always locked on. Always. You all have a blessed afternoon. The weather changing, Anna? The weather changing, face, but I feel. This pint glass, I wear it out here. Yeah. It's fully already weather outside. So, guys, we are here. Be careful. News coming up in a short while, all right? Oh, yeah. Me say you wake up in the morning and you just realize Carnival come What are you doing? Who does that? Monday, yes, Carnival Monday, 3 p.m. Queens Park Savannah. People, you need vaccination of entry. Young brother, I'm gonna be there live in the live DJ to be coming to Shell it down. In other words, steam it up! Yeah! Who does that? You alone! Bones on it like a trampoline. You! Yeah, he's a benza. Shake it from a leg! Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the ladies there, yeah. Carnival Monday, thank you. Yeah. KMS, TSP, and T.Sided, alongside Iowa George, presents the Carnival Combat. Simpsons Memorial Limited, number 63 Eastern Main Road, Laventille. Internationally accredited funeral directors and embalmers. A full-service funeral home serving families of Trinidad and Tobago and internationally since 1945. At Simpsons Memorial Limited, we serve with dignity in assisting families in honoring the memory of their loved ones. Our services include professional funeral and pre-planning, burials and cremation, custom-built and imported caskets, coffins and cremation trains, cemetery management, limousines, mourners' cars, grief counseling, web streaming of funerals, fully air-conditioned chapel with live musical accompaniment, full global shipping and receiving of loved ones. We specialize in facial restorations. Call us anytime, day or night, at 623-8688. That number again is 623 8688 Simpsons Memorial Limited. Superior service always with excellence. Take me to the king. I don't have much to bring. Season 22. <laughs> Defend <laughs> free culture. Thank God I'm free again. Oh. The 24th we come in to play. Oh. Song Forge, you know, is the place. So oh. February 24th, make sure I be there because they don't know it's a soca shell down a fear. Yeah, man, pretty sick. Season 22, defend we culture at Sound Forge. We spirit was live. Share the line. Share the line. Mystery 919 FM on Facebook and Instagram. Share the line. Iowa George on Instagram. Share the line. Iowa TV and Street Street TV on YouTube. Share the line. The Street 919 FM. News from the Street 919FM.com. Here's what's happening. Good afternoon. I am Vanessa Thomas with the 4 o'clock news on the street, 919 FM, and online Facebook and YouTube. In the headlines, a child dies in Beetham Fire. Calypso Rose cancels tour dates. WPC robbed at home by fake police officers and internationally Ukraine to declare nationwide state of emergency as fears of war rise. And now the news in detail. A nine-year-old girl reportedly died in a house fire this afternoon in Port of Spain. 
fire officers from the Rising Road Fire Station just before 2 p.m. responded to a distress call at 6th Street, 2nd Avenue in Beetham Gardens. When they arrived, they found the western side of the house well alight and were informed that the minor who was said to be mentally challenged was missing. Her remains were later found in the middle bedroom of the house. The child's parents and two other siblings are now homeless. The blaze also affected another dwelling to the west. Police is currently on the scene while fire investigators attempt to determine the cause of the blaze. Calypso Rose has announced cancellation of her tour dates for this summer, citing the COVID-19 virus and her health situation. The 81-year-old veteran entertainer made the announcement on social media earlier today. She said in the post that she had to cancel her tour dates this summer as the virus and her health will not allow her to come to France. Rose, who currently resides in Queens, New York, regularly returns to TNT in addition to touring. A WPC was robbed at her home by gunmen dressed as police officers. According to reports, the incident took place yesterday. Initial reports suggest the woman was confronted at her home by four men dressed in uniform claiming to be officers. The gunmen entered the house and stole a quantity of cash from relatives before pointing a gun at the woman and ordering her inside before escaping. Internationally, UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres told the General Assembly that the world is facing a moment of peril over the Ukraine-Russia crisis. A nationwide state of emergency is to be declared in Ukraine as fears of war rise. Ukraine's foreign minister has told the United Nations General Assembly that Europe is in the middle of its largest security crisis since World War II. The UN said this crisis was created and is being escalated by one side by the Russian Federation. It said Ukraine has never threatened or attacked anyone, adding that Ukraine has never planned and does not plan any such action. However, Russia's actions and statements are outrageous, horrific and go far beyond threatening Ukraine. In his address this week, Russian President Vladimir Putin overtly denied Ukraine's right to exist. And that was the 4 o'clock news on the street, 919 FM and online Facebook and YouTube recapping the headlines. A child dies in Beetham Fire. Calypso Rose cancels tour dates. WPC robbed at home by fake police officers. And internationally, Ukraine to declare nationwide state of emergency as fears of war rise. Do enjoy your afternoon and continue to be safe. Aisha Wells, the Queen of Talk, she's up next. News from the street. News from the street. 919FM.com. Yes. And Tobago, a musical showdown of medium and large steel bands from around the country, will take place on Saturday, 26 February from 5 p.m. <laughs> Center stage at the Safe Zone Carnival City, Queens Park, Savannah. Pantry and Vago, in collaboration with the NCC, presents a pan event musical showdown in the big yard. Big yard. See NCC's website or call the NCC office at 622 for grandstand and pawn group ticket details. This event is supported by Digicel and Angostura. Doctors Desmond and Angina Phillips present a series of healing retreats from February 27th to Sunday 6th March at the Eco Resort in Toko. This includes delicious healthy foods, refreshing healing drinks, learn DIY healing techniques, mini seminars and natural therapies. Price plans are for cost and full coverage excluding transport. Select plans one day from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. at $600. Monday, 28th February, Tuesday, 1st March, Wednesday, 2nd March, and Sunday, 6th March. One night, one day from 5 p.m. cost $1,100. Sunday, 27th February, Monday, 28th February, and Tuesday, 1st March, or two days, two nights from 5 p.m. That costs $2,100. 
Sunday 27th of February and Tuesday 1st March. For more information, reservations and bookings call 336-5441 or visit the website at www.npathlimited.com for online bookings. Empath for love and healing. Dr. Livet. Join him right here on your radio every Friday afternoon from 5.05 p.m. to 5.35 p.m. for your dose of the health and wellness in a program that is sure to change your life. Popular for promoting Livet rather than diet, Dr. Livet has transformed a number of lives nationwide and is now live on the street 919 FM every Friday from 5.05 p.m. Tune in and also learn about the U-Juice to build your immunity and promote overall great health. Dr. Levette on the street 919 FM this and every Friday from 5.05 p.m. to 5.35 p.m. It's time that you live. The Moss Gras. The Moss The Moss 2022. From the creative mind of Davlin Thomas. Deja Vu. Echoes of Carnival Coming. Presenting the finalists for the First Citizens Kings and Queens competition. 10 best of the best in Kaiso. With guest performances including Bungie Garland, Nadia Batson, Iowa George, Lyrical, Swappy, Fama Nappy, Skinny Fabulous, Blacks, and much more. The magic happens on the big stage at Carnival City, Queens Park Savannah. Sunday 27th at 7 p.m. Grandstand and Pod Posse tickets also available at NCC's head office and online at TicketGateway.com. For more information, contact the NCC at 622-1718. This event is supported by Digicel, Angostura, and TTT. The Mars Bra. The Mars Bra. Season 22. <laughs> Defend We Culture. Drop your keys and bow your knees For I am the notorious midnight rubber February 22nd to 28th I am here to defend my culture Season 22 I am here to introduce you to season 22 Defend we music We have soccer, we have pipe, we have calypso We even have the doubles man And sound for <laughs> culture lives on To make sure my culture lives and not just survive. Season 22, February 22nd to 28th at Sound Force. The spirit must live on! <laughs> Shop at New City Mall and check out our premium selection of high quality clothing and accessories for men and women. Save on all items with competitive prices and courteous service throughout the entire mall. New City Mall is located in the heart of Port of Spain with entrances at 3 Charlotte Street and number 41 Independence Square. We offer a variety of shirts, long and short sleeve, round and v-neck tops, vests, caps, hats, sunglasses, briefs, boxes, shorts, swim trunks, denim, Jeans, long and three quarters, socks, sneakers, casual and athletic, shoes, dressy and fashionable, dresses, formal and casual, skirts, lingerie, undergarments and a wide range of accessories. Come check us out as we also have clothing and accessories like Levi's, Clarks, Armani Exchange, Hollister, American Eagle, Ralph Lauren, Nike Air Force and Air Max, Puma, Adidas, Timberland, Academics, Aeropostale, Old Navy, Forever 21, Haynes, Dockers, Guess, Converse and so much more. We have barbers, hairstylists, as well as weave and wigs on sale. All at New City Mall. Like us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram. Sale, sale, sale. Me say you wake up in the morning and you just realize Carnival come What are you doing? Who does that? Monday. Yes, Carnival Monday. 3 p.m. Queen's Park Savannah. People, you need vaccination on entry. Young brother, I'm going to be there live in the live DJ. to be coming to shell it down. In other words, steam it up. Yeah. Who does that? You alone. Bones on it like a trampoline. You. Yeah, he's a Benza. Shake it from a leg. 
Facebook and Instagram. Share the line. Iowa George on Instagram. Share the line. Iowa TV and Street Street TV on YouTube. Share the line. The Street 919 FM. Hold 
it's lang. She want bamboo to touch in it. Yeah. Baby bamboo all in the road. After that, girl, we going home. Everybody moving and dying. Bamboo right in the combo line. Come Take bamboo, back. girl. Push back, baby. Uh -huh. Push back on the bamboo, baby. Uh -huh. Yeah. Push back, baby. Push back on the bamboo. That does it. Uh -huh. That does it. No. Push back, baby. Push back on the bamboo, baby. Yeah. Push back, baby. Push back on the bamboo, baby. Take bamboo, girl. A hundred and sixty five on YouTube. Let me say a very special good afternoon to you, the Republic of Trinidad and Tobago. How you guys doing today? Push back on the bamboo, it, baby. No, no, no. Push back, baby. Push back on the bamboo. Right uh -huh. Push back, baby. Push Good afternoon to those of you on YouTube. Bamboo, girl. Take Good afternoon to those of you on Facebook. to the people locking me down right now on Facebook. 210 people on Facebook. I met this, eh? Facebook, us how all you're doing today. Good afternoon to Diane Ransom. And Marie Solomon. Joyce Eric Eric Lestra. Maria Lyons. Denise Cummins. Christine Edward Farrow. The whole crew, big up all your whole self, yeah. Good afternoon to Earl, to Rudy Trudy, to Higher Sent, to Diane Payne, to Trevor Mischief. I know Michelle Superwoman is on the inside. Same dude in 1976. And the whole team, big up all your whole self. So much to discuss today. But before we do that, I'm going to remind you guys why we are heading to the Queen Spark Savannah come Monday. Remember, this program is going to be live from the Queen's Park Savannah on Monday. If you're not inside the Savannah, something wrong. Remember, Carnival, come back again. I'll be coming out with full teams on the outside to the Queen's Park Savannah come Monday. Yeah? The Fed care done. I turn up the fifth till it's an over. Male tickets are two fifty. Female tickets two twenty. It's food inclusive. I just wanna get this feeling only. Cabanas are two thousand dollars and it accommodates groups of nine. Coolers and food inclusive. Live performances by Shal Marshall. Jiger. KMC. Ding Dong, Swappy, Young Brother. All I want is, is a little more fed with you. All I want is, Don't forget the DJs is Elon Papi, Travis World, DJ Kevin, Artist Team Traveling, Poison Songs, Selector Kerry, much more to come. Remember, you can get your tickets online at suntix.live slash event slash the carnival comeback. Or you need to link 
Brandon in Arima for tickets on 278 6299. Brandon is going to advise you based on which area you're in where you can get your tickets, yeah? Remember, proof of vaccination and ID is required on entry. This event is sponsored by TTT, Angostura, Eastside Plaza, and Carib. Come out Monday where the whole team is going to be outside. All right, guys, so let's pick up where we left off yesterday, shall we? So, based on yesterday's programming, a number of things was identified. I took note of it, took stock of it, wrote down what I needed to write down, and I decided today we're going to take a look at solutions. Let me just say the cries of the people have not fallen on deaf ears. Hold on, I'm going to drink some water. Very good water. The cries of the people have not fallen on deaf ears. Hey, Melly Mel, love you, girl. Hugs and kisses. The cries of you people have not fallen on deaf ears. I understand your concerns. We have taken note of it. And we are urgently moving to address it. So, two things happened after I left the program yesterday. I had a, a conversation with my dear brother, Google. And I love that brother so much because he has a good heart. And Google means well. He's getting a little emotional at times. But the emotion is triggered by the fact that he is so eager to get things done that he takes it personal. If it does not go the way he expects or intends. And I'm hoping that is something we can address in the very near future. I laced with Sharon Felix last night, probably around after eight or so, maybe minutes to nine. I wake up the red woman, because you know she's be busy like a bee, between running her several businesses. Because Sharon is a woman that's mind she business. Eh? She's drink, she water, she's mind she business. And seeing about those lovely grandkids, I disturbed her time last night. Because I couldn't go to sleep with all this heaviness on my chest. And as I said to you before, and I'll say it again, I did not return to the p &M with any ill intentions. I didn't come back for deceit. I didn't come back for bacchanal. I came back to be part of the solutions. So, between Sharon and myself last evening, we decided that, you know what? We're going to reach out to members of the party to draft our way forward where publicity is concerned, getting them to come in for interviews, and highlighting what the government have been doing. You know... Sharon mentioned some things to me last evening about the challenges that this government is going through, eh? especially where the roads are concerned. But I don't want to talk too much of our personal conversation on radio other than we have heard you. We've heard you, we have heard you, we have heard you. And I am also going to work alongside Google to get the email addresses of the 41 members of parliament. We're going to send to everybody because Google is adamant about having everybody inside here. He wants to be fair. Personally speaking, I could care less to hear from 18 out of the, 20, out of the 41. That's just me. Personally speaking. But if Google wants to talk to all 41 of them, then I will respect that. And we're going to get their email addresses and send them official letters from his program, inviting them to be a part. 
As I said to him, I say, Google, not everybody does listen to radio. Sometimes they're probably busy. They didn't hear. Nobody didn't tell them. Don't feel no way if they did not accept the invitation to come through the open door policy. However, we're going to send them emails and official letters inviting them. And if after the letters and the email go out and we still running into problems, then something wrong. So I'm going to open up the phone lines pretty early. I am looking at solutions to fixing the communication breakdown between members of parliament and the constituents because most of the calls we got yesterday was from a constituent's point of view it was your constituents talking to you how can they serve you better it's service we're dealing with it is service we're dealing with and we have to find a way to serve I'm going to open up the phone lines. I'm going to take your calls, get you guys on the inside. So, call on your live. Sister, good evening. Hey, big brother. How are you? I'm all right. I hope I didn't make you upset yesterday. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Never. And I'm glad that conversation took place among the three of us. So, let me point out where it is really. I think we need some improvement. That is why when you ask for a poll, I give you Marvin Gonzalez. I heard... The princess from Princess Town. Because he don't have to change his gender. He already in Port Abini. So you know who we're talking about, right? On the Monday night forum, telling us, Wasa don't need an improving rate because they take the water from this alcohol they put it in the normal system and because of that. Right? And that's why Wasa in this expense. But I heard... The minister some time ago, Monsieur Rayevo, in the parliament, saying to us that these people extended the life of the contract of the Salcot. And have you heard anybody approach Padarat and ask Padarat if that is so? Because if they didn't do that, then Wasa would have been in a much better position. Now, if you understand all what we're on there and understand what we know with Wasa, then you would not have extended the life of the contract of this Alcott. Because mm. if you was interested in if you was interested in the, in the progression of Trinidad and Tobago, you would have made sure when you leave office that that would have been dealt with and this Alcott would have been no more. You know who owns this Alcott? The when my man, my father died. My father was building the Arangos Villas. And when they leave by here, they leave with guns, mushrooms, marijuana, you name it, he had it. Eh? Man of Muslim origin. Enjoy your evening. And that is what we do. You understand my point, sister? Thank you so much. There's a group of people in the media not there's a group of people in the media not doing what they're supposed to do. Because all now for should have been answering that question or the UNC should have been answering that question instead of showing it over to the PNM and making it look like the PNM is that they know what they're doing. Enjoy your evening. Thank you so much, brother. So let me send out condolences to the residents of Beatum Gardens. I understand there was a fire in the area today around 2 p.m. A nine-year-old girl perished at the fire. And I want to send condolences out to the people of Beatum Gardens upon the passing of this child. Caller, you live? Yeah, I sure was. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Um... Listen, when something is hype in a certain society, let me say in Trinidad, something hype. What is the main ingredient of something being hype? Like, you know, being in the consciousness of most people. Is it not the mainstream media? So when when when, when there's the CPL, you, you hear it on radio, you hear it on, you see it on TV, you know. And what, what we have in Trinidad here right now is two dynamics that is working against the BNM. Right, the full dynamic is what um, I think is Mr. Barataria just said it is where the media just simply would not put the positive stuff that the government is doing for whatever reason, right? But there's another dynamic 
with us black people and I might call and, and stick up in. Let's chat a bit. Mm-hmm. And you see that point you're making? Yeah. It is widely noticed. Mainstream no, media I, I, I does not, not a, intend uh, yes, to show the I good side of this government. Where I just say now, woman, I talking because I work in the media and I can tell you that that I have seen stories basically muffled. However, right? I want to also let you know that yes. there is a radio station that is state funded called TTT. There is I, I also radio that. stations and right. TV stations that are PM friendly, right. like 91.9. No. So, okay, what so, we so, have to do, one minute caller, mm-hmm. what we have to do is to look at strategies in order to get the message out there. We cannot pretend as though we don't know they're not showing it. We okay, know they're so not doing you, it. All right, so let me engage you on this, right? Um, when you speak about dictatorial governments across the world, what what do they do with the media, especially state-run media? They did what the UNC did from 2010 to 2015 with CNMG. Right. So early in the in the ten, in, in the um, in Dr. Rowley's tenure, he stated that he would not be becoming the UNC to govern in in, in so many words. And, and, and I understand what you're saying about getting it out there, right? I understand what you say about getting it out there. But what, as a communications professional, what I will say is this is how we do it. The PNM has a, a ground force that is unlike any other in this country, right? Now, every strata of society has been covered by PNM programs. If you're an academic person, you go to gate. If you are a person who have a tendency toward, uh, let's say, um, vocational study, there is that. In fact, I have an uncle who is a ace, um, he's a ace mason, and he had no papers to show for it. You know how we got papers to show for it? The PNM implemented something called a skills assist- assessment, where he went in and he showed them, listen, I am a mason of note. And now he has papers to show. So when, now that the government and this, this is another thing I would right with with um with NHA that energy AGC they are offering small contractors to build up to ten houses with a potential profit of a million dollars. Why aren't we speaking about these things? And and yes, I understand that government um, ministers need to come to the radio and all these things. But the second thing I was trying to get onto here is that we as PNM supporters need to stop making noise go into the programs and introduce them within our communities. Why aren't we doing that? Because you know why? We are not educating ourselves as PNM supporters as to what the PNM has. I have a degree because of the PNM. I am employable. In fact, I was once quoted by the BBC to come and work because this I was educated uh, with a, with a, a degree from London. This is, these are the things we need to get out there. So when you hear people complaining about um, we're not getting nothing from the government, you know as a PNM supporter, instead of calling on the radio and saying the PNM, you know, that doesn't sign on the laurels and the PR bad, you go find out. This is what the UNC does. Let, let me tell you something. I was with a few East Indian people the other day. And they, um, they don't care if it had PNM there, ILP there. They don't care if it had... Um, Whoever they, they, they making loud their UNC agenda, and it had people agree with them. I was not expecting to agree with them, and we are. I understand from. Thank you so much, caller. Let me take some more. I have a lot of people calling in and they cussing me, telling me they're not getting in. Let's see who's there. Caller, you live. Good afternoon, I said sexy. How you doing, bro? Yes, sweetie. I saw. Says yesterday, so give me a minute. Eh? I have a, a few to see. I shall one. Let me start by saying this, sweetheart. And <clears throat> good effort by you trying to, you know, you know, highlight what is the deficiencies in the PNM. I when I when I said that a couple months ago, people wanted to kill me on radio activists. Right. Are we willing to give up governance? Right? PNM supporters, PNM constituencies. Oil prices is as is right now at sixty-five dollars per barrel. Gas prices
prices are at four dollars and sixty cents MMBTU. There is a war about to take place in Russia. Sanctions are done being held. Um, started. The pipeline of Germany have cut the pipeline gas line agree agreement to Russia. So within now and the end of the year, oil prices and gas prices, gas prices, oil prices will be over hundred dollars. Are you all willing to give up that revenue, PNM people and PNM supporters and constituencies, to put it back in the hands of, <clears throat> as I just say, Alibaba and 40 thieves? You all saw what they did with the largest oil revenue. Who make you all feel they're going to do it any different? What you all going to give away? You all going to give away all of that for $1,000 of pension? and some crumbs off our table. So we had to ask ourselves a question. Are you all willing to give up that for the same players? And Roberts and Mrs. Bissess and all the, all, the, and all, all the characters are still there. I said we're $4 away from $100 a barrel of oil. Right? Solutions. The average man, one place, what has happened? The pandemic has created a loose and a standoff position with MPs in the PLM. We have to understand the black history is different. We are not really, we are not, we, 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 we situation is different, Aisha. We look for any opportunity to pull away ourselves from our community and stand off. That's just how it is because of our past and our history. What you need to need to do is exactly what I do. They just need to get back visible in the community, the pandemic, we have to live with it. Let people know the plans and the program. If you don't want to come out, you don't want to walk, you can drive by in a car. I saw so you could drive drive about in your car after your job here, I saw, with your glass down through your community in East Coast of State Spain and find out all the problems and the ills there. So why does MPs can't do that? You don't want to go and walk and talk in people's face. Right? People just want to see a cure and concern. And then... Because anything to end your eyes, I will call back. Anytime it's not going to work by trying to pave roads at the 99th hour coming down late in the year and think that they're going to pull people to vote for you, that do not work anymore. The work must start after Easter. So young people and people will see which will seem to be genuine and you get back your laurels on the chrome. And the same thing with the guy now talk about. Telling them about the programs and policies. But you have to be visible to whom much is given, much is expected. Aisha Wells and Sharon Phillips can only do so much. You all are the members of parliament. People voted for you all. They want, the, it's not even a matter of what they want to see. You. They want to see and see that you care. Being visible is to see that you care. And you have a listening ear. And then they, you say here, we're going to take from step one to step two to step three. And as I tell people, UNC is only three seats away from governor. Governor, there are six marginal seats. And as I say, PNM took take too long. And if, to start, Aisha, people don't want to know about betterment and whatever. People look at the responsibility, the roads of the government. There's three thousand plus potholes in the road. A pothole program should start, and it should start the rehabilitation of fixing. The roads, everybody has to use the road. From the poor man, the disabled man, the rich man, the biker, everybody. And as long as PLM has not been come, has not come back on the ground and get visible, they could drive by in the car slow. Can you know you are sure what you could do? It. They're going to lose the local election. And that so is going to be catastrophic and it's going to carry what it could be salvage. By showing that you care, and then you follow up on it. Thanks, Aisha. Well, you you enjoy your time. Enjoy your Thank you so much. I need to play some voice notes. I'm seeing you guys trying to get in. Let me play some voice notes. I'll come back to the phone lines. Good afternoon, Aisha. To bego in the house. To bego in the house. Aisha, you mean to tell me? You ask for a walk, and then when I give you the walk, you can't do the walk. I can't get pay on time. Then you look like you want to point fingers at the other worker who I had there before. Mine wanna fire the other worker because we were saying that the worker could not work. Eh? 
So now that I don't work from since December, I ain't getting nothing for Christmas. I don't know how I eat. December um January stepping I still ain't get pay. You must be fee sorry for me. And then you say, all right, let me get you a little caca that should go keep quiet. Now February we in February month and I still get pay. Still get car get pay, eh? You ask for the walk in Aisha and up to now I can't get pay for my work. Aisha, see workers. Up to now, these people and them can't get paid. And let it come and say it's PNM administrator straighter, eh? Because remind you, it's December 6th, them take over. They ask people to resign. You understand? And they they move out from the position that they're in and people can't get paid. So how do you see workers and them? eat a food, had to pay a rent and all these things. But now you're coming up and trying to play goody two shoes saying out now. Um I, I I said it to the administrator to make sure that you all get paid on Friday. You didn't know that all the time. But your so called one of your so called secretary demand that he get paid on time. Well I can't really reach where I'm going. I shan't they didn't say a word. Not a word. Hmm, I shall I locked on and listening, my darling. Thank you so much. Let me get some more voice notes in. Aisha Wells, good afternoon. Yeah, there you boy. Yeah. I don't know where your program is today, but I'm listening to when you come out. But I have my own little issues here. It's Andy Lyles or H. Lyles or everything. What about the young girl that he had, he had a fear with? How come... In this country, you're not hearing nothing about he concerning that case. But if as a little black boy do that, it on TV6 Monday, Tuesday, every day in the week, and the whole family going down in disgrace. What about Ram Logan and Ram Dean? What about, Ram, what about Modilal and Julian John? These cases are not coming up at all. So now it is that the law association are not bringing up this case. Where are they going on in this country, boy? So here we come just like Haiti. And who have money can talk, and who have money can talk. So and do, who do have money, making a jail, right? And who have money, lawyers there, they hungry like that, they like leech. They're fighting all in, the, in all the cases, and then they find the say that the man innocent. You see how we have it, Ish and Gamma Singh, them cases never come out. It's the same thing going on in Trinidad again. We had to realize what's going on here. We had to make a stand, otherwise, Trinidad gone through. It gone through. Because you can't tell me that this man had a fear, a ledge. It's just, it's a ledge. Everything is a ledge, you know. When them big boys and them do the wrong thing, it's a ledge. But when the poor man do something, it's not a ledge, right? So he is a big boy. H, right? He is a, he's a, he's a big boy. So we know how to take what they say. But if it's a little poor boy do that, he name on TV6. CNC tree and they're running it right through. Then he expressed it on the guardian. Yes, you raped this young girl. Yes, 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 he found this. But they ain't nothing about this fella here with this, with this, with this thing. So, therefore, now that we know how to take that shopness right through. You see, the law associated in this country, they're corrupted bad. I don't care nobody say they're corrupted bad because they can't tell me this man do this thing and the case can't come yet. Well, they waiting until the man dead for the case to come up so the young girl will get big. A big big woman and he dead and gone and he gets you outside and he make no jail. That we tell him tell him the law association in country so man come the man something wrong with me and we had to take that by right you boy go come let's say she have a bunch of lawyers I know no see where come let's say she have a bunch of lawyers I know who the lawyers is I sure when the circuit was given the I'll put lines in the cell cut. You have one line running. We're going to tie into the industry in Point Pieces. And the other line was going to tie into the Wasser grid system. So that was from since day one. Good afternoon, Aisha. Good 
afternoon to you, my lady, young lady. I, after you all do that, and they did not come, I will want to know the reason why they are not coming onto this radio station. A very important radio station where most of their listeners or their people just be on this station. I would like to know the reason why. Okay? That is what I would like to know. You know whether this take us for granted because many of us no matter what, we will talk and want them to do this and want them to do that, and we will. I, I remain happy in it. Okay? I will not change my shoes. I will do just as the UNC people doing. No matter what, their heart ain't going nowhere else. And it's time African people think the same way. No matter what, don't go nowhere else, people. Don't go nowhere else. But you see, these things have mostly happened to people who want something from the government and they didn't get. Or who like a party because they want something. And I know there is many of us out there doesn't look for anything but the love for our party. We stand firm and we stand strong. Okay? Many of us. And this is what we want. When they talk their lies, PNM have to come up immediately after and speak the truth. But nobody doesn't say nothing. They just stay quiet. And as soon as they put out their lie, people believe in what they're saying. You know, this is what I was saying. So just as how they continue to have meetings for five years. Almost years since wherever they're having the meeting. Just as they continue to do that. Call are you live? Call are you live? Hi, Aisha. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Aisha, PNM, whoever is the PR, the head of the PR, Miss. Lisa, Lisa, however, she name it, she needs to go. I um, Avina, she's in charge of um, social media. He needs to step down. They need vibrant people. They need young people. They need our bloggers need to come out. When PNM have a meeting, instead of just talking on on social and um, radio, go on the the Facebook when PNM have a meeting and and Dr. Rowley them talking and support the party. Come out and talk. Where your jersey? Come out and support the party. And some of them deadbeat who don't want to do nothing. All you sit down. All your old head, like Mr. Hines, you no longer supposed to be no youth officer or whatever. Time to put young people. I could see Marvin Gonzalez as the new prime minister, supported by um, Foster Cummins and men like. Stuart Young and Mr. Richard Stum Point and, uh, and even the man from Tonatuna and Mr. Monroe from Toko, all these people. You understand? Thank you, Han. Okay, so let me, let me come again because I don't want us to go down the same road we went down yesterday. I don't want us to start off on a bad footing. I heard everything I had to hear yesterday. And as I said yesterday, I will advocate for no one to lose their position. Not Laurel, not Mr. Hines, not Avinash. I am willing to work with all of them. Sometimes some people just need a little push. They need a little engagement. They need a little involvement. They need a little, you know, advice. So to call for people to be rid of their position or to lose their position, it's not my, it's not the road I want to take. However, I've heard you. Your concerns have been taken into consideration. And we want to do things differently. So I want to hear how can the lines of communication increase? 
what do you want them to do differently i already know what the problems is we talk about that for three hours yesterday i don't want to dwell on problems today i want to deal with solutions all right let me play a voice note and then we take a break and we come right back aisha was good afternoon aisha was it's so sickening to hear people talking about we don't need nothing aisha was in every community there's things to be done things that governments come and go promise to do street lights road road repairs pavements for children to walk on you understand bus stops different things it have a lot for the government i'm not talking about handouts but when people come on your program and say we spare them and we don't need nothing all these aliens are all these all these, all these, all these slaves the only people that work or or, or give everything they have, sweat, tears, and blood for nothing, was slaves. So when you see you working and you paying taxes and you doing certain things and the government is in power, you can't come on the radio every afternoon, Miss, Miss Indian, walk or whatever your name is, and talk about, you understand? Because you're a CPAP worker, you just, you just always talk about the CPAP worker. So I understand where your, your, your mindset is, you know? You don't see nothing more than CPAP. But at the end of the day, there is a lot to do in Trinidad and Tobago in these communities. Oh, no. The views expressed are not necessarily the views of the management of this street. 919 FM. service funeral home serving families of Trinidad and Tobago and internationally since 1945. 
At Simpsons Memorial Limited, we serve with dignity in assisting families in honoring the memory of their loved ones. Our services include professional funeral and pre-planning, burials and cremation, custom-built and imported caskets, coffins and cremation trains, cemetery management, limousines, mourners' cars, grief counseling, web streaming of funerals, fully air-conditioned chapel with live musical accompaniment, full global shipping and receiving of loved ones. We specialize in facial restorations. Call us anytime, day or night, at 623-8688. That number again is 623-8688. 83-8688. Simpsons Memorial Limited. Superior service always with excellence. Take me to the king. I don't have much to bring. I don't have much to bring. Hi, I'm Valentine Garcia. And I'm Nikki Garcia. Please join us on the final hour broadcast every Thursday at 9 a.m. on the Street 919 FM radio. Every week we will journey into the amazing word of God. So please join us. See you then. There's a new taste in town. Maracas Bake and Shark at 79 Robert Street in Woodbrook brings you bake and shark, kingfish, fries, shrimp, alu pies, and delectable sauces to tease your taste buds. Walk in, order with food drop, or get parking lot pickup at 488 Bake or 75 Shark. Need catering? No problem. Call or email tastemaracas at gmail.com. Follow Taste Maracas on social media for all the delicious details. Taste Maracas, the new taste in town. Corner of Roberts and Rosalino Street. See you soon. Me say you wake up in the morning and you just realize Carnival come What are you again. doing? Who does that? Monday. Yes, Carnival Monday. 3 p.m. Queen's Park Savannah. People, you need vaccination of entry. Young brother, I'm going to be here live and alive. These y'all to be coming to shell it down. In other words, steam it up. Yeah. Who does that? You alone. Bouncing it like a trampoline. You! Yeah, it's a benza. Shake it from a lady. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. Ladies, yes. Can you buy one day? Thank you. Hear this, TSP at T dot sided alongside Iowa George presents the Carnival Combat. Join the winning team with Pastor Alkaline John every Monday from 10.05 a.m. to 11 a.m. and every Wednesday evening from 10 p.m. to 11 p.m. live on the street 919 FM as he talks about La Vive, the power of five fruits, one of the most powerful antioxidant supplements on the market today. The five superfruits in La Vive are mangosteen, acai, pomegranate, gogi, and nuni. These fruits have a positive and profound impact on human health performance and disease. Listen to Pastor Alkaline John every Tuesday at 9.05 a.m. and Wednesday at 7 p.m. on the street 919 FM as he gives live testimonials of the Laviv healing powers. To get more information, you can contact Pastor Alkaline John at 516-286-7079, 516-286-7079. Seven zero seven nine, or you can visit his webpage at www.alkalinejohn.com. Season twenty-two. <laughs> Defend free culture. Let's give it up. Make some noise for David. David. St. James Carnival Monday night. Tickets available at the Songforge box office or tickets.songforge.live. See you there. Season 22. Defend We Culture at Soundforge. We spirit was revived! For more info, call the hotline at 33Forge. That's 333-6743. Every Friday. It's all about Firewood Soccer Fridays with MCU Consider Takochi from 6 straight to 9 p.m. Blazing all the latest and past soccer hits. So remember, make it a line, make it a day, rock and come in, you know. It's all about Firewood Soccer Fridays on the Street 919 FM. You don't know. Renting a car in Tobago should be quick, affordable, and easy. Wow. Here at Oni Rentals, we make the process as simple as possible by using our easy e-sign-up. 
Yep, we can sign you up from just about anywhere using our tablets. See? All done. And everything goes straight into the cloud. Ah. Yeah, you're on your way. Are you coming to Tobago? Book your car rental with us and enjoy the most affordable rates in Tobago. But hurry, because cars go pretty fast. Call 361-1042. That's 361-1042. One more time, 361-1042. O'Neill Auto Rentals, Tobago. Taking you further. Police, good day. Offer some best price here. Johnny Q Auto Parts Division? Yes, sir. I'm here to investigate an assault on batteries. Excuse me, sir? Is it true? You have batteries selling for $488? Yes. Power Master, Optima, Vata, and Megastar batteries. So I can buy a battery for $488? Yes, sir. For cars, trucks, and boats. Backed and distributed by Massey Automotive. Which part? Right here at Johnny Q Hardware and Auto Parts Division. 15 Arabita Avenue, Woodbrook. And our new Johnny Q Superstore. Located at Lowlands Mall off Claude and highway in Tobago. You could call 60 tools. All right. Thanks, boss. <laughs> nah, man. Granny. Do you have $488 to lend, man? Tune in to The Street 919 FM every Thursday from 10.05 a.m. to 10.20 a.m. for the program Straight and Narrow, The Way of Life, The Health Store, being brought to you by Mrs. Arlene Collins Mohammed. For more information, check us out on Facebook or Instagram at Straight and Narrow or visit our website at www.opulence.com slash Arlene for Life. You can also call or WhatsApp at 309-469. Seven or 6209379. Julia, how are our daughter bright so? What you mean? Kelly's so young and already talking about when she gets her first job taking out a mortgage with TTMF at 2%. She knows about 2%? Yes. 2% with no down payment as a first time homeowner and the lowest rate on the market. We would not have to dip into our savings to set her up. Where she get all this brains from? Her mother, of course. TGMF. From here to home. The deals are at East Side Plaza. Located at number 32 Shannon Street in Port of Spain. It's a sale on everything at all stores. Opening hours are from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. Everything from food stuff, lunches, pottery, African wear, Christmas gift items, tailor services, hair salon services, and so much more. Everything means everything. Head into Port of Spain and check out East Side Plaza at number 32 Charlotte Street. Turn your lights down low and listen to the master's radio. The Church of the Firstborn Assembly of Numbers 399 Eastern Main Road, Guayco San Grande, is pleased to present Pastors Morris and Agnes Johnson and guest Sundays, Tuesdays and Friday night, Sunday Ministry of Worship, Children Hour and the Word from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. Tuesdays, see Jesus in every book of the Bible from Genesis to Revelation. Tuesday morning from 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. And Friday night, 9 p.m. to 5 a.m. All night prayer for our nation. Tell your neighbors, tell your friends, tell everyone. For further information, visit with us at www.churchofthefirstbornassembly.com Dot org, or on Facebook, email us at church668hope at gmail.com or call us at 753-1113 or 236-7271. Your free gifts and offerings will be greatly appreciated at Church of the Firstborn Assembly, account number 795222 at the First Citizens Bank. Get in touch with God. Share the line. Share the line. The Street 919 FM on Facebook and Instagram. Share the line. Iowa George on Instagram. Share the line. Iowa TV and Street Street TV on YouTube. Share the line. The Street 919 FM. All right, people. We are back. We are back. Thank you so much for staying with me. Yeah. It is approximately. Five minutes after the hour, five o'clock. There is a protest action taking place in Dago Martin. 
information just reaching us. I want to pause for a cause. I'm coming back to the topic at hand. I'm coming back to the voice notes. But I want to touch base with those down there in Diego Martin to find out exactly what this protest action is all about. Hello, good day. Hi, good afternoon. Thank you for being on air with us. You're live at 91.9 with Aisha Wells. Could you tell us who we're talking with? Yes, we can with Patrice. Hi, Patrice. We understand that there is protest action taking place in your area. Could you give us a little more information? Okay, well, um, this um, it's with two brothers, right? So, Dari Potolo and Ojari Potolo. They were police. Police came on Friday, last Friday, and said the um the house warrant to arrest them for the triple murder that happened on Cemetery Street. Right? So they detained them, they took whatever they have to take whatever they have to take, and it's only yesterday to send a notice. Now we don't know we don't know what's going on. They had the the interview with homicide and everything, right? So they took their arm, um, took, it's only yesterday we got a letter that the matter was to go and get out to the DPP. And the DPP, um, in, in Port of Spain, under sanit- sanitation, that's what it says, so that's to go south. When they go south now, to my knowledge, right, it's alleged that the DPP never even view the case. Because when we think when they get charged, as they told us, we know he, we, 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 we get, we, it is alleged that they're not charged. Right? Now, this is something stemming from some years back with this particular family and the Potolo family. And it, it's just unjust with what's going on because they have their witness, they have the alibi that it was home when this happened, and they never. Listen, here where it is really going on. This, this person in question, Mr. Springer, he will stand as a witness in the Portillo family. Um, there, it was a, a murder. The Portillo brothers, who are now detained in this pre- present situation here, their younger brother, brother, who is now deceased, he himself stand as a witness in a case with him. And they came nine and a half years after, and he won his case, right? He and five others. So this person in question, Mr. Springer, he is now accusing two other brothers from the same family. That Wait, one minute. Let me see if I could get this right. One minute. Let me see if I could get this right. Mm-hmm. From what we, from what you're explaining, this this is one family dispute that is happening, right? Several different mm-hmm. murders and one family dispute? Two families together. This is, this is the Springers and the Portillo. But they are the same family, correct? They're family members. No. no, they are two different families. Or oh, two They're different the families. families. Okay. And, yeah, right. and Springer. Now, the Springer family is, 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 is in concern to the 15 year old boy who was a part of the triple murder in Diego Martin. I think that would have happened, what, 5th? two weeks or so ago? Yes, February on February 5th. 5th. February 5th. Okay. They hold, they held the brothers in connection of that. And they stated that the brothers, along with two others, they were a part of it. But the other two, they were released, and they are now putting the murder charges on the two brothers. And the two brothers only, right? right? The same individual said he see these four and fellas. Yes. Two, two got released, and the charge too, which we don't understand. And this man was a witness in the before the before. Um, thing before. And he was not, um, a, uh, a, what, what did it say? He was, he was a, a, he, a, credit, a, credit a creditable a um, witness. witness. Yes. Right? Because they got, they got, they got released. Six okay, seven. so he's he's one minute. So he's whip, he's a witness now to what he said happened recently, and the police have detained two persons. What did the DPP say in the matter? Well, we so yeah, yes, alleged know. that the DPP don't even has not even seen the matter. That's what we yeah. found out. They so the persons know. have not yet gone to court. No, they, they send a paper. They send a paper case. saying that it was a charge paper. That is what we were we were told, and that was the charge paper that they were charged for murders. But when we present the paper to somebody who is knowledgeable, knowledgeable of the law, the lawyer he said that 
that is not their charge paypal so we are confused if they are really charged with the murder or not because nobody is aware of the situation so where are they now they, one is in Carinage Police Station and one is in St. Ojari Portillo in Carinage Police Station or Dari Portillo in St. James Police Station. So did you guys get a lawyer? Yes, we do. We have a lawyer right now. What is the lawyer saying? Information right now to them. They We're basically. not getting everything. So that's why we go and we, the family, doing what we have to it's do. Really because catchy. we just find things that happen in fast enough it's and not the not notice is a are saying it out plain it's a frame piece because they have the alibi how come well they still charge two brothers with something and it have people are wrong it wasn't even family who gave the statement to homicide they understand the it was only family and all they still charge the only same they only charge them for me though. so how many people was in the protest today and how long is the protest action going to continue with that said we don't know because up to now, we, 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 we say, I don't know, we don't know what's going on. So that's why we come out and, you know, put in our wood out there because it's unfair. We so need help. It's not, it's not fair. We need help. We're trying to understand how somebody who stands as a witness to a murder some years ago, this is these people, five, five um, people aside of Odari and Odari's brother, Chike Fosilo. Why it is that he had to spend nine and a half years in jail, innocently, and released, and won his matter. And this same person who said that they saw Chiki in those that in that e- that event, he is now standing witness and saying that he is now seeing, he has no saw to his other two brothers in a murder. How you alone seeing all these brothers? Why are you, you doing that? Say then you say something different. They were, yes, sorry, it's not adding up. up. It is not adding up. Okay, so um, I understand the first wave movement was a part of the protest with you guys today? Yes, it yes. was. Are they also highlighting the issue? Yes, yes they, they are. are. They, we did a live with, with him. Yes. And we reached reaching out to all the newspapers, anybody that could have had a newspaper was up here also because we, we, need, the, we need that because this, this is not it fair. It is unjust. It's not fair. It's unjust. All right, so I'm going to take your closing comments. We'll continue to monitor what is happening down in the Dago Martin area. Closing comments? Well, we just need help. We just want any authority that could be able to stand and at least dig into this investigation and let Definitely. us see if we could get a, a little bit of feedback. Yes, we need we some need information some and we need not just no answer. We're not getting it. It's not adding up. There are a lot of missing pieces. Please, guys, we really, really need help. We Thank really need that. We cannot wait for this to go any further. And anybody who knows... How can, how can those in authority, how can the people you're asking for in authority get in contact with you? Well, um, they... Well, I have... Um, um, we doing certain, on, certain things on the end with... Um, what's the part we got in wave? Yes, the, the movement. Right. The first wave movement. movement. So they can contact okay. first wave movement? Yes, right. they can. So, Yes, you could. And he's directing us exactly what to do and how to go about it, the corrupt way, the legal way. Because we don't want it to seem any By other way. Yeah. yeah, because we just want to be fair. We want them to have a fair, fair hearing. hearing. All right. Thank you so much. So anybody Thank wanting you. to assist this family with information can contact the First Wave Movement on Facebook. Thank you guys for talking with us. Thank you very You're much. Welcome. Thank you. All right, you know, we bring current affairs to you. So we got the information of the protest taking place. Just wanted to know what it was all about. Now, you know, let's get some voice notes on the inside. Let's go. I share on one more thing. One more thing. But all the little issues with the PNM and, and, and uh, not meeting the grassroots and this, all, all this kind of thing. The PNM is the best choice and will always be the best choice. From 1956 to now, PNM is always the best choice to run Trinidad and Tobago. And at this present time, the PNM is the best choice. There are no other political party to run Trinidad and Tobago. Right? One more thing, I heard Tabaki um, told Google that if um, the UNC leadership change, that the PNM can get around. I sure I don't believe that. 
Right now, the UNC has no leadership. When I say leadership, it has nobody in that party have leadership skills. Who? If you let the one do, um, Kamala out, but when they put out Kamala, who they put in to take over that party? There is nobody in the UNC with leadership skills. Well, it's better they put Rodney Charles on the UNC who Padarat the, the MP for um, Princess Town. Better they put them to run the UNC. There is nobody in that party. So, waste of time. PNM is the better choice. Jump high, jump low is the PNM. Good afternoon. Politicians have to realize on both sides, all politicians, that the days are the 1956 and 40s politics that done. The youth and them eyes opening wide daily now. Everybody seeing and understanding what time minute it is. So politicians and them need to get a new playbook. That 1940s and 50s politics tactics ain't working in 2022 and beyond. Trust me. Trust me. So, yeah. The majority of these politicians and them too stuck up. Not all. The majority. I could count the ones that don't tilt on my hand. One side of my hand. But the majority of them, they too stuck up. And that is the problem. And at the end of the day, whether PNM win or not, next election come 2025, them in really business, you know? Because all of them know where they bread butter on both sides, right? And we as the, 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 the grassroots, as they like to say, had to understand that. You dig? Let's see who's on the outside. Caller, you live. We have a sister and going out trying to reach you. Assalamu alaikum. How are you doing? Hi, all right. I'm back for. Um, Miss Welcome to Morning Mayor. When I'm going to take off our bed, I'm going to take off our bed. And we are right here. Um, you know what I'm talking about? You traumatized. Ms. Wells, um, could you give some advice on that area, like domestic violence? Um, hey, you see that? Back for you there? Not there. Call are you live? Aisha, how are you? I am good. How are you? Not too bad. Aisha, listen up. I, I heard the, the interview that you had just now. But I want to let you know, sometimes the Lord has have to take its course, right? You have a certain amount of hours that you can be arrested for a particular crime before, well, at least taken into custody before a charge is actually placed upon you while investigations are going on. That is our law, right? And if for that, you cannot really do much. So this is why the family might be finding it hard to get things that they, they find things taken too long or whatever. But until they work out all the missing pieces to find that adding to this story, it's going to remain as it is so that until the time runs out, that where it is, they can actually keep them in the station. And right now, I'm sure they're gathering information as well as evidence. Because even you know that, even with a witness statement, sometimes it's difficult to be able to uh, finally prosecute someone for murder, especially without hard physical evidence. So, now going on from that, the issue with... I, I would like people to understand something. I heard the gentleman mention about we didn't like this 1922 politics, but after heavy, having heard your friend yesterday called Heavy talking about why they don't do like Kamala and um, come in the boots and come down to the people. Now, that is 1922 style politics because I don't know if anybody remember, but when we had a big flood in the United States of America down in New Orleans, Mr. Obama hasn't reached there up to today. Because you don't need to go 
at the location to make people's lives better or easier. Because I should come, Aisha, and tell you, oh gosh, Aisha, sorry this happened, but um, hold a little bag of food now. And you know what? That's it. And you tell yourself, oh gosh, that was so nice. But then what did I really do for you? What have I done to make your situation any better? I don't know about anybody else, but I would rather people put something into policy that will help me get over the issue that I am facing and beyond. Instead of giving me something, give me a mattress in a flood where I can't put it in the water so it has no purpose to me. Give me food to cook and my stove mash up. So what am I really getting help with? What am I being, what is being done for me in any positive life? And unfortunately, Trinidad still is in 1922 politics because we are not moving forward from that backward position. We need to have government as the present one to make changes. As you see what it is, the conversation he went with away. To make changes to benefit and better the, the country in the long run as well as the present. Just like when he did and he made the instead of the six percent royalties we were getting, and it's now twelve point five percent. When it is the opposition, you tell them don't go because they will make the people don't invest in the country and who here pull out. And nobody pull out and more people came. So we have to have that type of governance to be able to have the testicular fortitude to go before the big wigs in the international medium and tell them, listen, this is what we need, this is what we would like, and it's time we start treating with respect and fairness. So, with that said, you all take nonsense from what is right thinking, and let's see how we can go forward. Aisha, have a nice day. Thank you so much. Let's get some more information inside. Let's go. Hey, Aisha Gadi. I find that too much at times, Mr. Bego always calling or sending voice notes to this program and spreading one set of propaganda. Why should I, why should I say before before the Tobago election in December that the the P the P and M hire over hundred CPEP new CPEP workers and they had no funds to pay them and poor Farley now had to find money to be able to, to sustain them out of three payments or they collect two already but you come on the radio station to spread propaganda miss me with that very interesting caller you live Mr. Bigel can defend herself yes caller Go ahead, Baratari. Are we hearing you loud and clear? Baratari, we're not hearing you. Feel free to call us back. Call are you live? Yes. Hi. I'm calling, <coughs> referring to the guy who called and said about um, Obama didn't go to New Orleans. He got it wrong. Obama wasn't a president at that time. It was President Bush. Hello? Yes, caller. Yes, it was President Bush. So he got it wrong. And Bush did go and visit New Orleans in 2005 with Katrina. So he got it wrong. But anyway, I want to say, some of the laws that they have in Trinidad today worked it back when PNM government had just started. It's not working today. They need to revamp the system. Because some of those laws, the British don't even use it. They, 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 they outdate those laws. So Trinidad needs to step up and update the system because what they think was working back in the 50s and 60s is not working today. It's a different generation. That's my take on all of this, what I'm saying. Thank you so much for sharing. Thank you, Aisha Wells. Okay. You think you're looking for solutions, Aisha? Aisha, the solution is right before the pain. I'm eyes and they know that. I sure the public servants are still advocating for the public servants. They are angry at this point in time. And majority of them who I have spoken with said that they were withholding their votes. They're not going to vote for no local election. And one will say that the public servant is greedy and we need to study money, 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 and then you want money. 
I just, the public servants have people have personal problems who have their loan to pay, who have their house and they have been good toiling the, the soil and they have going the extra mile, Aisha. They entitled, this, this is money that they're asking for that they worked for. No, it's not something that they are asking for that they didn't work for. And it, one will say to justify why they should get a raise in salary. Aisha, I employ you, Pastor Google, Baratire, to go and invest. If it's what I'm saying is true, is it that is it true that it's a certain um, body, security body, is still ha still have contracts with the um, prison service? Are they clearing, carrying, um, escorting inmates or prisoners, or you want to call them, towards the to, to the um to the hospital and clinics and so forth? I got that from a good source, from a good friend of mine, and he said he told me how much they are receiving. You or what you want to find out how much you are receiving per day for the small maxi and per day for the big maxi. Aisha, people ain't making that in, in, in a month, the kind of money they're getting per day. So you can justify paying public servant. That is more than enough money. If you save that money and you, and, you form, and you find some other form or mean of transportation, you can afford to pay the public servants and everybody at double or triple their, their salary. I'm telling you. Thank you so much. The lines are open. Caller, you're live. Good afternoon. My brother, Tabakit. Well, I'll tell you why I call. <laughs> good, good afternoon. I was sitting down here drinking water and minding the UNC business. But when they call me, the caller who called me, look, I decide it's PNM people business, so I was going to sit down. I went and drink punching and mind the PNM business. Let me tell that caller something. Mr. Gentleman, today or tomorrow, Kamala Posad, the sister, is not the political leader of the UNC, which, let me say this, eh? that's my political leader, and I accept her still. However, let me answer. If today or tomorrow, the Honorable Kamala Posad, the sister, is not the leader of the UNC, let me give him to put this in his pipe and smoke it. We ready? There is people on the outskirts. There is people, the UNC is ready, ready. There is people who will take up the leadership. And I have news for you. The writing is on the wall. The first thing we started with is the local election in this November coming. And you see, 2025, hear me, brother. The writing is on the wall. You know, long time they tell you go and cut a tambourine wood, which sprung, and you get a song cocktail. That is sure, like the sun that does rise on a morning. I tell you, read Kabaki Talim. I was sitting down drinking water, minding the business. But since you call now, I had to drink punching and mind the PNM business. So to you, caller, who say Tabaki is saying this, Tabaki telling you, we have leaders, we have brilliant, competent minds in the UNC who will lead that party and lead us into victory come 2025. So put that in your pipe and smell it because drinking punching and minding the PNM business. Tabaki out and over. Wow, wow, wow. Tabakit on a roll. He's on a roll. Aisha, good afternoon. Um, I have to say, the PNM treat their supporters with disdain and arrogance, and they try to win Indian hearts and minds, which they will never do. I shall ask good day. Listen to me. Be talking about solutions. And solutions means if you have someone who you are paying to do a job and they are failing in doing that job and meeting those commitments or deadlines given to them, will you continue to hire them? 
will you continue to pay someone who is not doing the job that you have been paying them to do or they are failing in that position? Let's be real. It's not making somebody lose the work. It's about, I am paying you to do something. Are you doing what I am paying you to do? And if the answer is no, then we need to find someone who will do it effectively. This is what it's about. This is about finding solutions. Now, we ask him, what can we do? How come the Monday Night Forum is always on every news media? Everything they say on that Monday Night Forum, clippings are on every news media. It's not a press conference, but it's always used by every news media. So no press or media is there to ask questions of the things they say. But everything they stated runs as facts in the news. Not so. Social media is the, is the program of the day. So all political parties need to get involved. When Obama did his campaign, he utilized social media to raise funds because back then they had the whole issue of campaign financing. And he utilized social media and raised millions. Black Lives Matter using social media to raise millions. That is a whole topic altogether about what the money is being used for there. So the solution right in the face. So there's no question about what is the solutions when we have a problem of communications. If you can't see the solution, then you're failing in communicating. So then maybe we just need to get rid of you who failing in the communications. The solution is right there. It's not rocket science. All right. Some people Some still angry. Caller, you're live. Caller? 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 I hear myself echoing, Caller. We'll not come again. Asha, it's simply constructive criticism. That's what it is. Pay attention to yourself. Yeah, you're lapsing here. Pull up that socks. That's just what it is. Mr. Bego, a little correction there. CPEP does their best. You hear? CPEP does their best. So, eh uh eh. -uh. Uh -uh. CPEP does their best. It's so much you could do and no more. Yeah? So, don't say uh, CPEP take pattern from Tobago. CPEP does excellent work. Yeah. I sure it's not like people are, are against the party. People love the party. They love the government. But it's, it's like you have a child and the child doing and you're not correcting the child. The mere fact that they're talking out because they want to see things go right. As I say, if you have a child, you will, the child going, you're not um, scolding the child because you don't love the child and you just want the child to do the right thing, to go the right way. So I, I'm just hoping that the, these, these complaints and or they fall on the right ear and they get up and do something about it. Yeah? God Wall Street, this poor disadvantage, underprivileged. Stop labeling the people as that, na man. The day passed the good day. I remember that. Asha, good afternoon. All I will say is, PR is poor. That's all I will say. PR is poor. Asha. There is something called constructive criticism. That is not hate. That's not dislike. That is a medium used to improve persons or situations as the case may be. Yeah? How about your evening? In any establishment, any institution, support the support staff is the backbone when you're like in in i say in the service if you have a ministry and that supports those that support staff is not holding their end 
it make the the peers and everybody look bad so that support system is important it must be working properly call your life i shall good afternoon to you my dearie mommy my love how are you good good how are you good night i'm good i'm good thank you for asking I shall listen to some of your callers this afternoon, and I am asking question, Mister Tabaki. I want to tell you something. You really drink water in my own business. You are the P and M business. You concentrate on the UNC business, and I will tell you as long as Kamala is here, that is all the P and M business. I shall. You called some thing happened there this afternoon with some caller. I think you had it live. What happened to that person in Diego Martin? Some killing that took place uh-huh. and because of the killing the people are protesting because they said it, it appears to be a frame case what part of the government take place um on the main road closer to rich plain i think okay but well, seeing as is this aisha you know we have to leave that in the hands of the police am i right or wrong you understand yeah 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 you definitely have to have the lawyer and the police uh-huh. and everybody do their work Right, we can't say who was there, who see, you understand? So understood, perfectly listen. understood. You understand me? Because that falls under the, our constituency, so that's why I'm asking you that. So neither nobody, not even a member of parliament or the council, nobody cannot say absolutely nothing. i wait and see how it unfolds. Am I right or wrong? No, oh, mommy, you're absolutely right. I'm telling you that, you understand me, but I shall sure listen to some of your callers to speak up the area. I shall sure go Martin West. I could put my head on a block. I shall confess there to help out the member of parliament, okay? And if anything goes wrong, I shall in that they go Martin West. Whatever concert is, you have one one I could tell you how she goes out. I shall sometimes about two o'clock in the morning. She out on the street it is a quilla glass co. You hear what I'm telling you about? Look now before was had a problem then big yard I sure she was dead the hour she left. And tonight again she's getting again coming wrong from point commander there. It have a serious leak. And she's telling you that they go back out there. I sure hear the kind of hour she'll be out there. When she's supposed to be in her bed with the family, she goes out there. And I think that I need to tell the councils when you whatever community you are, you understand me? You are members of parliament. If you can expect a member of parliament, Aisha, because you know my member of parliament is Keith Christopher Rowley. And it's, it's, it's not only the prime minister for Carinage or only the Martin West, it's for the whole country. Right? And I think the, the councils and them need to show more appreciation, I know, and goes out there too and assist your community, I sure. You know, what I'm telling you about the need that, you understand me? But other than that, sweetheart, everything all right with you, right? Yes, mommy, I'm not complaining at all. Right, but I don't hear two of your callers. What have you put a ban on them? Which two? Bim and bam. Oh, Lord. No, no, no. They just call, man. They go call when they're ready. All right, Asha. Have a good one, darling. Thank you so much, mommy. So, people, I I don't know. I'm getting the feeling that a lot of people are, in fact, disenchanted to the extent that they are not waiting on us to address the situation. I'm saying this because I'm still observing some people addressing what they believe are their immediate concerns, irregardless to the fact that, as I said, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a work in progress. It's something we're moving towards. I'm still getting people calling in about their issues. Some people don't want to hear that. We're moving too late. We need to fire this one. We need to fire that one. Is it that bad or was I living with my head in the sand all the time? Because if we don't get this right now, we go end up like Tobago, you know. We will be going into an election doomed to fail. And I don't like to lose. So even though I came today with good news of the direction we intend to take as, you know, talk show hosts who support the party... That doesn't seem to be good enough to some persons. Is it that people have already made up their minds? And I want to say good afternoon to 
my friend on YouTube, which is Ambrose. Ambrose is in New York. Ambrose says, listening to the comments from listeners reminds me of the era and the end of Patrick Manning's political career. He was chastised by PNM supporters at Balize House. Politics, you need a stormy head. Is this the writing on the wall for what it is to come? Because Ambrose, I remember that, you know. I remember PNM supporters. 2010. I remember the mood and I remember the attitude. I remember they came out to Eddie Hard Grounds the day before election in their numbers as though it was the last supper before Judas betray Christ. It was the largest crowd I have ever seen so far in a political rally. It was in Eddie Hard Grounds the Sunday before election 2010. And while at that election, everybody was convinced we had it in the bag. I and all knocking glass. That time, Conrad and Ellis chairman, Martin Joseph, they are, we said, all right, they said, we win. We won. Eh, uh -huh. It was at 29.12 in Weasse. Up to now, we didn't see it coming. Is this the writing on the wall? I can only help but ask questions because I come here with all honesty and all sincerity with us to move forward and look for solutions and expecting persons to get in. And while they're coming in, they're making their contributions and we nation building and we're moving forward. But people are still stuck in their ways. They're not, they're not giving up. I could come and tell them what I want. Some people are still stuck in their ways. And I don't understand. So I am now <laughs> wondering what to do. Should we go ahead and fight? Knowing what is ahead, because from how it's looking, all you go have me out there and half all you ain't go be behind me. Have we given up? Are you ready for Anil Roberts and them to return to government? I don't know. If that is the case, then come out straight and say so. Come out and say so. Come out and say, well, go beat up. Let me try something else. And I would pull back. In my little zone and allow all it to live. You know me. But I don't like the mixed feelings. The mixed feelings is what have me a little uneasy. I tell you, I couldn't sleep after the show yesterday. Real talk. After that Tobago cut ass, I still very edgy. Because I did not see that 14 one. So now everything I'm looking at with a fine teeth comb. So after yesterday's program, I couldn't sleep. I had to be up on my phone with Sharon. Ting, ting. Lazy with Google. Ting, ting. You know? Only to have all you when I come today feeling so good. Yes, we come with a plan. This is what we're going to do. All you still hitting me for six and falling off her belly pain, eh? I am feeling as though I am getting cramps. I tell you all you all again my cramps right now. Not even headache, you know. Cramps. You know that feeling in your gut, in your stomach that is cringe. That's how all I am feeling. And I real confused. I didn't know things was that bad. Was it that I'm burying my head in the sand? I still confused all you. Help me out here. Help me out. Let's take some calls. Call her your life. Hello, I Good afternoon. Darling, you understand what I'm saying, or is it just me? i going off? No, I understand what you're saying, but what I'm saying is this. It, it's so amusing to know it's only when PNM in power, they have plenty complaints. When the last regime was in power, not a man talk. Nobody ain't seen nothing, they ain't seen or no road, they ain't seen the distance. Only when PNM in power, they have a problem. We 
we people, because there's a problem all, of, all of us, if I real penal, you never hear the people and them come out and say nothing about it. <laughs> the five years, three months, and how much days, they was comfortable with it. They show about the 18 seats. But I don't know what it is we really want. What it is we really want. Look, I live in an area here. The representative is in, in the house the street is a mess. You don't, even, you don't even come around here because it's a housing scheme. And you might tell yourself it's PNN people living in the housing scheme. Here. All right? So what it is, why it is, is only when PNM in power, everybody seeing all the problems. And when the other side in power, they ain't seeing nothing. Where all the money they have, we shouldn't have no problem with no road and water and all those things. 29, right? And all the big set of money they have. We shouldn't have no problem, none. Might have a little minor thing, you understand? Know, so what do they do with all the money? Why we people ask them what the people do with all the money? We should have no problem for road, water, nothing. But it's only when PNM and power they just see all the mistakes and the road one fixing and this one, this and the one, that and the one, that. Right? They know the easy. The people easy to keep our heads. Some of us heads. They ain't going to keep my heads. Because my vote ain't going for no UNC. I don't care what they say. Because I think it's just like how the other side does things. Drunk us over my neighbors. Right? They ain't leaving the people at all. They're so not we, going. They don't care what happening. The road could be caving in, falling apart. They're not going. going away. So I don't know why we can't pick up that same attitude. Uh, darling, listen. Wrong. If I tell you how I have a belly pain right now, you wouldn't believe you wrong to have a belly pain because you know why? You know that a bunch of, we, they used to teeth some of us head. Right? And we always see any mistake when PNM in power, but we'll see it when the UNC in power when the teeth and all the money. There are no problem, Aisha. You have a blessed afternoon. Thank you so much. I don't think all you understand the frame of mind I was in when we lost in 2010. Hello. In case all you forget, I will remind you. That time I am a mother of three small children. And I couldn't sit down home and take that election results that night. I mean, something about seeing that map turning yellow made me sick. I got into my vehicle, put my three small children in the back of the car, the youngest child being less than a year old. Only hear why you telling all you? Put him in the car seat, put the others in the booster seat, and I driving around the savannah listening to the results on the radio. And I just start to cry. This was 2010. Man, I start to study Mr. Manning, how he feeling. I start to study all kind of thing. I start to study what will happen now if they go close down gate. Listen. I don't think all you understand how traumatizing election results can be for people who want better for the country. I just walk in all you down memory lane for me. Some of all you may have had all your own experiences. Feel free to share. But when I see on election night a handful of people in Balize House and Mr. Manning had to take that platform by himself to concede defeat. And PNM people chasing him out of Balize house. I listen. I wasn't in a good frame of mind. Let me just put that put it that way. That is a frame of that is a memory that will stay with me for life. And I don't want to feel that way again. But I don't know. Some all you're frightening me. Some are all you're scaring the hell out of me. Call her your life. Mr. Wells, good afternoon to you. Hey, Kunji, where you come out? Well, I say, well, this is my program. Uh, when I listen to radio and evening, uh, I listen to the street 919, 919 and Aisha Wells program. When I do have time, I listen to Aisha Wells program. But um, I could tell you what you could use for the um, belly pain. Uh. If you bite up some young gova leaf. Uh, Look, see, you know, give me no belly pain, pain advice this hour but, day, please. But I say, well, we have a, a council in our area represent the People's National Movement. And I will give her 10 out of 10. I may not support the People's National Movement 100% right now, but I will give our councillor because it have times I work PH inside here, and I always see this girl on the ground. 
the road have a big hole in it, but she on the ground still. She explained it to us. She said, Mr. COP, funds be lacking, funds we can't fix the road and thing much. I can understand that. And and let me tell the councillors and them, you don't have to get nothing done but to show the people and them that you're outside there with them, you're, 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 sup, you're supporting them, you're still speaking on their behalf. That alone, the people them just really need, especially in the PNM areas and them, you know. That in the events here, yeah, then they want to talk and talk and talk and talk. Eh? They want action. But the people then need to see the people and them. And I can understand when some of the PNM, because this is not bashing the PNM. And when the PNM callers and them call the radio station and, 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 and express their concern, it's not about bashing the PNM. It's about letting the people and them know the problem the community have. And that is how the authority will get to understand, hey, we need to have problem over there. Is either we love the people and them and we take good care of them or we deny them. But bring out your voice and letting the people and them know that the, the ministers and them know that hey, there is problem in the community. That is democracy. And that is not chastising the PNM. That is not condemning the PNM. But Kunji, that is being I'm going to go real. for a break. Remember, 40 seconds. People, we're going to go for a break. We're going to come right back. I'm going to play some voice notes. I'm going to take some calls. We're going to enter the last half hour of the program. Don't forget, on Monday, we're heading to the Queen's Park Savannah as we bring in Carnival Monday in fine style. Bring out your teams. Bring out your entire crew. Yeah? We look forward to seeing you at the Queen's Park Savannah. Remember, male tickets, 250. Female tickets, 220. Get your tickets today. We'll be back. All I want is so tell me the party over or no. Expressed are not necessarily the views of the management of this street. 919 FM. Season 22. <laughs> Defend <laughs> We Culture. Celebrations in the country, oh no, no, no chance. The 24th of February, it's all about my concert and it's going down at Sun Forge. Make sure be there. Season 22, Defend We Culture at Sound Forge. We spirit must <laughs> live on. Season 22, <laughs> Defend We Culture. in the country oh no 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 chance the 24th of february it's all about my concert and it's going down at some forge make sure be there season 22 defend we culture at sound forge we spirit what <laughs> live on <laughs> Introducing the new and improved Digicel Plus Smart Home. Complete home control right from your phone. Enjoy amazing upgrades, new stylish design, and easier to install wireless cameras. Automatic home and away arming and disarming. One touch home automations. Easily integrate with Google, Alexa, Hello. or Apple. And full color night vision. Sign up now for 50% off installation and 20% off for six months. Get smart home now at digicelgroup.com. Digicel, better together. It's all about the fastest going reggae show in the land without a doubt. Right here on the street 919 FM. Each and every Sunday from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. With yours truly MC Duke alongside Selector Kochi. So make it a date and don't be late. Rock and come in, so line up, link up, creep up. You don't know reggae rock each and every Sunday. Salute, God, I'm our King Celestia. Mosh Gras 2022 from the creative mind of Davlin Thomas. Deja Vu Echoes of Carnival Coming presenting the finalists for the First Citizens Kings and Queens competition. 10 best of the best in Kaiso with guest performances including Bungie Garland, Nadia Batson, Iowa George, Lyrical, Swappy, Fama Nappy, Skinny Fabulous, Slacks, and much more. The magic happens on the big stage at Carnival City, Queens Park Savannah. 
Sunday, 27th at 7 p.m. Grandstand and Pod Posse tickets also available at NCC's head office and online at TicketGateway.com. For more information, contact the NCC at 622-1718. This event is supported by Digicel, Angostura, and TTT. Dimash Bra. Dimash Bra. Doctors Desmond and Angina Phillips present a series of healing retreats from February 27th to Sunday 6th March at the Eco Resort in Toko. This includes delicious healthy foods, refreshing healing drinks, learn DIY healing techniques, mini seminars and natural therapies. Price plans are for cost and full coverage excluding transport. Select plans one day from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. at $600. Monday, 28th February, Tuesday, 1st March, Wednesday, 2nd March, and Sunday, 6th March. One night, one day from 5 p.m. cost $1,100. Sunday, 27th February, Monday, 28th February, and Tuesday, 1st March, or two days, two nights from 5 p.m. That cost $2,100 Sunday 27th of February and Tuesday 1st March For more information, reservations and bookings call 336-5441 or visit the website at www.npathlimited.com for online bookings Enpath for love and healing Yes, yes, Trinidad and Tobago. A musical showdown of medium and large steel bands from around the country will take place on Saturday, 26 February from 5 p.m. Center stage at the Safe Zone Carnival City, Queens Park, Savannah. Pantry and Vago, in collaboration with the NCC, presents a pan event musical showdown in the big yard. Big yard. See NCC's website or call the NCC office at 622 for grandstand and park group ticket details. This event is supported by Digicel and Angostura. We say you wake up in the morning and you just realize Carnival come back again. All right, maybe that is not 100% true. But here it is. TSB at C. Sided alongside Iowa George presents Carnival Comeback. Carnival Monday the good again. This is Iowa George, the big boss of the business. Carnival Monday, the 28, 3 p.m. Queen's Park Savannah. Carnival Comeback. 3 p.m. Carnival Monday, Queen's Park Savannah. People, your brand going to be there live and live these years. We got it done. Shake it properly. People, you need vaccination on entry. Come out in your Monday wear. Come out with your team from 3 p.m. till. Get your female tickets started at $220. And male tickets at $250. With food inclusive. Get those tickets online at suntix.com. Also, book your cabanas. $2,000 for groups of nine with coolers and food inclusive. All this happening at the Queen's Park Savannah. Carnival. Carnival. Dr. Livet. Join him right here on your radio every Friday afternoon from 5.05 p.m. to 5.35 p.m. for your dose of the health and wellness in a program that is sure to change your life. Popular for promoting Livet rather than diet, Dr. Livet has transformed a number of lives nationwide and is now live on the street 919 FM every Friday from 5.05 p.m. Tune in and also learn about the U-Juice to build your immunities and promote overall great health. Dr. Levette on the street 919 FM this and every Friday from 5.05 p.m. to 5.35 p.m. It's time that you live. Join Pastor Kelvin Heinerein and friends for The Way, The Truth, The Life Radio Ministry, a Church of God ministry, live on the street 919 FM from 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. This and every Sunday on the street 919 FM. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh to the Father except through me. John chapter 14, verse 6. For further information, contact 6. 686-3845-349-5178 or 342-7303. 
Hi, what's up, TNT? This is Wayne Johnson out of Brooklyn, New York. I always wanted to do something back home, and we're going to be doing our gospel segment on Mondays from 10 p.m. to 12 midnight. That's 10 p.m. to 12 midnight on 91.9 FM. Listen what I want you to do. Spread the word. Spread the word, TNT. Salvation, full and free. Salvation. It's for everybody. Mondays from 10 p.m. to 12 midnight. That's 10 p.m. to 12 midnight on 91.9 FM. There's a new taste in town. Maracas Bake and Shark at 79 Robert Street in Woodbrook brings you bake and shark, kingfish, fries, shrimp, aloo pies, and delectable sauces to tease your taste buds. Walk in, order with food drop, or get parking lot pickup at 488 Bake or 75 Shark. Need catering? No problem. Call or email tastemaracas at gmail.com. Follow Taste Maracas on social media for all the delicious details. Taste Maracas, the new taste in town. Corner of Roberts and Rosalino Streets. See you soon. Trinidad and Tobago Mortgage Finance Company Limited wishes to advise customers making mortgage payments over the counter that the tellers at all our offices will be open daily from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. To make payments online, book appointments, request letters, statements, documents, and access other services, please visit our online customer service center at ttmf-mortgages.com. TTMF, from here to home. Shop at New City Mall and check out our premium selection of high-quality clothing and accessories for men and women. Save on all items with competitive prices and courteous services throughout the entire mall. New City Mall is located in the heart of Port of Spain with entrances at 3 Charlotte Street and number 41 Independence Square. We offer a variety of shirts, long and short sleeve, round and v-neck top. Vests, caps, hats, sunglasses, briefs, boxes, shorts, swim trunks, denim, jeans, long and three quarters, socks, sneakers, casual and athletic, shoes, dressy and fashionable, dresses, formal and casual, skirts, lingerie, undergarments and a wide range of accessories. Come check us out as we also have clothing and accessories like Levi's, Clarks, Armani Exchange, Hollister, American Eagle, Ralph Lauren, Nike Air Force and Air Max, Puma, Adidas, Timberland, Academics, Aeropostale, Old Navy, Forever 21, Haynes, Dockers, Guess, Converse and so much more. We have barbers, hair stylists as well as weave and wigs on sale all at new city mall like us on facebook and follow us on instagram sale 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 this is bishop aaron williams from the divine problem solving international ministries inviting you to be part of our broadcast on any given thursday night from 12 midnight right on to 5 a.m on friday morning and this broadcast is called early morning gospel market program then we have on tuesday from 12 noon to 1 p.m the holy ghost gospel pharmacy if you are sick and ailing you can get from this particular pharmacy from the pharmacist the good things of life hallelujah on any saturday from 10 a.m. to 12 noon. Break into the host of the Philistines. Hallelujah. If you are sick and tired of being sick and tired, hear in the Babel of false doctrines that you encounter daily. It's about time you get close to God. God's word direct from his throne room in the name of Jesus. God has good plans for his people. Why do you worry so much? Share the line. Share the line. The Street 919 FM on Facebook and Instagram. Share the line. Iowa George on Instagram. Share the line. Iowa TV and Street Street TV on YouTube. Share the line. The Street 919 FM. Thank you so much for staying with us, people. Thank you. All right, four minutes after the hour of six o'clock, I'm going to share with you guys a video of what happened today on the beat um, The fire that resulted in the death of a nine-year-old i'm also going to come back to the phone lines and to play some of your voice notes so in order to see this video you need to get onto youtube and on facebook and take a look at the beatum residence 
coming together to fight this deadly fire. Yeah, let me just open this up so you guys could see it. Mm -hmm. Let's go. All right, so check this out. Residents can be seen breaking a wall trying to gain entry to the house. Let me play it again. Let me show you guys another one of residents forming a bucket brigade in order to deal with this deadly fire. Hold on. And I have one more video to show you of firefighters when they actually got to the home. All right, hold on. Let me get this one. Hold on. Let me get the one with the firefighters on the scene. That would be this one. So again, condolences to the family and friends of the nine-year-old child that passed in this deadly fire. Let's get some voice notes on the inside. Let's go. I sure is good afternoon. In order for people to call in and find solutions, people must first understand the structure of governance. Our government is elected by the people. The government appoints ministers. Almost every MP has a constitutional office where they are paid money to support that office and staff to support the MP of the area. And all corporations have councillors who would see the burgesses to deal with issues. Nobody if you're realistic and understand politics, can't expect to see a government minister every time you have a pothole or a landslip in your backyard. It are plenty of people in this country who don't know nothing about politics but always want to talk about politics. The job of the minister and the government is to ensure that proper policies are drafted and laid in parliament so that proper policies are made so that people can live at a proper standard of living. They may not always get it right, but that is the duty. 
people in communities who have problems need to go see the counselor and if you have other egregious, you could go and see the MP via his office and the people in the office are there to help you because they are supporting the MP who may be a minister. The minister cannot come and see everybody every time you have a problem. That is not the function. Of course, if you say they should make a day once a month, once every three months to be in the office to meet people, all right, but they can't see everybody. They will never be able to see everybody. It is impossible, otherwise they will never get the business of the country done. People, come on, try all your, take up a constitution, read some laws, try to educate all yourself in all aspects of governance so you can know what good governance is so that when you want to complain, you're going to know how to complain, you're going to know where to go to complain, you're going to know what to do to help build your community, help build yourself and stop relying on our government to give you everything that you feel you need to live. That is not a government's job. Good evening. It's so sad that the child up to burn to death. But one thing with them, them beaten, um, People, and as like about them, they have a love and a togetherness and there's watch one another back. That is one thing with them. They had a kind of, they had a love with, within them, eh? for their neighbors and things. I'm sorry to hear about the child, it's sad. And a big child. Couldn't do nothing to the family. Sad. So sad. Almost every MP has a constitution. Be strong. I share this local election, you can see a lot of you, see people. In PNM stronghold um, corporations holding seat. What you remember telling that? Eh? People not going out to vote, and that's not going out. What chance? Sure, I hope. Take my stupid advice. Don't do embarrass yourself. I'm not telling you. I'll take a break. This is your Royal Castle Soca Shot on the street, 919 FM. What goes in is a local something that makes it all, that makes it all taste better. It's the flavor of our culture. Come from here, come from there, and everywhere. It's the special flavor that's made to savor at the Royal Castle. Oh, 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 the Royal Castle. Royal Castle. Flavor to the bone. Royal Castle. It's the very own. Royal Castle is the local something that makes it all taste better. Taste the unique flavor of our culture at Royal Castle. first restaurant in 1968 when that distinctive tempting aroma hit the air they just couldn't resist and like never before fried chicken with a special blend of local seasonings and a one-of-a-kind flavor down to the bone 
Today, Royal Castle still have that same delicious taste, and I love it too. The kids can't resist it either. Plus, they have more to enjoy. For me, the castle is more than just nice food. It's we own, part of me and you, and it's the real flavor of TNT. That was your Royal Castle Soaker Shot on the street, 919 FM, brought to you by Royal Castle. Our culture, our taste. Shellers, I hope, take my stupid advice. Don't, don't embarrass yourself. I'm not telling you. The, the atmosphere within the public servants have partners who's, who's a nurse, have an ex-partner who work. I have plenty of friends who work in the military. And I, can, I, I, can approach, I cannot approach none of them and speak about PRM in, in that circle. And then they speak about PRM, they just get vexed, some of them, they said, of course, some of them is walk inside, they only want to hear about PRM. I should take my advice, you see that local election, better leave it alone, or better let's take yourself and, and take a trip and, you know, visit America or some kind of thing. I don't want to hear that result, trust me. It's not that, the, I should, if they wanted to vote for you and see, they would have voted UNC. That is not the public. That is not the issue. You know. They just don't like UNC. But they prefer to withhold their votes because of the the issues that is um, plaguing at them, um, surrounding them at this point in time, and not being dealt with. So they just prefer to just withhold their votes and they say they're not even wasting their time. They ain't spending that extra money because PNM gave them that, that, that twenty dollars to go and vote and come back. Who had to go and vote? Who had to pay thirty dollars? They don't have extra thirty dollars. They not. They want a bus come by the house. Need that too. So let me get this straight. <laughs> all you withholding, all you vote for twenty and thirty dollars because you don't want to pay the passage to go and vote. The importance of voting should outweigh the fact that you are trying not to spend twenty and thirty dollars. Based on the government you bring in, policies they implement could either make your life better or worse. And you mean to tell me some people in this country willing to withhold their votes because they don't have the extra passage to get to the polling station? Well, then I think we need to talk about the importance of voting. It's just my humble opinion. As I say, I taking it easy in this hour. All in go give me a belly pain before I leave here. Not me. I keep saying, even if there is a problem in the area which cannot be fixed immediately, let your presence be felt. Let people know I am here for you, even if we can't fix the problem right away, whether you want to say we're working on it or it will take some time, but let your presence be felt. Yeah. Yeah. I turn up the fed till it's on over. I turn up the fed till it's on over. Boy, I just wanna get this feeling. Pulling. I shall listen to that call all day. Remember the UNC supporters, they don't vote on issues, you know. They just just vote. They just vote on tribal. So whether the UNC do for them or the UNC do for them, them do business, they will never complain. And when next five years, they're still going back and vote the UNC. But the African different, as you start a lapse, them looking to turn away from the PNM, but not with the UNC supporters. Them don't care, UNC don't have to do nothing for them, and they're still going back and vote them every five years. Showers, good afternoon. Now I show us, I am not a PNM, you know, and I am not a UNC. But if I see the PNM doing the right thing in the country, I definitely will give the PNM my support. But my partner Bataria for the last two days, he, he don't have a good phone. He explained to us that somebody picked up his phone somewhere and went with it. So I don't know if it's me too he picked up, but I'm me too in working for the last two days. So let me do something for Bataria now. Let me put out something for Bataria and get Bataria a proper phone. Because we know the PNM had the, the PNM people who are supposed to call them and give them a little honey for the truth for talking right you, they don't get them calls. But the supporters of 919, I'm sure we could put up something and give Batari a proper phone because he's been part of 919 family for a very long time. Although 
Although he called my basement man. But don't worry about that. Yeah. I first I first will be putting that that starting feed towards your, your brand new phone that will be working properly. Brooklyn, All right, partner? Brooklyn, you and the lander phones. What the hell is this? Brooklyn, you could walk to the corner store and pick up a phone for so cheap. Get Barataria a nice iPhone, man, and send it. Have a skybox. Let me know if you want it. Yes, I shall. It's ready for another rubber sand to come around this place. You are seeing me on that and a rubber sand there. Nothing I did this. Pick it, pee, and I shall. Wear. I shall wear. So I shall go with it too, you know. You know, nothing happened for the pee, and I'm good. Let me play your voice note again, eh, son, because you sound like a young. Yes, I shall. It's ready for another rubber sand to come around this place. You are seeing me on that and a rubber sand there. Nothing I did this. Pick it, pee, and then I shall wear. I shall have to let you go with it too, you know. You know nothing happened for the piano, them girl. So you ready to see your way, according to you, under Anil Roberts. And I take it what, live sport? Because nothing ain't happening under this wicked government. And I, Aisha Wells, is wicked for trying to convince you otherwise. Darling, doodoo pie, honey bird, I am sorry for trying to convince you to do better for your country and for yourself. Because apparently the $400 million that disappeared on the live sport does not matter to you. So I go pretend they don't matter to me. And you go ahead and see your way, just like how all it was in the Hilton. Hands up, hands out. Hands up, hands out for your $60 a day, partner. My bad, $66 a day. While those who perpetrated such programs walked away with millions, one man alone make $34 million and didn't give it back. But you telling me I wicked? Because you are seeing your way under them for $66 a day in life, but let me mind my business. It's really time for me to study my children. My child just joined the new Air Force. My child doing good, you know. Let me leave all in, all your mess. Eh? Call her your life. Hi, good evening, Aisha. Rowley Jr., you could beat this? Yeah, yeah. A lot of people feel that these are a, a blast in PNM forum or some kind of thing, you know. I might preamble and let him run it on a rubber because I should. I remember Dominic had a nice program in Sunday to one Africa because there's a difference. An organized PNM supporter, an organized PNM supporter, is one who understands the whole, you know, the whole the semblance of um, government and everything, and would vote. However, there's a culture among people who we have to persuade of African descent that PNM have to dig in a little bit more. But I'm not going to repeat that conversation today. Let me deal with my, my partner there. You see the gimmick since I watched a video. Well, woman, her, her floor seemed like it's well tiled. She got a hamper during the, 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 um, the pandemic. And she was critical of the oil, the this, the that. Those are not poor people. Those are not the people I'm talking about. Those are the people who are causing bad living in areas that we know have to always use the police to control. Because there are, there are African people out there, and I'm making it clear, who always want to live in communities and make it bad for others. Those are the people that PNM don't have to deal with. Because my thing is, and I, I talk about the culture of UNC supporters. UNC supporters, there's a whole difference in that culture where they, they understand, hey, there's an Indian leader, they are going to eat anything, but they just want an Indian leader. We are high at a higher level. We would watch and notice that, listen, we want a better leader. We want a leader to see from a national perspective. UNC supporters are care about that. That's why Kunji and Bill, no matter what, once she dress up in yellow, she could stay home, stand at one o'clock in her mind, I get an Indian leader. We are different. That's why Dr. Rowley, when he fell up at him, eh? that's why he put forward a legislative agenda. The UNC will never support it. And that fella who called there don't know that a legislative agenda that could bring more work to the local government body is what Kanas decided to support in the parliament. He will understand that because he from the, the gimme gimme gang. There's a difference between people who want help from the PNM and the gimme gimme gang. 
and it's a very difficult thing to dissect. So I know it's a challenge, but we still have to do the work. I'm sure the PNM remains the most formidable party, the most organized party. People don't like them because accountability is guaranteed. The people don't like that. You see that 400 million going from that water treatment plant? People forgetting that. They're forgetting that. And they, don't, don't, they don't know that money has to be paid back. So you see that, Father? He had business about that. And that's our problem in China. But like Andy said, I think even though, even though there nothing can be done, Aisha, they are developmental program, not so much with employment that we could see about, to have the conversation going on the importance of voting. But well, take care of your son, take care of your family. If Baratari, hey, we will support a brother again afford any day. If you want that support, he will get that. Definitely. But Wells, I'm telling you, African people who bow in for two dollars for Kanga Pasan, we can't stop them. But what we know is that enough African and PNM supporters and more right thinking citizens out there to keep the UNC at eighteen seats or even seventeen. We just have to do the work and get it organized. Enjoy your afternoon, Miguel, the evening, and take care of yourself and your son. The people in the PNM, the people in supervisory positions, yeah. positions of authority, they cannot sit down and wait for the prime minister to do it. They have to understand, just like how the people in the, in the positions in UNC know, so they have to make Indian millionaires. So they have to make African millionaires in the PNM. PNM have people, people in the PNM have to understand. All you have to give the people something. Listen to what Kamala and them do. They just come in the office. They will give one. one they, they'll give one, one, one of the PNM people our two hundred thousand dollars, a hundred thousand dollars, and they give their own people twenty million. So we get in take for small money. Because what is happening is when the PNMD, if you ain't do that and give it something, you have to do it. That is what it is. Yeah. I turn up the fed till it's an over. I turn up the fed till it's an over. The views expressed are not necessarily the views of the management of the street. 919 FM. Sister. Let me catch my breath on you. Me playing mad in real life, I'm tired. <laughs> Somebody say, yeah, yeah. <laughs> George, you are ready to see you. Only that way for the set up. Hold on. Hold in your stomach. A real belly, you know. And just sing. Sing from your heart, ding dong. Just sing. From the age of 10. Had my first girlfriend. I didn't have no paper when. She wanted ice cream from right from the bed. Later then. How much money you spent? It's too so so hard way again. She marking every cent. You see, I. Just too much girl in time. You see, I. All who play that you mark, never see a trumpet sign. Me say you wake up in the morning and you just realize Carnival come What are you doing? Who does that? Monday, yes, Carnival Monday, 3 p.m. Queens Park Savannah. People, you need vaccination of entry. Young brother, I'm gonna be there live in a live DJ to be coming to Shell it down. In other words, steam it up! Yeah! Who does that? You alone! Bones on it like a trampoline. You! Yeah, he's a benza. Shake it from my leg! Yeah. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, 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 y
Kiss TSB at T dot sided alongside I will George presents the Carnival Combat. Season 22. <laughs> Defend the culture. Thank God I'm free again. Oh. The 24th we come in to play. Oh. Song for you know is the place. So oh. chance tell me where you drink in. Oh. We drink in. Oh. It's all about chance. February 24th. Make sure I be yeah, because they don't know it's a so bad shell down a fear. Yeah, man, pretty sick. Season 22. Defend we culture at Soundforge. The spirit was live on! Looking for a safe and relaxed professional massage therapist and nutritionist? Look no further. Nature's Touch with Empress Judy and Associates offers a natural approach to better health. Treat yourself to a professional massage therapy and nutrition advice in a safe and relaxed atmosphere. Rejuvenate your body, mind and soul at Nature's Touch Therapy. For an appointment, please call or WhatsApp 1-866-398-8282. Or visit our Facebook page. Remember, your health is our responsibility at Nature's Touch. There's a new drink that's transforming what you expect from a beverage. U-Juice is 100% natural and has the power of red ginseng, turmeric, ginger, and the world's strongest antioxidant, astaxanthin. Your new favorite drink has arrived. U-Juice, en route to the ultimate you. U-Juice. Boost. Tune in to the Street 919 FM every Saturday from 7 p.m. to 8 p.m. to listen to the live Temple of Restoration, Pastor Curlin and the team. The Temple of Restoration is located at number 12 Endeavor Road, Shawanas, opposite the Curep Taxi Stand. For more information, contact 488-4413 or 777 8691 the Temple of Restoration, where Jesus changes lives. Tune into the street at 919 FM this and every Thursday for the program Conscious Talk. Conscious Talk. Where we are at and where we are going with Steve Antoine. As regards the land space for the celebration of Emancipation Day. Every Thursday from 1025 a.m. to 1055 a.m. It's Conscious Talk on the street 919 FM. This is the voice of Tuesday, Seventh-day Adventist. We are preaching emergency alert broadcast, which is from the Tuesday, Seventh-day Adventist Church. We will be featuring voices of brethren from different parts of the world, preaching the gospel, preaching prophecy as it relates to current events and the ending of the world. Listen to us on 91.9 FM every Sunday from 9.15 to 9.45 AM on Sundays. May God bless you as you learn the truth. In Jesus' name, Amen. If you're experiencing pain, constipation, headaches, poor blood circulation, high or low blood pressure, diabetes, cancer, swollen or darkened feet, come visit us at Health and Wealth Lifestyle, located at 73 Eastern Main Road, Barataria, opposite Eastern Credit Union. We at Health and Wealth Lifestyle offer a wide range of services. Come and experience our new 3D analyzer, which allows you to have a look inside your body. We also provide live blood analysis, iridology, ionic foot detox with foot soap and foot massage, aqua therapy, full body massage and organic supplements on sale such as nano silver, nano zinc, body light, cold pressed sesame oil and more. Health and Wealth Lifestyle located at number 73 Eastern Main Road Barataria opposite Eastern Credit Union. For more information call 275-8359 or 288-1108. Join Nicole Huggins. 
slogans for health and wealth lifestyle every Monday from 9.05 a.m. to 9.55 a.m. right here on the street, 919 FM. Better vision for your physical eyes and through the eyes of faith, let healing arise in your mind, body, and spirit. At Natural Healing Ministries, we teach kingdom principles for living that brings the blessing of God to your mind, body, and soul. NHM Professional Associates are located at number 10 Moody Stewart Street, Monrepos, San Fernando. For more info, contact Dr. Desmond Phillip at NHM on 349-3494. NHM Professional Associates can be heard live on the street 919 FM every Saturday from 9.05 to 9.55 a.m. Pastor Hannah A. Pabu of Holy Spirit Ministries will be live on the street 919 FM every Wednesday from 11.15 a.m. to 11.45 a.m. In the scripture, Matthew 19, verse 26, the Bible says, But Jesus looked at them and said to them, With men, this is impossible, but with God, all things are possible. Pastor Hannah is here to motivate you, challenge you, encourage you to walk in your purpose and destiny God has for you. For prayer and counseling call, Pastor Hannah at 728-5197. This is Bishop Aaron Williams from the Divine Problem Solving International Ministries inviting you to be part of our broadcast on any given Thursday night from 12 midnight right on to 5 a.m. on Friday morning. And this broadcast is called Early Morning Gospel Market Program. Then we have on Tuesday from 12 noon to 1 p.m. the Holy Ghost Gospel Pharmacy. If you are sick and ill and you can get from this particular pharmacy from the pharmacist the good things of life. Hallelujah. And any Saturday from 10 a.m. to 12 noon break into the host of the Philistines. Hallelujah. If you are sick and tired of being sick and tired here in the Babel of false doctrines that you encounter daily. It's about time you get close to God. God's word direct from his throne room in the name of Jesus. God has good plans for his people. Why do you worry so much? Turn your lights down low and listen to the master's radio. The Church of the Firstborn Assembly of Numbers 399 Eastern Main Road, Waiko Sangri Grandi, is pleased to present Pastors Morris and Agnes Johnson and guest. Sundays, Tuesdays and Friday night, Sunday Ministry of Worship, Children Hour and the Word from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. Tuesdays, see Jesus in every book of the Bible from Genesis to Revelation. Tuesday morning from 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. And Friday night, 9 p.m. to 5 a.m. All night prayer for our nation. Tell your neighbors, tell your friends, tell everyone. For further information, visit with us at www.churchofthefirstbornassembly.com or on Facebook. Email us at church668hope at gmail.com or call us at 753-1113 or 236-7271. Your free gifts and offerings will be greatly appreciated at Church of the Firstborn Assembly, account number 795222 at the First Citizens Bank. Get in touch with God. Share the line. Share the line. The Street 919 FM on Facebook and Instagram. Share the line. Iowa George on Instagram. Share the line. Iowa TV and Street Street TV on YouTube. Share the line. The Street 919 FM. All right, we are back. We're running out of time. Let me see if I can get some more voice notes and phone calls in. We'll start with the phone calls. Call A Live. Oh, my. Thank you, my dear. Thank you. How are you? I'm good, Queen. Thank you for calling. Listen, um, when when we became like this, what, what it has happened, you're supposed to go out there and do your civic duty for your country and cast your vote. But you said PNMA will give back that $20. I mean, when everything must be handed to us, my father had to provide transport down to my shoelacing, books, everything. He didn't have no school grant. And I had to work with my sandwich or else I wasn't eating. He didn't have no book grants. 
We didn't have no food po- feeding program. And yet we are there shouting at the rooftop that they did nothing. When we came like this, I sure don't let this thing get to you, eh? because sometimes I myself even wonder if there's some kind of a tag team game that is played between parties. I, I, I'm, I'm being honest with you, because politicians are politicians, and they all belong to the same club. So whomever come in there, they are going to do what they're supposed to do and to run the country. They won't get no extra special prize of anything. But one thing we know for sure, we see the class and the caliber of people. We see things in people that we never see before with every administration, every time they come into power. You see greed. You see stealing and mismanagement taken to a total new level. It started with Pandey when it went on and on. That is what you see in the country whenever there's the unopposing side that, 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 that is run in the country. You see things that you don't see before. This, this is, is, is becoming, I, I simply can't understand it. Everything is gimme, gimme, you know, in, in, in the sense that you have to get up and get and make, create with your mind first. When I hear African talk, people talking about this UNC, I say, what? That's ignorance. Because if you understand the, 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 the principles that govern that party, you cannot, as an African, go and jump up and say, well, I am one of you all. It is not accepted. I heard a caller say that they always try to appease the East Indians, but it will never happen. This man came on on the radio with two African talk show hosts and talking about Kamala raised the, the what? The, 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 the um, oh gosh, the pension. Kamala raised pension by $55. Kamala put a helicopter place on top of her house. Kamala and her whole balacoonies have money like it's... It, they, they endeavored to empty the treasury. And I didn't hear not one of these talk, talk shows will say, but listen... They raise all these people. That, and, and this is not the first time I hear him with this crap, you know, always talking about Kamala raise all these people that, as if that is something compared to what they are doing. Don't let it get to you, my child. Whomever is there, they have to do one thing, govern the country. They will steal, they will plunder, they will rape, and we are going to see exactly who they are. And they would never get enough because when money and possessions is your God, you could never get enough. There's an insatiable appetite for more and more and more. So don't let it get to you. And whomever there, they have to stay a, a, a length of time, and then they are going to go just as well. So we just have to stand firm and, and stand strong. African people, well, I always hear um, Baratara saying, wake up, open your eyes. Uh, please do, do that, eh? Thank you all so much. Aisha, good evening. You could say what about PNM? I go vote PNM for spite, just to keep the UNC out of power. I believe that. Yeah, Aisha, the roof in the UNC no come across now, girl. You know the PNM don't like you, give it with us for girl. Come across to the UNC, you go, you do good across here. Come across, the yeah, roof here, come across. I real good. You stay right where you is. I good here. Do it now. That caller just insult the uh, airwave there, boy. How you can call that man name, boy, on the airwave, boy? Boy, you have no shame, boy. You see that shameless naughty dog, in a way. You call that man name, boy? That is the worst thing you can do if I put that man back in, in, in their party. I'm, I keep asking people the same question over it, but you know you try to get people angry here, you know. I keep... Good evening, Aisha. Um, the supporters of the PNM continue to propagate the idea that the UNC uh, wins these seats over and over and over again because of tribal voting. But when you listen to them, the same PNM people talk on various radio programs. 
they express the greatest fears that if a black man is not in power or the African party or the PNM, that they wouldn't be comfortable at all. You hear it all the time. Most of talk radio is not Indian talk radio. So a uh, talk radio fan like myself, I hear them all the time. I'll tell you what goes on with the Indian voting. Eh? Um, yes, there is a high degree of tribal voting, just like with the African voting. The, the thing is that we are satisfied that our party gives us the guidance we need to take us forward. Now, they don't have to give us all that, that much. Eh? Once they give us the basics, remember our culture and our uh, family structures and, and our communities and so on have not been decimated. So we have that natural strength above you know people who have suffered calamities on those fronts so we just need the basics like we need to get water and we need to get roads and we need to get fair opportunities for education and when there are jobs and we apply you know we want you know go, let the thing have some merit in it scholarships and and those things and um we'll find our way and that's why so many people open businesses uh, they they just have that sense of purpose. That's Miss Wells. Every government is a servant for the people. Like like every prophet who a servant, every every prophet from God is a servant for of God. You understand? And every prophet who here, you know what it comes to the, the, the two most important things they come to see the the come to, to teach about is love and justice. You know why? Because God is love and God is just. You understand? And if we don't have love and justice in, in a society, we will crash, we will, we will break down. You understand? And if we don't have... Thank you so much. Call your life. Hi, Shavel. It's a pleasant good afternoon to you. Hi, how are you? How are you doing this one time? I am excellent, I Shavel. I saw us, what is the occasion in the African outfit? No, I just decided to wear it today. Okay, okay. That is, um, it, it have, it have um, emancipation, pre-emancipation celebration. You know, I'm a proud African Wall Street. Oh, 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 yeah, I'm a, I'm a proud African too as well. But, but I saw us, I hear somebody calling the radio station and saying how Something with I'm paraphrasing here. It seemed like if black people only want handouts from the PNM. When Faris Alwari gets twenty something million dollars a year from the government of Trinidad and Tobago, what is that considered a hand up? That is a hand up. When the other when Stuart Young family right gets all them different contracts for NCB Global from the PNM government, what is that considered? That is a hand out or a hand up. Right? When the people in Chumaka Clavantil didn't ask for no hand out for the buildings to be demolished, right? Or to be renovated. That is not a hand out. That is thing in the community that needs to be done. When three buildings cannot be painted, I shall wells. For ten years under the PM. Is that is that would that money be going in somebody's pocket? That is a hand out. When the Lavantil to Washington Empowerment Center could be on Duncan Street, for them same people who you're saying want handout, and the blackest man in Trinidad and Tobago, his words, not mine, Dr. Keith Christopher Rowley said, no, nothing for all you. All you have to take a pool, all you get in a pool, all you go go drink water, take bamboo, and mine all your business. Aisha Wells, where's the economic development, economic empowerment? economic inclusion and access to capital for black people and black businesses in Trinidad and Tobago. How I don't hear all the people calling about that, Aisha Wells? Why not? Eh, Aisha Wells? Why not, Aisha Wells? It is sad, Aisha Wells. Sad, 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 sad. Nobody in telling the PNM to give them handouts. Them people in Chumaka Club, they don't want to hand out from the PNM. Them people in Beatum don't want to hand out from the PNM. Wall Street, my calm down has started. 
Yeah, yeah, I know, I know it started, but I said, well, you have a fantabulous, splendiferous, marvelous, tremendous, splendacular rest of the day, I said, well, bye-bye. Thank you so much, Wall Street. Let's see if we could clean up and take about one more so before we go. I, my comment has started, Cola. I sir. Yes? Well, who dropped that man? God, boy, stick him for the man. God, boy, he did not set with the luck. God. Thank you, Jamma. Jamma, I don't want you with an upset stomach at all, at all, at all. Let's see who's there. Hold on. Caller, you're live. Caller, talk quickly. We just have a minute. All right. No, you're breaking up very badly. Wall Street, you damn nuisance. Yes, a nuisance, you lunatic. Aisha, where's well, good day? Aisha, it's a couple days I'm calling on a program. And because of that guy who talking there, Wall Street, he sickens me. That is why I had to turn my station and go to our next station. When I know he's not on the, when I realize that it, um, that he finished talk, then I will switch, switch back to you. Wall Street people tired of you, man. What really going on, Wall Street? People are fed up of you. What you're telling yourself? All right, let me see if I can take this quickly. Caller, just a minute to go. Yeah, Aisha, I will deal with Wall Street to, to understand that all the offers with respect to HDC houses, opportunities for African people to build themselves, must be parallel to what Paris al Rawi and this nonsense you have that some, something that is legal and approved already, that you're going to put that in the context of handout. So, Afri- you see what Mr. Pinal said? So, the only difference with Mr. Pinal, Mr. Pinal so disingenuous, he went to Trinidad and Tobago offered. For the UNC, but what Mr. Pinal said is that they got they use the basics, the offers, and they build themselves. That's what you want you all to do. Why should they want them to do that? You want them to mine all the African people and all the offers remain there. Yes, you're crazy. I shall continue with that tomorrow, please. God, thank that, you so much. And they were, we'll talk about that. Thank you so much. So, people, I have to go. I have 30 seconds. Let me leave it here. As I usually say, TNT, do a good deed tomorrow. When we come with something else, something new, something hot on the official station that defends the nation, the Street 919 FM. Have a good one. Yeah. I turn up the fed till it's on over. I turn up the fed till it's on over. Boy, I just want to get this feeling all day. I just want to drink and party all day. expressed are not necessarily the views of the management of the street 919 fm everybody right now put your right hands in here put your right hands in here we have a-